Uh, so we're back. We got uh, Carfam and I don't know who the Krom is. I don't recognize them. Um, Zero Suit and Krom on PS2. Everything's on PS2. PS2 all night. Uh, some brilliant neutral here. You, <laughs> I love ultimate neutral. <laughs> They're just landing aerials on each other. I'll pull up Yeah, it looks like this is... Harfam and Zanakin Highwalker. <laughs> That's where they're at. Nice. Okay, and we are in winners. This is winners round four, I believe. Carfam with an early lead. Winners round three, sorry. Winners round three, still early in bracket. Uh, Harfam with a nice early lead here. Really, really keeping Krom out, which is, uh, Zero Suit's very good at just dashing in and out, you know, uh, being really tricky with that movement. And you can see, uh, Zanakin is having a hard time finding the, uh, uh switch the Ooh, big up B, not quite gonna kill. Because Sanigan is having a really hard time just finding the chances to get that sword on Carfan. Just, you know, one second out of sword range, the next second they're in too close to where their fists beat out your sword. Especially moves like that Zare. It makes it really hard to deal with, uh, deal with getting your sword on, in on Carfan. And rolls out of the corner, able to escape the ledge. Which is a really terrifying place to be against Krom, but between... Uh, Zero Suit's just fast movement and Flip Kick especially, not really having any trouble there. Both characters just whiffing those crabs. I don't even know why they're doing it. Neither of them have kill throws. They just really want to grab each other. Ooh, the, no super armor there. Which, Ooh, parries but not getting a punish as Carfam. That frame one jab we all know and love. God. <laughs> It interrupts anything that Zanagan was throwing out. Off stage is Krom. Gets the Zare. Not quite going to do it. Able to hold on to this life just a little bit longer. Falls to that side B just as quickly. Down a whole stock, but not out yet. Does Krom not have armor on his uppie? I thought he did. But we have seen it get stuffed out like two or three times. So I guess he probably doesn't. And I am wrong. I'm thinking of like... Finally, uppie connects. Uppie out of shield is a very Krom thing to do, but... Very risky. Puts you in a very bad place if it whiffs, and he has whiffed it a lot. Uh, so I'm, I think the, uh, being more careful and precise with how that gets thrown out would help Zanakin out a lot in the rest of this set. We'll see how that ends up going. Just, just Carfam just jumping in and out. So hard to just get your hands on. That throw looked really weird. I don't know how that grabbed, but... Uh, is he even jump? Is he dead? Oh, man. There's the armor I thought of. Okay, I guess it's after he starts rising. Uh, definitely Carfam getting a little hungry on that. Let's hope it does. Oh, my. Yeah, yeah. Well done to Zanakin. Bringing that ba game back. What a comeback. What a comeback with Zanakin. Yeah. So, that is a thing that Krom can do. And, yeah. I don't really have much to say. He just kind of cannot be like that, and you steal socks at zero. And uh, hate to see it. Hate to be on the receiving end of that, but I know I saw Zanakin pop off when that hit, and uh, yeah, he's up 1-0. Carfam's got to watch out if he doesn't want to get into losers. He's got to just you know one mistake against character explosive characters like Krom can mean the stock. And in, in situations like that, and also just other more like normal kills. Krom is just so terrifying that if uh, you make one wrong move, it might take your whole stock. Which is why you really gotta, it's really a test of mental game and, and patience when you play against uh, explosive high damage characters because you just cannot make mistakes. Uh, our fan was up the entire game until threw away his stock with a down air and then got greedy at a ledge strap and that was it. So this game, I'm gonna see if he's hopefully I'm going to try to be a bit more patient. 
And uh, we'll see if Xana can, can match that. Uh, already, Carfam still succeeding in his uh, zero suit game plan of just being annoying and running around. Yo, hey, I'm, sock? Yo, oh. I'm digging this freaking uh, tag. Yo, Anakin Highwalker? Xanakin, I think. Uh, Xanakin? I don't know how to say that. Say that, it's, it's pretty sick, though, and he's up a game. Oh, really? Really? Yeah, it was actually a crazy ending. See, Carfam down aired off stage and missed, and then <laughs> immediately got hit by Krom Suicide Uppy. And oh, the ledge. my God. <laughs> yeah, like within like 10 seconds of each other. He was, he was winning the entire game and then just threw his stocks away. Oh, my God. Uh, but he's being a lot more careful this game. He's up. Two stocks, almost. Two entire stocks. I'm about to say, what if he, like, pulled a little bit back and, like, spoke him off stage? Because yeah. he can kind of, kind of do that. <laughs> That's kind of funny. All right, all right, all right. Gosh, yeah. This crown pressure, I'm, like, I'm digging it right here. I was just saying that, like, car fans got to be careful because, like, one mistake against Prom can cost you the game. Yeah, but okay. I think Carfram is looking pretty comfortable right now. Don't you think? He is. He is. Yeah. But this is also where he was looking last game and oh. he lost. <laughs> oh, he was like two, up two stocks to get two stocks to one? Something like that. Oh, it, it, he was up a lot. and uh, Bro, oh, please. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Bro, yeah, yeah. please. <laughs> I know Carfam tensed up a little bit with that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, oh, we that's going to be it. Up we out of here. Takes it. Carfam tying it up 1-1. One, one. Uh, Zanakin's really gotta gotta switch things up here for this game three. Uh -huh. Something's something's not working, and I know, like I was saying, that's a very oh it's a very oh it's Z boss. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh okay. This I think this is like the probably the second time I've seen him in person, so like I wasn't really sure what he looked like, but now I'm confirmed. This is the man. <laughs> we calling him Z boss, or are we gonna stick with Zanakin Highwalker? Um, Zanakin Highwalker <laughs> is the better name. Zanakin Highwalker is a phenomenal name. Uh, Zanigan. <laughs> really struggling against the Zero Suit just because of how fast Zero Suit is and how mobile they're able to dodge in and out of sword range and just uh -huh. fly around, hit you with those really quick moves. And every time they, every time there's a situation, uh -huh. frame one jab just stuffs out everything Zanigan's trying to do. Uh, keeps happening. I want to see if uh, they can find a way around okay. it. Okay, this has happened. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, Sweet. that situation has happened twice where like um. Where Carfriend would the uh, ooh nice back air. Well, Carfriend would uh, there onto uh, 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 Zanakin's shield, and Zanakin try to uh, try to uh, draw a punch right away, but he always got stuffed by ooh. It's happened a lot more than twice. You just yeah. got here late. Oh really? <laughs> it has happened like oh really? Like oh, almost every time he's airs okay. or does something like a landing aerial on his shield, he just matches Jeff. Yeah, a lot. Yeah, a lot of people don't understand. Like yeah. Uh, Vivu is one of the few characters that has a really fast jab, so she can jab her after doing an aerial. Even when she's minus, she's not, because <laughs> her move is, like, five times faster than yours. Ooh. Every time I hear that spike noise, oh, <laughs> I, just, I just assume someone's dead. I'm like, please. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Out of here. Getting real hungry for those grabs on that platform. I don't know why. Oh, oh again. Missed attack. Missed attack into a back air. Carfam's up an entire stock. But it's obviously not over because okay. that move exists. Uh, another one. Just keep popping it, man. Ooh, B reverse, wave, whatever they call it. Wave bounce? Wave, wave bounce. Yeah, wave bounce. Nice. It looks nice. Yeah. Big up air combo. Uh, not quite, yep. And a tricky landing with the side B. I like it. Yeah. I thought that was a, I thought that yeah. was a flip kick. Yeah, same. But like, I guess he wasn't ready to confirm it. Yeah, or just the wrong oh. sense or something. One. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. One wrong move at this ledge could mean the stock, but zero suit. So hard to pin down in the corner uh, yeah. between that flip kick and just general air speed. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah. Reads the roll away, and that's yeah. going to do it. Yeah. Our fan winning 2-1 over Zanakin. But don't worry, Zanakin Highwalker fans in chat. That is winners, so we will see them. Again in losers or the fight you know the funny thing is is like uh um the Zanakin's opponent before his uh was uh Dragoon and, mm -hmm. and like and then I was thinking about like if Dragoon won this match, he would not want to fight Zeus. So <laughs> yeah, that's not fun. <laughs> oh my goodness. I was gonna have a hard day. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Belmont. Zero uh, suit running all the way around the screen while you're just <laughs> uh, oh my god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I feel like Belmont doesn't really have fun with many matchups, but when he does, he has a lot of fun. Oh my god. When you get a slow character on screen, he's, he's sitting there licking his lips. 
Okay, so okay, this is a match that I was here to commentate. One All right. Okay, we I'll got it a Heath versus Chess. Both of my boys. You know, a Heath with the Yoshi. Oh, is and that? Well, hey, yo, go on, Yoshi turn on to the player cam. Yo, yo, the yo we need Yoshi to see this. Plushie? There it is, yo, the, Yoshi. the Yoshi plushie. <laughs> yo. I love the Heath, man. Yo. Oh, he's the luck. protagonist of Minnesota Smash. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, so we got Heath with the Yoshi and Chess with the Min Min. Min Min slash uh, Steve. <laughs> Which one do you think we're going to see here against Yoshi? Against Yoshi? I feel like we're going to get... Gosh, I don't know, actually. Because I at uh, first I was going to say, like, I think we're going to get uh, Min Min. But, like, with uh, Yoshi's air drift or whatnot, I don't know. Like, Yoshi doesn't have too much of a bad time trying to get in on Min Min with the air drift that he has. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, it is, it is definitely either or. But also, Steve is kind of suspect, too. I feel, I my prediction is it's going to be Min Min. Min Min game one, if Min Min goes completely trash, he's going to go Steve. But, yeah, again, yeah. the Steve, yeah, because uh, he's just capable of being Maya. So, and, like... No disrespect to my boy's chest. His Steve, his Steve is also great. It's definitely, it's definitely the best yeah. Steve in the, in the, in the I think I think yeah. he's can beat anyone here oh, personally. Yeah. Oh, I think yeah. I think he's uh, you know he doesn't always win, but like he has those sets sometimes where you just watch him and you go like, man, how is this guy not <laughs> just like <laughs> winning everything? <laughs> he has those moments where he just he's just so uh, dominant. Uh, oh yeah. And we are gonna see the Min Min out first. Oh uh, okay, we got. Uh, oh, and Chester we're showing us. Hey, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> yep, there we go. Oh, you got you big know, big damage chest versus Ahis. Okay, taking their times. Just just feeling each other out a bit. He's oh, yeah. taking advantage of that jump button that Min Min doesn't like. And once again, shout out to Ahis, always picking the same color as his opponent. Dude, I, <laughs> people don't talk about that. I love that part about him. Every time we go to select characters, he just like looks me in the eyes and waits for me to select a character and choose the same color. And I think it's so funny. Well, the up smash reflector coming out oh, for yeah. Chess. We are, we are taking his time. Yeah. Chess wants nothing to no, do with that Yoshi. Taking no chances. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Uh -oh. <laughs> See, because this is what happens, you know. You kind of let your guard down for one second, and Yoshi gets oh, in, and you die God. for it. You, you, he's got oh, in twice. God. He's one neutral twice. Yeah, that slow start, yeah, I, like, I want nothing to do with this Yoshi. Yeah. Oh, period. Like, it, it looked like they were, like, just kind of camping each other out, but he's just really just, like, taking notes, trying to figure out the way in. And he got it. Yeah. And now we're going to play this game again. Yeah, he's like, just winning. He doesn't yeah, care. Yeah, Ch Chess is a very patient player. He's kind of, he, he is definitely the kind of person that will camp you when he's down. Because he because he assumes that your ADHD will kick in and you're just going to run into his stuff. Dude, camping is so hard. <laughs> like, not like physic like just physically holding away from your opponent uh -huh. for that long is hard. Oh, Ooh. oh, what the, the magnet right there. hands for Yoshi. <laughs> Yoshi's oh, double yeah. dunk. Oh, oh, my. Yeah. oh, man. Oh, my God, the double dunk. <laughs> if you get hit by that twice in one game, you uh, get spiked, you just set the controller down. You uh, say, okay, God. good game, man. <laughs> uh, he's with a... Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. He, he that, lost the stock, but, like, still a comfortable lead here. And I it looks like, looks like he's starting. He's He's got uh, this min min down. Uh-oh. Chess is going to have to start. Oh. Yeah, tech chase. Nice. Oh, yeah. no jump. He has a jump. Uh -oh. He landed, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. That, that back air. Just barely missed. Oh, yeah. I keep on forgetting. It's like, uh, Min Min can't do the Dragon Blast if she does a tilt. So you don't have to worry about that. But definitely can do the tilt in the aerial. Yeah, but her tilts look the same as her smash. Yeah. <laughs> it just has, like, a couple frames more startup. All of her moves look the same. That's the, the only thing you think about Min Min for me, yeah. is I can never really tell what's happening. Right. It looks like it's all just F smash. Oh. Does he have a jump? He does. Yeah, he holds on to his jump, because that's kind of what he needs to live. Ah. Big up smash. Nice up smash by Chess right there. And yep. just like that, uh, I said that Chess needed to figure something out, and it looks like he did, because he has not gotten in in a long time. Uh. He's not really landed a hit in a while. Yeah. Yeah, the keyboard game is real. And like, I like how Chess is like, not even doing a, a lot of arm for a lot of times. He's like, I'm waiting for you to do something. <laughs> yeah, he yeah. almost doesn't need to because uh, he's just playing in that perfect range anyway. He's, or he's Chess is playing in that range where uh, he can't really touch him. He's going to have to commit to something big, you know, right. like, like a jump or like a some sort of run in. 
to even be close to hitting him. And he just takes that stock right there. 65 to 0. Chess takes his time on the platform. Oh, gosh. And I he's see. no jump? Oh, yeah, yeah, you have jump. Yeah, I'm smart. See, this is why he's the better player. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Always assume that he has his two, jump. Two, three, four. Oh. Okay, back to neutral. So I definitely see what you mean about Chess being <laughs> the most patient player here. He has not held forward <laughs> once this whole game. Look at this. They're just standing on our platforms, not pressing any buttons. That's hard to do. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's yeah. hard to be in a setting, in a tournament setting like this, and just not do anything. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh he's in though. Uh -oh. Oh. 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 Grab missed by pixels. Got the, got the roll away. But remember how many neutral interactions that he's won that first dog. He only won had to win two, and he's won one already. He's halfway there. Gosh. We're just going to be playing this game and keep away for the rest of the yeah. match, it looks like. And just making this as hard as possible. <laughs> oh, Dragon call Blast. That's it. Ca That's calling good. out the, the egg. Yeah, that was smart right there. Calling out the egg throw with a with an S match. Yeah, and that's why Chess wasn't pressing buttons at all. He was just kind of sitting there waiting because he knew that Ace was going to commit to something, and when he did, that's when he can find the F smash. Mm. All right, I'm going to hop off this for a second. I need to talk to someone. All right. All of you, Lomomo. Okay, it is just me, baby. All right. But yeah, Chess taking game one on PS2. Let's see what stages we're going to. It's a damn. Oh, I just checked the rule set, and we actually have Yoshi's story on here. Okay. But Yohisu is not going to take go to Yoshi's story. We are going to Battlefield. Yeah, it looks. I, I feel like uh, he's is going to want to opt for more high, uh, more conversions on uh, on platforms and whatnot. Yeah, Okay, going, going with the targets. Okay, have the slow start. Yeah, and uh, uh, just staying underneath the platforms. Not committing anything. Making it very hard to approach the zoners on the underneath the platforms. Oh. Okay, here we go. I wonder if it, like he will like start catching up. Like the, once, once uh, Chess sets out the the second arm, that's his opportunity to actually run in. There you go. Mm. It's pretty interesting to see. Just like you all were talking, a really patient player. Oh yeah. Mm. Here in Chess, like he just he'll wait <laughs> and then he'll hit you. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I feel, oh, is that, is that his jump? Oh, no, it still has here. And, like, I think he needs to realize, when, especially when regards to, like, fighting Min, Min Yeah. like, you will have, like, a bigger... Oh. No, it's all good. Keep going. You have, a, like, a bigger opening to actually get in once uh, Min Min throws her second arm or something like that. Like, once... And that's why, like, uh, and Jess kind of knows this, and that's why he's, like, being very reserved with his arms. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. And yeah, every time that you are throwing out a move, you can't like throw out a different move. So, yep. Uh, a big thing to, uh, uh. to that's really hard to do is to not attack, which sounds counterintuitive, but uh -huh. not pressing buttons is a lot of the times the right play. Right. right but it's hard right. to do that because you want to attack. Oh, oh big okay. forward air for me. Yeah, long stock, but it, he's ends up taking the first stock. Uh, and but, can't hold on yeah, to it very long. Yep. <laughs> Even game. Oh, yeah, uh, like, thirsty F smash in neutral. <laughs> uh, he uh, he saw small shield must hit. <laughs> he just loves F smash. He loves Yoshi's big nose. He goes for F smash and forward air all the time. Oh my god! Look at this. Look at this neutral. Hold on, Perry. Okay, we in? No, not quite. Glancing blow. But yeah. Are we in? We in, boys. Oh, not quite. Oh, uh, jab just barely missed. Okay. One. There it is. Chest hasn't it. really uh, hasn't really been able to find his footing here in a while. Isn't really uh, taking any huge combos. Just sort of this extended disadvantage. Uh, not quite. 
finally finds his footing back on stage. Ah, Almost takes the stock. That way. In. You know this uh, this megawatt is out because if it if it so much as touches Yoshi at all, it's gonna kill him. Right. Oh my uh, God. As, as soon as I say that, I am a liar. Uh, okay. Next time. Oh. oh. <laughs> you wind that air direct on air yeah. hard right there. There it is. A, he's losing his second stock, but and that F smash is gonna cost him. Oh, okay. I'll stay situation. No still, jump still is no just. Jump. Ooh, nice uh, stalling nice, nice with the uppy. Right Able to dodge the forward air. And he gets back yeah. on stage. See, yeah, that's their opportunity to get in. Both arms. He mm -hmm. can, literally can't do anything until they're both retracted. Uh, Man, this, these, these, yeah, these recoveries from chess is really good. But uh -huh. Finally, the command grab from Yoshi. Able to seal that sock. And we're back uh, into uh, this uh -huh. scenario of... Uh, yeah, hiding near the platform. I wonder if, like, even if he wins this, wins this game, I wonder if he's going to opt for less platform. Yeah, uh, I, I can see that because oh. it's sort of it's given him that chance to run around, but also kind of screws up his uh, his jump ins because he has to right. dodge these platforms to get in. <laughs> Chess is fine to just sit under that left platform right. and just just hang out. He's not not attacking, not really doing anything. Just, Throws an arm out once in a while to remind you he has him. Right. <laughs> He's going up to the heavens to yep. recover there. That was a snake recovery. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, God. He delayed that arm so much. <laughs> like, I forgot you could even do it that long. Yeah. Oh, my God. Ran so through. tricky. Oh, oh, the dragon breath. Catching him off guard. Uh -huh. Yeah. Good stuff yeah, to chest yeah, there. Yeah, very close game between you and Two O, but it was a close two O. It's yeah. one of those games, you know what I mean? A lot of a uh, lot of mental energy put into that game. Oh that was a God. long game. <laughs> a lot of neutral. Well, game imagine play. chess versus lazy Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> Remind yeah, me to yeah. not be on comms when that happens. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Min, Min 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 is a cool character. Like like what they do is really cool. I just you know, it, it just kind of all looks, it's that thing, it's the Olimar problem, mm -hmm. where they all, their moves all look the same, they all have different purposes, mm -hmm. but they all visually look the same, so watching it is just kind of like, mm -hmm. it feels, unless you know what's going on, it just looks like Min Min's just throwing the same arm, just using the same move over again, one button, and right. it feels really demoralizing to lose to that if you don't know what's going on. Right, right, right. And it feels bad to watch it if you don't know what's going on, mm -hmm. which is why people don't like her, but... If you if you watch Min Min a little bit, it becomes really sick to watch because you kind of you know like oh you know every time he does throw out a move, it is actually a big commitment. And like we saw, if Ahis gets in once or twice, it's the whole stock. Yeah, so yep. every there are stakes to every single arm yeah. that, that she throws. And uh, he's legally de demonstrated that game one. The minute <laughs> the minute uh, um, Trust threw out an arm. He just got in and he died immediately. I yep. was like, well, <laughs> I'm going to cap that allow you. He got hit, and then he had the wrong read once. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give us one sec. We're trying to get our next matchup on stream. Hey, 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 hey. If you want it, it's the thing that's on the screen. They dem they, they advertise it. If you go to the menu, you know, it's like I, I was like I literally was like, yo, I want that one. Oh, and dip shit in doubles, bro. I'm kind of nice. What was the last time you seen a dip again in doubles? I'll wait. I mean, done again. No, I mean, I mean, I meant to say, what was the last time you see again in grands? I'll wait. <laughs> Get, yeah. in, get into such a cool character until he dies at 20. Oh my god. <laughs> get into cool until you have to fight him. I was like, well. <laughs> yeah. Young Savage's Ganon specifically is so funny because he is like such a good player. Uh, and then like I went last hit game three with him. Uh, yeah. I am not good at this game. <laughs> I just know how to play against Ganon. <laughs> I know how to just 
not approach uh, someone. Yeah, I know the U of M food get, got a lot of Gannon experience with, with Vinny T, so like, y'all know how to play him. <laughs> Vinny T's Gannon is such a... Oh, uh, that is a cat. That is a character. <laughs> Vinny, Vinny claims he plays every character in the game. Do not listen to him. He plays three <laughs> characters and he plays everyone else like mediocrely. Oh my God. <laughs> he, hey, he, knows, he plays them. He knows where the back air button is. That is the extent of his knowledge of all the characters. Hey, he plays them. It's like that. The caveat yeah. is not yeah. well. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, see me in randoms, bro. And then he like takes one sock against somebody's main. He's like, see. Oh my god. Of course I play Duck Hunt Dog. <laughs> Bro, you don't want to see my game and watch. Speaking of Vinny T, uh, there's a Greninja on stream. Oh, okay. I don't know, is this, uh, does Kahuza play Greninja? Yeah, we're going to see some Greninja with Kareem Esports. Kareem. Yo, okay. Kareem Esports, not to be mixed up with Kareem Gaming. <laughs> yeah, very, do not mix them up. They will make you feel bad if you mix them up. Uh, Kareem Esports is a very uh, well-respected organization in the Minnesota scene. Um, of course, with their titular, uh, Kareem, is, you'll see why. His uh, Game & Watch is very hype. He's going to hit you, and then he's going to up air, and then he's going to up air, and then he's going to up air. He's um, gonna up air. He's oh, gonna up air. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, game and watch. It's, it's, Upper is a good move, baby. It's Upper a good a move. move. It's, a, it's a very good move. Same with Nair. Game and watch Nair is a phenomenal move, and it makes me angry at how good it is. And game and watch forward air is a really good move, and every game and watch tells you that that move is bad, and then they spam it over and over again at the ledge. I'm like, why, why do that if it's bad? <laughs> game and watch. Game and watch mains hate their own character more than everyone else. Oh my god. I know people hate Game & Watch. Game & Watch mains hate Game & Watch. <laughs> and they still play him. Oh my god. Rosalina Luma? That's not good. That's not oh. for Ninja. Uh, I believe I saw, I believe this, did this guy beat Vinny T earlier? Maybe that's where the Greninja came from. I believe I watched this match, and this is a very good Rosalina, if that's the case. Um, this is not a matchup I really know. I don't really know much about what Rosalina does. Um, I know that they have Luma, and you have to watch out for it, but I have not really played a good Rosalina. You can see, uh... Yeah, you know, he's definitely he's doing uh he's doing what you should do against Game and Watch, and that's just kind of be really careful about everything. Game and Watch doesn't really have any any big ranging moves or projectiles, so he's going to have to run in and get it to get his hands on you. And you can see Kazu Kazuza is really not letting that happen. He's letting Luma do all of the work. He's sitting back with Nair with back air. He's down tilt just to poke him out. And but Luma looking Luma's alive. But not for much longer. I do know about Spacey Rosalina. You wanna you wanna try and kill Luma, and there it goes. Yeah, especially with the baking in the back here. Uh. And now Kaos has a better, big disadvantage. Ooh, nice parry. Parry. Able to get a get stage control off because of it. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Oh. <laughs> Luma at ledge just jabbing uh, is so funny to me. Get him out of here. Wow, that Luma did not live yeah, for very long. Yeah, like, Green was taking advantage of, like, anytime you just put Luma out there, or like, oh, yeah, I'm hitting that. <laughs> Big forward air calling out that down air attempt. <laughs> I love Kareem just bullying Luma. <laughs> oh, calls out the back air. Big early, or big lead here for uh, Kareem. And able to extend it a bit with that narrow, but the oh up smash gosh. taking it. Yo, Kahosa. Yeah, uh, this uh, real back and forth. You see these characters really, really careful about how they uh, approach because game and like oh my Kareem's God. game and watch is known to do stuff like this where right. he finds a stray nair and he converts it into seventy percent and. Oh, yeah. Kauza is playing a character that does not really need to to uh, to put themselves in danger much. They're able to... They like just kind of hanging out and letting Luma hit. Like oh there. And using those... Her floaty jumps and her big aerials to... 
safely jump around and stay out of range of those uh, scary Game & Watch moves. So it lands up with his match being very back and forth, very careful, I guess is what I'm trying to say. And mm -hmm. I like watching it. I think okay. it's like the, the jabs. Yo, that Luma pressure. <laughs> Stuck oh. at ledge with no Luma. Yeet him out of here. Uh oh. And yoink. Yep, off stage now. You got your Luma back, but at what cost? Might cost you the stock. Being stuck at ledge against Game & Watch is scary because you can't outspace him. There's no room. <laughs> Up air trading with down air and a weird looking interaction. Oh, the spike from Kahuza. <laughs> But it cost him his Luma. Oh, uh, yep, yep. <laughs> okay, that's all good. He's like, I'm just going to keep away from yeah, it. A star for a stock. Kareem is doing a really good job of getting off of ledge. I just noticed that he hasn't really been ledge trapped this whole game, which is usually something that's really terrifying against Rosa. Uh -huh. uh, but he sort of just finds his way and he just runs in. He's not even like throwing out attacks or doing anything crazy. He just kind of runs. Yeah, there's a lot of, like a, a common situation that like a Kareem does just to, just to like auto get out of uh, being ledge trapped. It's just like ledge hop uh, up the. It's like oh, I'm out of here. Yeah. Mm. But also like uh, Kauza is trying to cover those big aerials with. Uh, okay, peace. Kauza is trying to cover those uh, those jumps that or those upbeats that Kareem likes to do with those big floaty jumps. And Kareem just sees throws a jump and just runs under it, which Ooh, you know, nice, it works. That's up there to keep himself from getting spiked. Oh, oh no. Kareem trying a two frame with dash attack. Saw success once, misses, but able to steal the stock, take the stock with that forward tilt. Uh oh, uh oh. Big deficit though. Game and Watch is very light, so. Oh, I thought that was a nine coming. Da, 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 da. Okay, yeah. Uh oh, uh oh. Kareem is going. Kareem is going to do this the, the old-fashioned way. There's the Kareem esports special. <laughs> Both characters are too scared to press their out of shield buttons. Okay, nice, nice wait on the ledge hunt got up. Yeah, understand. Uh, Kareem understands how strong Luma is. Yeah, fighting his way in by just fighting Luma, only focusing on one at a time. Watch it. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, there's the smash Ooh. attacks. There's the smash attacks. That's the game and watch we know and love. No Luma now, but uh, got Kareem oh, yeah. off stage in a bad spot. How's he going to get off? Oh, Ooh, nice spot dodge. Uh-oh. Yeah, we not dealing with that. Oh, Kareem can reflect. Can, can reflect Luma. reflect Luma. Yes. You cannot. Get out of yeah. here. That is a lie. Luma really? Is, Luma is a projectile when... She does that move. Does she hurt Rosalina on the way back? Yeah. That's when, funny, when actually. Does, when he does that move, she's a projectile. That's hilarious. Mm. Oh, man. And just, all of a sudden, this is looking very doable for Kareem. Uh -huh. uh, big stock or big percent de deficit, but Ooh. Game & Watch does not need crazy das, high percents to kill. Das, <laughs> das chair. Give him the chair. <laughs> Comes in with a chair. He's Kareem. <laughs> Taking game one. See the players laughing about that interaction. The end of the game. That was a very long back and forth game. What we kind of expect from Kareem. But Is Kareem's name on Star Chief Kareem Gaming? Oh my gosh. Hey, hey, first name Kareem, last name Gaming. Get it right? <laughs> I love Kareem. <laughs> the, the icon of Kareem Esports, the figurehead. That is why he owns his own organization. Yeah, the most yeah. influential gaming organization in all of the yeah, Twin like, Cities metro talk, area. Talk to him, baby. Talk to him. Go into Battlefield this game. That was a weird looking clash. It was like Luma and Rosalina both trading with Game Watch. Oh, that's a Luma dead already. Every time Game Watch down throws, I want. I just. My brain thinks a 9 is coming. Oh my god. And I feel. I already am afraid. Oh. Really did not want to be on the left and side Lu of the and stage. Lu and Luma is gone already. That was a stuck at ledge. Just kind of. 
Can't really find a footing against this game and watch. The sausages coming out. Finally finds her Luma and finds a uh, finds a hit. Yep. Gets Game and Watch in disadvantage, but uh -oh. Game and Watch has uh -oh. a down air, and that kind of invalidates disadvantage state. I, I feel like there's an answer to down air, but yeah, those, there those, is. Those, those, those were good uh, down airs. It's just you have to always respect it, which makes it really hard to to uh, juggle him because you kind of always have to be. You can't really be directly below him because if he down airs. You know, you're gonna oh. die. Oh, speaking of down airs, never mind. Or is it sucks? Uh, it's just kind of juggling Game Watch is hard because down air exists. Even if he doesn't use it. Whoa, was that forward air? Uh, that was forward air. Yeah. That was it's weird. Forward. I didn't even see it come out. Good stuff to Kareem, though. Yeah. Just being below Game Watch is scary because you can always pull the trigger on down air at any second. Uh, so you have to sort of juggle him from like the side and below him or uh -huh. not uh -huh. commit to anything. And, uh -huh. I'm just eating those sausages. Kaguza really does not want to be stuck at ledge. I love those recoveries to just fly past the stage. Just say see you later. Yeah, like, I just do not want to deal with ledge driving whatsoever. Just, yeah. Sees the sausages come out and it's like, I'm out of here. Fuck this. Okay. Finding the up air, though. Yep, sharking yep. under that top platform is Kaguza. <laughs> Kareem can't decide whether he wants to hit Kaguza or Luma. <laughs> He's going back and forth. Like, like which, which one? <laughs> like He's the freaking button meme. Yeah. <laughs> He's got the devil and the angel on his shoulders. <laughs> which one's the good decision? Which one's the bad one? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> nice backer to hit Luma right there. That was a nice backer. You're right. Tough bees to get out of that. Oh my Ooh, god. Almost kills with it. 136 here. Stuck at the ledge is Kaguza. No Luma either. Really oh bad place. God. Back here does not quite kill. Uh oh, yep. There's an opening. Oh, oh damn. Just mash down here. That's what I mean. Grown man mashing. Down air is not like a, an amazing move by any means, but like, it just like, you just can't go under him. Some, Cause sometimes that happens and you just die. Yo, treat, you know, treat game watch down there like Bowser down there, Steve down there. Just don't be on right beneath him. Don't whiff a move right beneath him. You're going to get it. Just don't whiff a move in general against like game and watch. Anytime you whiff, you might just take your whole health bar. I like that. He didn't whip a move, but he whipped a spot dodge. Good enough. Uh, uh, ooh. Yo, green with the feints? <laughs> Dashing in and out. This game and launch dad dash dance. Yeah, Luma gone again. This is big, big hole for Kyoza to climb out of. I want to see a nine. I think we're going to see a nine. Will, will Kareem Actually, no, we're just going to see sausages for the yeah. rest of the game. Yeah, Kareem, Kareem Gaming will not do it for the content. Rim game is, is never known for the content. They are here to win. Oh. Yep, yep, there's the bomb. <laughs> yep. And that is what, uh, that is what, we call it like that. Green gaming, gaming sports, green gaming, moves on. Remember guys, that forward air sucks though. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's true. <laughs> I did not hear what he just said, but. What did you say? Oh yeah. Yeah, he says forward air is pretty good. Yeah. What? <laughs> It's his favorite move. Okay, never mind. Kareem is not like the other Game & Watch's mates, and he actually likes Game & Watch forward air. Yep. That's why he's different. We're going to have Dadzy and Barb Nation. Barb Nation on a run here in winner's uh, quarters. Doing crazy. He's beaten past uh, Taco Guy and someone else to get here. He's having a really good run is this Samus. Cucumber. What? What? Who did uh, who did Barb Nation beat before this? Who did Barb Nation beat before this? No, I was talking to Barb earlier. He's had a had a hell of a run. Oh, all day. Okay. Yeah, well. all day. Yeah, Taco yeah. guy and I, I, all I, I day. Felt, I, I felt like he was going to beat all day. I was like, he was extra worried about him for it. I was like, eh, Samus Sonic, what is, what is, what, what is Sonic going to do? Spin dash into a shark slap? I mean, I'm just glad that I did not get to watch that match. 
Oh my gosh. It's a, it, I'm, honestly, it's like Sonic historically, it has a suspect matchup against Zoners. Yeah. Like you wouldn't really like pick it, but like, because he's so fast, you feel like he'd be able to get in. But also, like, what does he do when he gets in? He just he likes to get in and then run away. Right. And that's what Zoners. Zoners like when you run away. Yeah. Um, yeah, Dad's yeah, in yeah, Bar yeah. Nation. We're gonna see Lucina and Samus. Yeah, projectiles are really good at uh, punishing. Um, punishing just spin dash, hold spin dash all the time, and whatnot. But unfortunately, I wish I could stay longer. But I have, fortunately have to go. Like all right. That. Well. Thank you, yeah. Lomomo. I'll see you later. All right. uh, give it up for Lomomo, everybody. Thank you. Hey, peace. I'm going to stay on and watch this Lucina because I love watching Lucina. What? Uh, you can find something else. I play Lucina. Not very well, but I do play Lucina. And so I always like watching Dadzy play. Dadzy's probably one of my favorite players here. And I would love to watch this set, especially against Samus, because I think watching Lucina versus Zoners is a very fun matchup. At least to play. Feels really good when you uh, call out what the Zoners about to do. Zoners typically are very good at covering exactly one option at a time, so if you just pull, do the option that they don't expect, you're always a little tricky with it, or just mix up your timing or your approaching in general. Feels really good when they... When Samus forward airs and you don't jump, or they charge shot and you like dodge it, not getting hit by a zoner's zoning is uh, one of my favorite things of the game. And so Lucina versus Samus, a very fun matchup for me. Um, and I know Barb Barb Nation also likes this matchup. He or he uh, he likes playing against sort of the patient characters, uh, just because. Uh, you know, it's his game he likes to play. He likes it when it's slowed down, likes when he has time to think about what his next move is going to be. And if we're talking about patience, there's almost nobody better in the scene, in the Minnesota scene to exemplify it than that man right there, Dadzy. Dadzy will stare you in the face and he will say, go on, do it. Go pick a move. Yeah, I dare you. He doesn't, he just, he just stands there menacingly. Hopefully we'll see it right away because I, I know Dadzy is very good at not pressing buttons like I was talking about earlier. Ooh, the tomahawk grab right off the start. Well done. But Barb finding the up airs. Good stuff. Going from side to side here is Dadzy. Back and forth game already. Oh, uh, Barb launches a missile the wrong way. He hits it, but able to catch the unsafe move on shield. Gets the uppy, resets neutral. Dash attack trading. And now Barb's the one stuck at ledge. Gonna have to find his way out or else he's gonna lose his stock here. Oh, misses the Dancing Blade. Dezzy is doing a very good way of finding his way in against this charge shot and those uh, missile or the, the whatever the down B bomb is called. Oh, the shield break! Let's go! Caught Barb trying to up B out of shield for the too many times. Taking that stock early. Getting a bit of a lead here, but uh, you know, it won't take much for Barb to even this game up. Gets the grab, but Bomb breaks it immediately, and now he's thrown off stage. And this is what Barb Nation wants. Yup, yup. He loves just setting those bombs up at ledge and charging his little uh, little charge shot. Dezzy Shield looking really low here. Barb finds the grab and is able to put on some percent for setting up shot behind a under a platform in the corner. These Zares missing their mark, but they're doing a good job at just keeping Dadzy away. Uh-oh, though. Uh-oh. Does find his way back with the Zare. That is a very scary situation for Samus to be in. Samus has a very good recovery, but uh, is slow. And Dadzy has a sword that can cover a lot of movement at once. And here's Samus ledge trapping again. He's able. He's happy to just have 
keep Dadsy at the ledge here for the rest of this stock. And he's doing a good job of it. The vet, nice air dodge from Dadsy. Gets out and resets neutral. Now, how does he deal with this uh, charge out? He runs up down tilt and gets the grab. We've seen a lot of good grabs here from Dadsy. <laughs> the, the one teabag. This is what I mean. This is Dadsy's patience. He puts you on ledge and just stands there. And gets the uppy. And now he's just going to stand there. Nope, he's going to go out. Misses the grab, but throws him back off stage again. And he's... Oh! Oh, the mix-up. You thought he was just going to stand there, but he runs up, gets the ledge trump. Not getting a stock off of it yet, though. Oh, the uppy. And far able to get another bomb confirm into a kill. Uppy tax on some percent. Oh, up there. Misses. But Barb's still sitting pretty comfortably here. He's not going to die quite yet. As soon as I say that, he comes narrowly close to death. And Dadsy is at ledge again. Good tech and roll away is able to keep him safe for now. When you're playing against a Samus, always read the roll away. <laughs> they always roll away. They like their space. They like not being next to you. Uh, finds the back air is Dadsy. Finding the back air. Evening this game up. Only 18% deficit and... What the? Wait, charge I can trip? I, I swear I've never seen that before. That was crazy. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> and he gets a gets a good amount of percent off of it. And now Dazzy stuck in the corner, but finds his way out with the jump. Uppy misses. That's the one thing that when Samus misses that Uppy, you you punish them for it. They are, should not be allowed to do that. Almost exactly even here. 73 to 70 something. I couldn't see it. Um, and there's the Dadsy ledge trapping. Able to just react to anything you do. The forward tilt swiping him away before that charge out has a chance to come out. And it looks like the next player to get overly aggressive might end up losing the game. These players saying so patient with each other and careful. Oh, yeah, he didn't have ledge. And uh, Dadsy knew that he was going to do something panicking. And he read the roll, got the back air, caught Barb. I think DIing out a little bit of an early kill there. But uh, good stuff from Dadsy. Was down most of that game, but clutches it out with that ledge strap. And it comes from, like I said, Dadsy's patience. He uh, he could have gone out there and edge, tried to edge guard him, but if you put yourself off stage and miss, uh, you're putting yourself in a bad spot. And uh, are we going to have a new commentator here? All right. Yep, so it's 1-0 Dadsy right now over Barb Nation. Uh Oh, we're seeing a character switch from Dadsy. He won and he switches characters. Okay, we're seeing Palutena now. Interesting. Uh, well, welcome. Welcome. Uh, wait, no. Who are you? Introduce yourself. I am PR number two failbot. Uh, Barb Nation told me he was going on a run today, and wow, he's not joking. Yeah, he took out, uh, we saw him beat Taco Guy and uh, All, all Day. day. Yeah. And did really well in that last game. Just yeah, one just wrong, wrong decision away from winning. But Yeah, really was one charge shot away. If he can play slow and steady like Samus and just keep his mentality that way, he can absolutely win this. Uh, Barb Nation has been fantastic at keeping his mentality right. Also, uh, I really... Maybe the stage is really good for Palu. I'm not aware of it, but uh, I don't like switching after you win with the character. <laughs> it's kind of a kind of like a big dick move. Like, I don't even need to play my... I won. I don't even need to do this again. I can beat you with yeah. any character. Like, it, it was close, but a, a PR or a story time. I was a PM tournament back when I was 2017. Uh, someone was playing Sonic against me, and they barely won, and they switched to their secondary, and they got they got beat solidly, and then they switched back to Sonic, and then they lost to me. That was, <laughs> that's my go. PR win. There you go. We love that. So the point is, uh, I really think you should stick with your character. Well, but maybe the stage is good. Yeah, maybe he just wasn't... He, he, the game was a little too close for him. Wanted something a little more uh, a little more assured. I know Dazbian's been switching to Palu a lot lately. Um, yeah, he's definitely a co-main, and it seems to be working, but yeah. I don't agree with the philosophy, but that's my philosophy, not his. Hey, it's working out so far. He took the first stock, which he didn't do last game. Yeah, so... Oh, oh big up tilt. 
knew the ledge yeah. invincibility. That just, was crazy. Because just, just ran if up he and was did a, it. If Dazzy was a zero, that would have been he would have still had invincibility. But because he was at a hundred, he had less. Yeah, and that's one of those things that uh, Barb just Barb loves putting people at ledge and just have like keeping them there for the rest of the stock. Like, yeah. You get at ledge against Samus, you go like, oh shit. Nah, yeah, they... Samus excels at ledge yeah. trapping, and Barb wants to lean into that end. Yeah. It's yeah. working decently well, but now can you get off the ledge? No. Okay, try again. Yeah, yeah, as long as you don't tells... die, honestly, you're fine. Because you can get a big 0 to 40, get charge shot, and then it's basically even. Yeah. Or close, at least. But Dadzy also excels at ledge trapping, which is what won him the game last time, and he's doing it again. He's, okay, uh, you gotta... Oh my god, that, that was some nice charge shot movement. It didn't yeah. pay out, but... That's crazy. So, Dazzy has a comfortable lead, but... I don't know. Samus can never count Samus out. Can't count Barb out either, but... Barb has been going on the run. Yeah, I, the run if you told me that Barb beat all day and uh, and talked to guy, I wouldn't have believed you, but Barb told me. Yeah, no, he was telling me beforehand, he was like, if, like I just crazy. Beat, if I just beat Taco Guy, I feel like I can get into top eight. Because he, he felt good about that all day matchup, and he was like, you know, Dad's he's good, but I have a chance here, and he obviously does. This game's about yeah. close. Oh, guys, careful. Palus love uh, that run uh, off there. Uh. Or dare, but. Yeah, Yoshi's is a small stage, too. We're only, uh, I'm back surprised Barb's not good up attacking. Yeah, I think... Uh, you gotta do it once. Yeah, I think it's just... It's very scary to, to choose oh, the wrong option. Oh. oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I oh, think... Oh, missed the wall yeah. jump! That's so sad, but... Yeah. We keep going. Uh, good stuff to Dadzy there. Uh, winning with both his Lucina and his Palutena. Really uh, cementing that victory. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think it's just when, when you're stuck at ledge against Dadzy, it feels like there's no right option. You don't want to do the laggy ones. Yes, and Samus is so floaty that jumping, well, if Barb Nation didn't jump there, it would have gotten punished pretty easily unless yeah. Barb Nation had really good downbeat mix up. So. Yeah, even just even if it does get off, you're putting yourself in the air. Uh, Samus doesn't like being in the air. Yeah. You're putting yourself in a bad spot versus maybe putting yourself into a good spot. It's uh, it's hard. Real hard. And now he knows what he goes through, what the other opponent goes through every single time he puts them at the ledge and does his little bomb shenanigans. So we're I in hate this ledge trapping. We're in for a long one now. We got all day versus, or not. We got Lazy Zack versus Vomit. Ooh. It's going to be a long one. Yep. Even if it's 3-0 for someone. Because... Vomit, uh, to my understanding, aside from maybe Pyromithra, doesn't play characters that are too good at approaching Sonic, and uh, Lazy Zack doesn't really approach. I've noticed that. He does what he needs to. Winner Semi is best of five. Winner Semi is best of five, okay. So, to get here, uh, who did uh, who did Lazy Zack be? Do you know? Oh, it'd be Chess. Chess would be Ehis, yeah. So, Lazy Zack be Chess to get here, and uh, Vomit be Goflap. What a run for both these players. It's the fun thing about an Arcadian. You get these characters you don't normally see in Winter's Semis going on these crazy runs. Yeah, well, we've seen Lazy Zack in Winter's Semis yeah, and yeah. Vomit, but not at the same time, for sure. Yeah, these matchups are fun. <laughs> you just spice things They're up new. a little bit. Yeah. Uh, there are a lot of things. I wouldn't say the fun. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I've seen I've seen Loaf in Winter's Semis enough. I'm okay to see uh, these two characters. Yeah, I, I hate Loaf, too. I like no, I like loaf. I do, I don't. I'm a, I'm a loaf <laughs> fan. I'm a I'm a loaf head. He's right fans. there, and I'm shit talking him, and he is no, he's none yeah. the wiser. He's yeah, he's playing. Well, he's he's playing. concentrating on his mega fast. Yadi, what game lightning, mode is that? It's lightning mega smash. Big and fast smash. Yeah, I can tell because. The, well, it is big and fast, but like maybe there was something else I was missing. I don't know. It kind of hurts my head to look at too long. Uh, if you guys ever want to give yourself an aneurysm, play lightning fast smash. This is like, uh, uh, this is how it feels to play Smash Point on two hours of sleep. That's what uh, Big Pass Smash is. That's, I feel like that's what, like, your head on. That's what it feels like after, like, six energy drinks. You just pound it all at once. Uh -huh. Okay, we gotta get, we're gonna get that Mithra versus the Sonic. The sussy Sonic tag. How lovely. Yup. That's what I would I wish King of Wizards was here, but alas. Nope. No PR players allowed. Here we go. Vomit starting it off with an aggressive spin dash, almost taking a sock right there. If, uh, if Lazy Zack had jumped. Oh, I'll, I'll flip the tags. Yeah. Or, yeah. 
If if Vomit had jumped, Lazy Zag would have taken a stock there. Thank what? you, Ben. Holds on to it. Sorry. <laughs> We're good. Uh, either way, uh, damage. Uh, Sonic's faring. Oh, that's uh -oh. dead. Oh, no. He had a... Oh, that's actually a really good recovery. I would have expected side B there, but Uppy barely gets back. And could have been punished, but you're not expecting it. So you get away with it once. You get away with it once. And now <laughs> they have hesitation if they think you're going to side B. Mm -hmm. Mithra's recovery is, like, bad, but at least you've got two of them. Yeah. Two bad recoveries it's completely is sometimes workable. better than one good recovery. But if uh, he made know, that back, that would have been the best recovery ever, but instead it was a bad recovery. Yeah. Well, Very sad. Second best recovery. You remember shoot down down airing a pigment? I think that would have been <laughs> honest about that might have been better. <laughs> Better say it. I love the shoot down. So it's I've so gotta better. be I've gotta be honest, I have no idea how this matchup works. I, I like I guess Sonic wants to spin dash a lot, but I don't get what Mithra wants to do about spin dash. Uh Mithra Evidently it seems like you just want to get hit by it based on the way Vom is playing. Mithra likes to press buttons, especially A. Uh yeah, I guess you close the space and then, but Just yeah, if you clank, that doesn't really favor you. Oh, oh big missed the sweet spot. That's tough. This is sus, yeah. to say the least. Maybe, maybe Vomit doesn't want anything in this matchup. Maybe, maybe he just wants to go to the next game. Yeah. You never know. <laughs> he just wants to go go on to losers round five or wherever they are. He's just like, yeah, that was a good winner's run while it lasted. It's hard to say. Oh. Like, it's hard to say what's going wrong because it feels like Vom is just approaching and then just not getting it, like, just losing consistently. Yeah, we have to bring the down interaction by interaction. We've also seen Vomit just die really early. Uh, oh. Yeah, yeah just hesitated on that down tilt, but yeah, even then, probably couldn't have gotten a guaranteed kill. Okay. Big F smash. You gotta start something here. Can you hold the ledge? Sonic has a lot of good options off ledge, and that's one of them. Just rolling because you can thread so many other things. Oh. Dodges the spray. Dodges it. Hey, he's definitely not out of it yet. Yeah, it's but, just uh, good luck. Oh. He's just getting rolled over, but ambitious. Like, even that F smash wouldn't have killed. Like, well, but he's actually would have. But yeah. <laughs> like honestly, do you just play Pyra at this point and just? Oh, should have died there possibly. Mm. Just I... playing Pyra is kind of like a. Kind of just like, yeah, I know I'm probably probably lost, but I'll throw all my cards out now. Well, it's much more about you want to have the threat of winning at any time so you can get that panic option out. True. That, that is true. If you can get a panic option out, that's how you win here. Because Sonic, if Sonic just lays back... That, there. <laughs> that <laughs> almost gross. It just ball. Yeah, but if Sonic laid back there, what's, what's what you're going to do? Yeah. Because... At least what from what was happening in that game, it didn't look like Mithra could really get a guaranteed way to beat Spin Dash, and most of the time it would favor Sonic if they did the Clank situation. Mm -hmm. Or just RPS, because it's Sonic. Mm -hmm. Sonic's pretty good. Do you think Sonic's top three? Top, wait, what? Top three? Do you think Sonic is top three? Do you? Yes. Okay. I mean... It's not that uncommon, but I get not thinking it. I can't really argue with you because you are a far better player than me. Uh, but if I said Ganon is top tier, I think you could argue with that. No, I'll let you have that. No. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Do you think Ganon is top tier? No. Okay, we got the Ken. <laughs> Yo, Ken, let's go. See, at least with Ken now, you have a harder time finding your way in, but when you do, you're going to deal a lot yeah, more Yeah, shoot damage. those Hadoukens. Oh, that's actually really nice spacing. Yeah, I don't know. If don't, you don't yeah. have a safe tilt to punish that, it honestly might not be worth it, just because it's much better to keep Sonic at ledge and get that threat of getting another hit, rather than letting him would punish you most of the time. Overextending against a character like this is just uh, brutal, scary a lot of the time. You don't want to do it. But if you never extend at all, then like it becomes really hard to find stocks, like we saw in the last game. Just yeah, just shoot those tokens. But well, Zach doesn't have a good answer for them. Just quarter circle forward and punch. Yo! Then, you know, I guess PS2 doesn't even have a high blast, so I'm guessing maybe just I'm used to seeing command input. D charge down smash. There's Good the job. Smash. Yeah, that was a really aggressive homing. Well, not really, but that was an aggressive homing attack. Mm -hmm. Man. You got all the time, you just gotta play solid, especially with Sonic. That's what makes him so good. Playing solid, but maximizing your opening. That makes, what makes him top three, Fine apparently. <laughs> Man, the Hadokens, they're working out. See, I think this is the way people should play shows. You should just just camp and sh shoot fireballs, just like in Street Fighter. Yeah. That's but I nice think take a lot of damage. Just the mix-up between the fireball game and just running in is really getting Zach. Mm -hmm. 
because he's have to, constantly having to be like aware of those fireballs and thinking about them, and then suddenly all of a sudden Ken is in your face. And, yeah, uh, like to show you. If if Lazy Knack hesitated that spin, she probably would have just died from that because that Shoryu read and how did they get punished? Like Vomit's really changing the risk reward from last match. Yes, Lazy Zack just probably having a tough time, uh, like adapting. Sort of yeah, changing his game plan. It is really dramatic to play uh, two, these two different characters. Yeah, all of a sudden, like the fastest character in the game versus. Oh, I don't think he can make it back. He was a little too scared of. That's the character there. that really wants to be right next to you. They yeah. don't want to keep you out of range because Vomit was not keeping Zack at the range that Mitra excels at, and also it's hard. So. Yeah, the fastest right. character in the game, but. Wow, that was just invincible. Oh, this is some damage. I'm just running to ledge. But just giving There's him the space, you. giving him the space and punishing him for taking it. Amazing. <laughs> he just spun all the way to the other side of the screen. It wasn't even fast. Yeah, it was. Bro was like leisurely yeah. spinning by Sonic's stand. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Careful. You're gonna lose here, but how do you get off ledge? I guess Sonic's ledge trapping isn't the most oppressive because you don't stop. Oh, he keeps. He's, he's gone for that twice. I don't think down tilt. Down tilt does what you. I think he does Lazy's actually getting SDI out, and what you oh. have to do, what uh, like Vendetta does, they practice hit confirms, mm -hmm. where they can react to one down to it, which is really hard, but it's so good because they don't get a chance to react to it. They just die. Because you're better. And yeah, no jump, this should be a dead. He doesn't jump. Oh, never mind, he doesn't. I thought he did. I thought he landed. Either way, that's his thought. Yeah. Lazy Zack brought this back a lot. I think ever since we started gassing up Vomit, he uh, has not really gotten a, a hit in. Yeah, we should really just stay quiet if we want Vomit to win. Actually, Vomit's playing really badly. I think he's going to yeah, he's uh, just, lose this game. Me yeah. will do, be doing better. He will right literally now. never hit a shore you can He ever. will never get top eight. <laughs> he will never get top eight. He will never get DR. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, back to the match. Our commentator's curse did not uh, seem to work. Nice Lazy back air. still thriving uh, right now. Good for him. It's going for the F smash I'm at 35%. I don't, talk. I don't talk. Nothing happens. Yeah. Uh, he does even the game. And even the game stock is, count. Yeah. And uh, with Ken's firepower, it is definitely always an even game. If you get a good hit against Sonic, like starting now, you could just die if you get hit in a really bad spot. Yeah, and even if you don't, you're going to take 80. Like one one good read of a... Oh, uh-oh. Is he dead? Oh, oh a really just, good attempt, but just doesn't get the high. Enough. But the back throw is going to put him in a bad spot. Bomb is, Bomb is weaving around these so carefully. I think... Two, it's what I'm saying. Two bad recoveries is oh almost God, better than one good recovery. If Vomit knew, he probably could have done up tilt down air. Maybe. I don't know. But oh, no way that forward killed. air. Just the last hit of it. Oh, my... No. no, I think no. I think auto turn. I think he went under the stage and auto turn around. No, it was not a turn around. He just thought he, he just, was somewhere else. Yeah, unfortunate. Well, good shit to Lazy's back up 2-0, but yeah. anything can change. That game was a lot better than the last one. So yeah. if that trend line continues, we're we gonna see Ken again. You think? If that trend continues for the rest of the set, you're getting JV Port in game five. So don't let it be you. Yeah. Why you ask? So. Uh, okay. Yeah, it looks like the Ken worked enough that he is going to stick with it. Uh, I, did, did he change alts? I think he did. Uh-huh. Yeah. The shirt color was what was weighing him down is yeah. really what it was. Blue is lighter than whatever color he was wearing. Mm -hmm. He wanted to match no. uh, Oh, my God. That's unfortunate. Well, not unfortunate. That's Ken, Ken entirely moment. within your control, but that is tough yeah. either way. Not a good event to happen. Yeah, you hate to see it happen. But think about it. If Vomit makes his comeback, which is not looking likely, but if he does, he'll have a lot of momentum. But uh, I don't know how you get there. Yeah, that was very desperate. Hey, he wants that momentum, like you said. And it maybe would have worked, but not this time. Oh, my God. Oh, he... <laughs> this is brutal. Remember what you were saying about JB4? Uh, <laughs> it's not quite it, but just you know, a, a very unfortunate sometimes game. Sometimes, you just have to play solid. Even if you're not going to win, play solid. Keep your head in the game. And... Maybe you'll win this game. Don't let it get to you. Even if you don't, you'll be better prepared for your next set if you don't let it get to you. Everyone has games like this. They just happen. Yeah. It's... This is rough. You hate to see it be you, but if it's ever you, the best thing to do is just keep playing your I game. I thought Lee's exactly didn't have a joke. Yeah, that would have been what Vomit needed, but instead Vomit's not getting anything that he needs. 
Nope. No luck on his side. Oh, the parry. Oh, the parry. The I die mean, go. As long as you don't die here, you really don't care. But, like, how do you not die here? Yeah. Oh, he gets that. What? Yo, and he's what in the game. Of but that's what you need. Yeah, focus hits on your back but for some he's, reason. But he's actually going to Anthony and approach you. Again, you've got five minutes on the clock. The game's going to end unless Lazy Zack refuses to commit. So might as well take good commitments. Oh my god. Oh, they are swinging. Up. It's really messed up. Well, it isn't because she obviously he earned this lead, but like... It's really... What the heck? <laughs> what the fuck? You're dead. That's tough. <laughs> that was two slingshots and a, a fully really charged really, forward but... smash. Going on Lazy Zack. Lazy Zack. Quite solid. Yeah. That's his game. That's yeah. what you need to do. Just play this game. He played... I mean, he, it's not even like he just played his game. He did play really well that set. He played out of Ken's threat zone really well um, between just his spaced aerials and his using his movement. Uh, good stuff to Lazy Zack. Is it Sonic. Kareem Dazzy now? For winner semis. Uh, I think I may need to hop off comms. Um, but hey, Dadzy, are you playing against Kareem? Okay. Yeah. It's gonna be Dadzy and Kareem coming up next. Uh, I'm gonna hop off. Oh. Never mind. Meat Flap and with Mistro first. Who is Mistro? I know they won some stuff, but I don't know who they are. I don't know. I've seen their name a lot, so they must be good. Um, good commenting with you, Failbot. I'll see you later. Uh, thanks for having me, Good having you, Mr. Phil. Thank you. So let's see. Mistral has beaten Jimbo. Or a wolf, Nachi, Rush. Who do you lose to? I'm gonna find who Mr. Lost to. Tell everyone in chat. If you want. So Mistral's been on a run. They beat Mistral beat Strumble, lost to Chess, and then they beat Rush into. Um, Mistral beat Rush after lose, after beating a Shrumble but losing to uh, Chess and Winners. Who was Mistral beaten? They've beaten uh, Nachi, Orowolf, and Jimbo to get here. That's crazy. Not bad. Orowolf is so good. Yeah. I'm curious to see who Mistral plays. Uh, Kazuya. Oh. Oh. We're gonna get a we're gonna get a FGC ditto here. This is gonna be a matchup and a half. I I'm feel... I'm 90 percent sure it's Kazuya. If I'm wrong, I will DQ. No. If I'm Have right? they gone to the Umex, Mistro? Uh, I don't know. I've, I've never been to a Umex. There's a Umex player, or there's a person who goes to Umex who uh, plays Kazuya from, and they're a Tekken player, so they know all the inputs. Oh God, I have the same, I have the same mic and the same crane at my house. Yeah, don't. It's not your house anymore. Uh, it's not. But it's been like, yep. Okay, that's right. We are getting Ryu Kazuya. That. All right. Um, this matchup, I feel like Kazuya has the advantage. Ryu. Kazuya can uh, do the invincible dash. I don't know the exact name for it. Through the crouch dash, yeah. But yeah, through the fireballs, and that's gonna be because Ryu is more of the zoner. He's got the invincible dash. He's got the reflective. He's got a bunch of options to deal with that. He does have the reflective. And Ryu that's just right. kind of has to just get a timing read, really, to yeah. get a, a good hit. Mm -hmm. I feel like Ryu might be better at the ledge, though. And oh yeah, definitely. Ryu is a better disadvantage, especially in this match. Well, yeah, especially and in this matchup. But obviously, if Mistral knows the punish game. Quake in fear. Yeah, and focus, I think, is going to be pretty good in this matchup. Yeah, Mistral trying to jump in. I'm actually not taking any knockback from that command grab. Even the armor through that fair. But Meatpot's got a really good plan, just zone. Yeah. This Dude, is like a real fighting game. Th this is what I experienced when I played Meatpot 2. I don't blame him. This is, this I think, is how you should be playing this matchup. Yeah. Don't interact with Kazuya. If you interact with Kazuya, you're probably just going to die. Well, that so auto how turnaround. is Mistral going to get around this? That's the question they have to answer. Yeah, that auto turnaround is coming in clutch, but Rage Drive. So, Rage Drive, obviously, if you read a fireball, doesn't matter. Read a fireball, you can't read a fireball if you're dead. One thing that is going to be super good for Ryu in this matchup, Kazuya is heavy and Rage Drive is scary. Ryu can kill really early, really consistently. Actually, yeah, especially with Shoryu, like we just saw. That, oh my god. Ooh. Read the yeah, yeah, but probably the wrong percent. Yeah, I think going for the S-Master is a little greedy. 
I think that the biggest problem that players at this level have, and even at PR level, is that like lower, lower to like not low level PR is that we get desperate. We yeah. go for things. We go for hail marys. It's like okay, if this hits, I will be even, and if it doesn't hit, then then I don't care. It, but it's you do like, care because you're missing a potential advantage. Yeah, it's almost human nature to want to just like yeah. That was a really good option. It's not going to kill because it wasn't the, the super version. Oh, he got really aggressive there. Pushing in. Big risk to the character with Kazuya up me, but... Yeah, and I like the idea to use fireballs to try to get rid of that range drive, because you want to get it before you lose your... You want to get rid of it before you lose your Yeah, because now you could die. Yep. Two, two interactions, you're dead. And that should be it, sure you. Yep. Yeah, there was no way Mistral could go. They just they picked a bad spot. Yeah, I guess maybe trying to air dodge to the ledge would have been the best, but yeah, if you can do down tilting because at least then uh, the green has to react and bounce. Back. Yeah. Oh, I like oh, that sliding forward. Do you know your combos? I'm gonna go with yes. This combo's cooking. 64. Not oh, bad. but the ambiguous platform situation saves me flat. Only taking 64. Not that bad. Oh, that side view was a bit ambitious. Just jumping over in his meat flap. And Mitchell has brought this game all the way back. Just with one neutral win. Um, one stop. I, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't notice that. Yeah, I haven't noticed it a few times either, but... <laughs> my, my fault, Chad. Tapsu, that's not gonna kill for me yet. You can't get hit one more time or you can't whip Rage Drive, really. Because you're dead. Tatsu should live. Kazuya's no heavy. Drive, but honestly, do you need Rage Drive? Just get a hit in the right spot. Oh, you're dead. Okay, this has to kill. Okay. It is a little stale, but still. Good game plan by Meat Flap. I don't know what to say, he just stayed out of his range, got some fireballs, and Mistro didn't really have a good answer for that. And one one thing was, Meat Flap kept that game plan consistently. He never really had any lapses in it, and once he got a hit, he made the most of it. He was getting the down tilts into the Hadoukens. Oh, Smashville? I guess, like, Kazuya's probably good at this stage. Maybe the platform middle, middle is ambiguous, because you can guarantee that you'll get the platform reset, which are really strong. Yeah, you got the first stack. But, uh... I don't know, Ryu's also really strong in this stage, so maybe you should go for, I don't know, the flat stages were probably banned, but I yeah. guess this is fine. If your opponent plays Kazuya, please ban FD. For the love of god, your character's not better than Kazuya and FD. Yes, I don't care who you play. I don't care if you play Seed, I don't care if you play Greninja, it doesn't matter. L like, the two best characters in the unfortunate SD from Mistral there, Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say, the two best characters on FD are Kazuya and Little Mac. Oh, I forgot about that thing. If your little Mac probably take Kazuya to FD. Yeah. It, does, you're, it doesn't matter. You're dying in one hit anyways. Well, anyways. Speaking of dying game. in one hit, uh, this girl is not, not dying. And I think no. this is still a best of three. It's best of, yeah, it's best of three. This is the game top eight, so you've got to make a big comeback. But Kazuya is a character who can do that, but Meat Flap is just Meep a Meep wall right hit. now. And it's really hard when you're not getting any hits to be confident in your punish. That's not going to kill, but that is 40 damage. Yeah, so if you get the kill here, um, you have a big threat, but how are you going to get the kill? I mean, if Kazuya lands an electric here, is what I would have said, but Meat Flap getting the sh sure you can turn well, consistent as ever. It's the same situation as last time, except you need another electric kill yes. to make the comeback. But Meat Flap, just pressure. I don't know what Kazuya does out of shield. Kazuya's out of shield options are kind of lacking. They're not up good. B. He is up B, but it's not fast enough for Ryu. Yeah, Ryu's... If you don't have a, uh, an, a move that's minus 9 on a field or faster, you cannot contest with a down tilt on shield. Yeah, I'm I'm super privileged in this matchup. Well, if he spins with it. Oh, yeah. uh, he lived that? That is the first Please. I've seen Ryu recover. Wow. And, and you're in kill percent now. If you get down tilted, you, you're dead. Oh, Meat Flap's just going for down tilt. What are you going to do about yeah, it? What are you going to do? Clean, clean duo from Meat Flap. Wow, that was brutal. I don't even know what it was. Like, I think you just have to grind that matchup with Mistral because that wasn't like having the wrong idea. That was just not having an idea of what it, to do. It was kind of just Meat Flap felt a lot more confident, looked a lot more consistent in his game plan, and just yeah. ran away with it. And to be fair to Mistral, Meat Flap does play Kazuya. That's true. Yeah, so Meat Flap he knows all those ranges that he should say that he was quite willing to play lane. Okay, hey, nine. Not bad, Sean. Not bad, especially considering Mr. was like almost unseated. Yep. And there was a hundred people here today, so that ninth looks even more. Not bad. Yeah. Pretty good, actually. Yeah, I can't believe this tournament got 104 entrance. That's actually crazy. Everyone thought it was their day, but I, it was not. I, I expected it to be like 50. And then I was like, oh my god, there are so many people here. Uh, I might be playing next. Dadsy's looking for me. All right. Yeah, just go. All right, chat. Wish me luck. Good luck, Curry. Hey, good chip, me flap. So 
for our top eight, we got B flap is our first one in loser side. Oh. What brings you here? I don't know. I want to commentate. That's fair. Commentate, and my friend told me to. <laughs> I understand. So we got Kareem Dadsy. I don't have the stats up. I think Kareem won the last time they played, but I think this is overall favorite Dadsy. I could be wrong though. Maybe Dadsy won the last time they played. Dadsy's definitely been hotter recently, but yeah. This is also Game and Watch Lucina, so. Definitely uh, Lucina. I've watched Kareem's Game and Watch. It's, uh, it's pretty good. Pretty snasty. But the big problem with this matchup is how are you getting your hits and do they count? Because you can juggle Lucina pretty decently well, but how are you going to get in? Because Lucina's forward, if they space it right, it's going to be safe, it's going to outrage all your moves, and you can't really edge out this character even if you do get a hit. Like, it's not worth it, so we'll see. Yeah, Dazzy loves his Tomahawk. They're going to be with a lot of doubles. Are you dead? No. This is, this is, this is game of Isn't this game of Yeah. Dead. He has to be in the pits of hell to be dead. Yeah, I was thinking of tossing <laughs> it. Yeah, get your damage. Game and watch things. Yeah, get another grab. But this is the hard part. How are you going to kill Lucy? As game and watch, it doesn't feel like you have a reliable way to win neutral. I'm, I'm saying this because I'm going to keep saying it. Like, if, like the best thing you have out of shield is probably Uppy, but aside from that, you don't have much. Anyways. They're keeping it pretty close. Okay. Wow, Jazzy's really threatening that space, but Jazz, going back to the ledge trap, they gave themselves enough time to recover and go to the ledge trap. And that's why they threatened the space, so they can just speed. It's unfortunate. Yeah, not too big of a deal, but did it, you, need, you really wanted to speed against Game & Watch. I mean, down I'm, smash there. You need to down smash and probably cover the landing when they mash out. I, I guess luckily for Cream, he doesn't have to kill, so. Yeah, if, if Dazzy is teased, a hard part of the matchup gone. Oh my god, this zoning. I don't know if it's zoning, this boxing is great. Oh, DI wrong on the nair because didn't think it would cross up and could have gotten up there, there, but still, 50% of them, not, that's a decent deal because you get knocked down a lot more now. Okay, this man is still alive. Oh, that was a questionable. That was a dubious down air, but Dazzy got hit by it, so no complaints for me. Dazzy oh, takes a stock. Yeah, that's crazy that you can just beat Game Watch down air from below. <laughs> How good must your character be? But yeah. Oh my god, I thought Dazzy was gonna run out down air and go for it all. But he plays it safe, keeps a stock. But probably a better choice. And yeah, he's just already winning again. Just Kareem can't get a hit. But you've got the stage. How are you going to use the stage? Poorly. Oh my god. Dazzy just always spends that space, but still doesn't have time to let trap. I can't get over it. That was enough to how to shield for Kareem, but that was a big whiff. Good one. God, Dadzy just holding the stage right now. Yeah, Kareem has gotten like one hit in the last minute. And um, yeah, Kareem lost his entire stock and got one hit. That's brutal. Because that was like being suffocated. Another upbeat. I love to see it. Yes. It feels impossible to get in on this character. Like, that's probably not the case, but like, geez. It, especially with the spacing we've been saying. Oh my god. Let's go. Didn't need to worry about the cross up. Kring didn't get far enough in to make that matter, so I'll be just catching inside. This is rough. I I don't know what to say. Kareem just can't get in. And how can you win if you can't get ahead? I guess you just lose. That's what we're seeing. That's not necessarily true. We saw if you SD, you can win pretty easily. If your opponent has these. If your opponent has these. Yeah. I mean, maybe Kareem could knock the controller out of Dazzy's okay. hand, but... Kareem's fishing for a 9, but just dies. That takes it. Just, just, Kareem is dead. Just locking Kareem down from getting any damage in there. Last two stocks. I hate to see it. Yeah, so... 
But Dazzy, feeling good. You did well that game. You won solidly, despite SD at the front. So I don't think you're worried. And I hope Kareem stays uh, game wise this whole set. I do not want to see the banjo. Banjo is not going to do it. The, the I don't banjo care how good has banjo to come is. out. Da Dazzy is not going to lose the banjo, even if it's Kareem the banjo. Banjo is not good. Yo, gets a parry grab at the start of the game. What do you get? 40. And ledge. Okay, wow. Not bad, but once again, how are you going to kill? Well, I guess if you get hit, uncontested, no need to worry about killing. The kill will come. I don't know. We've seen some pretty nasty stuff from, from uh, Kareem, like on ledge, the, the down air. Uh, killing dads, he had ledge. Yeah, that was a great use of an attack. Oh, you're dead! Get out of here! <laughs> Just like that. Should have thought about spacing better. Well, they actually really can't space them much better, but... Anyway. Oh, that was clean. Got the, got the hit confirmed. That's what he needs to win. Is this going to be a repeat of last game where Dazzy just kind of runs away after getting pretty first dog? I hope not, for Korean's sake, but... Yeah, that would be definitely sad to see. Back at even now, after that crazy oh, that's huge. kill. Now, Dazzy had to give up stage in, in return for landing, so you still got a good spot. That down was nice. Oh, doesn't get the grab, and Dazzy's gonna get a punish. What does he get? Oh. Okay, gets forward. That's really good. Especially now, because back is gonna kill if you get too far out. Wow, back throw. How original. Fourth throw? Really? I would guess back throw at least get a ledge situation where you can throw a chip. Oh, Dazzy. That was so clean. Just dashing. Oh, but he lives. That's a huge deal. You gave him stage because you were a few percent too early, and now you're going to die. Bad there, but not much you could do there, so. Bad. You just chose a bad spot, and that's so. A few percent off from being attackable, and you lose. Ooh, hits there him with a chair, all the H box. Okay. Sending him to heaven. They're neutral in. Why would you put yourself there? That's no good. Oh, that's very neat. Oh, but doesn't get anything off the knockdown. He still gets up stage. And Dazzy is on the back fight, but just swing and it works. Good shit. That was so close to working. If Kareem went a bit more to the left, it would have worked. Could we see the crazy Kareem clutch? It's so hard. It's possible, but. Because Dazzy can just keep forcing grabs, basically. Yeah. And you can't. You kind of just have to take them because if you ever get strong on the back here, that's just an instant loss. Oh, the chair just doesn't come out. But Dazzy, what does Dazzy make of it? Oh, Kareem's ready for the life jump. He probably learned that from doubles. That's it. Oh my God. You that hate so to close. see it. Dazzy's up 2-0. Kareem's got to make a huge comeback, but he, I mean, he's definitely capable of it. Three times in a row is a tall order. We, we could definitely see it. It'd be very, very nice to see. I hope he pulls out the banjo. I um, hope that he doesn't, for his own sake. I think it'd be funny if he made the if he made the clutch with banjo. I guess. Maybe it would be funny. A little bit funny, but is it likely? likely? Is it, we got to weigh its likeliness in, in terms of how funny it is. Very funny, but also very unlikely. Well, the Game & Watch would be very cool for the Kareem, and it's possible. 
So last time someone was up 2-0, uh, they kind of just got memed on game 3. So let's hope that doesn't happen again. For, for game three. Yoshi's? Yo, yeah. Yoshi's here? That's crazy. Game Watch is really good on this game. The platforms really help you juggle. If you get caught by up on the top flight, you die. There's a lot going through this here. You know, I, I don't get all the Yoshi's here. I'm gonna be real. Okay, I... Let's talk about Yoshi. It has the same top lasso height from the floor as as PS2 and FD and all those stages. Oh, my God. oh that is... That is... You just... Yeah, you're dead. Oh, oh okay. you got a second piece on light. You took it up grab. What a pro. I don't like plants, but if you like them, that's fine. But there's enough else going against the stage, like it being another tripod at that. But I do play Mario, so I'm not complaining as long as it's legal. Yeah. I think the stage looks cool. And that's about it. Yeah, that's fair. He's back airing. He's gonna back air again. Oh. Nope, grab. Mixing it up. It's a situation that makes it so every other move is that much closer to killing. Gonna do it. No reason to play aggressively here, just play slow. That's just got it. Yeah, throws a curveball. Especially when you're on the ledge for like five minutes. Which is just unlucky. Oh, sneaks in between those hits. That's huge. Crazy. Whoa! How is it green that got on stage? This is doable for Kareem. You can get back here. Still doable, but much harder now. That was not a good recovery, but Kareem just didn't position himself right. That was in a really awkward spot where he had to get he had to fast and get or he had to fall and get more drift in, but he wasn't in a spot to punch him, so he got away with it. Yeah, this is really an unfortunate matchup, especially since we've seen Kareem do some really saucy, crazy stuff, and it just gets shut down as well. Yeah, Dazzy just wants to keep him at bay, at the end of his sword. Now we're going to keep him closer. This is sad for any, uh... Oh, that's the end of the stream. Okay, the... Okay, got a punish. Wow, the up air. That's insane. I wouldn't guess. That's yeah. How pretty pro move. Game and watch. Okay, you back here. It's actually almost even. I didn't realize it. If you get like a good down smash, you probably just die. Yeah, but it's also been even the last two times, and then Dadzy just keeps him in disadvantage for like five minutes. It is really the same as last game. But, um, you know, maybe Kareem wants it to be different this time. Maybe people decide to win. Maybe he took a couple deep breaths, and it's a... And it's a different now. Okay. That was a bit of an aggressive landing on the platform. You could only really get a kill there. If he lands on the platform, you gave up a lot of your advantage. No jump from Dazzy, but still gonna make it back. So, what do you got here? Good recovery. Not good enough, though. Yeah, that's it. So, um, Kareem up as a lead when Dad's got his last stock for the first time in the set. How was he gonna make of it? A yeah, small stock of damage here at 144, though, or 154. Every hit is precious, and he only he got, he got one. Get up there, up air gun. Yo, yo, oh, he's, he's going insane. He's going ham. Jazzy, how is he gonna get off? Oh no, jump! Oh, just wants to offer the life trap, I guess. Yeah, Lucian doesn't have any guaranteed edge yards there for Game Watch that kill, so. Oh my, oh god. my god! He's keeping in his zone! No oh way. my god! The cream! Okay, now you just gotta play solidly. You've got a big lead. Of... Yeah, he has to respect the chair, so now you gotta play around. Okay, how's he gonna respect the chair? We're gonna punch him with things. So a lot of grabs probably will be good. A lot of these rising airs that avoid that jump over the chair. Just... This man is at one percent. Just don't throw. There it is. Cream puts himself on the board. Dazzy definitely still the favorite, but 
Rim really turns it around. I'm not sure how much of it was the Yoshi stick and how much of it was just avoiding the zone Dazzy wanted to put him in. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think we're going to see it. We're going to see the cream comeback. I do agree that we're going to maybe not a full comeback, but he's definitely going to make some progress. I feel like he definitely made or took advantage a lot more of the space that he had and didn't let Dad see. You know, take advantage of that space, I guess. Yeah. I wonder how the rest of Bracket's going. Is my Go Drip still in? Three, two, one, go. Oh, Town City. So opting for smaller side blast zones and higher top blast zones. Given that Game Watch has been killing with like good mixed chairs and. Uh, Whatever, whatever that uh, helmet's called, he's a uh, yeah, that's a reasonable pick. It's much more about the stage and the opportunity to get edge guarding and uh, not edge guarding, but uh, juggling. So I think this is a good pick. In summary, so uh, could could we see goat? Go Reem, come back here. The go. Oh, um, sorry. Let's, um, yeah, I think we were both checking our phones there. Um, I was looking at bracket. My go drip is out. I lost Taco Guy for 13 for long with go flat. He almost beat go flat, but didn't pull through in the end, which is sad for my boy. But like, me flat still goes on, so good for him. I'm, I'm gonna call it here. He's gonna come with the back air. It's gonna happen. That's a, a reasonable assessment of the situation. So. I was wrong. <laughs> Dazzy's actually got a decent percent here, so as long as he doesn't get hit, uh, you're golden. I'm scared we're not going to see the comeback. Well, I wouldn't be scared if I was a Dazzy fan, but I am pretty right? <laughs> Unfortunate. Yeah, I, I I haven't seen a ton. Yo, of that. the chair. Can we see another chair? No. Yeah, as he's just playing a solid advantage. Like we've seen time and time again. It it really is like the other three. He was probably dead anyways, but that was an insane angle. Okay, Kareem, this is what you have to push. You've got a really good opportunity to juggle because the side, plas the side platforms aren't going to mitigate the fact that the center of the stage is just FP. Doesn't work out. Same thing again and again. I really don't know how Kareem would get out of this situation when getting into it. Kareem's playing well. Not much more than that. You know, if, if Kareem can get the kill here. No, it would it would tie up the shot. Yeah. But uh but, right um, now Yeah. Oh this is up the angle and got punished. Fifteen to sixty. It's rough. Yeah, I am not a believer. Cream could still win, but you just can't get back here to like or Ivy or really fair off stage or four tilt is pretty soon. Oh, doesn't hear that That's huge. He has a chance. Oh, and he gets the chair out. He has a chance. Oh, he's gonna keep. He, he, he's. No tech. Okay. Not like that, dude. At least make at least tech in the game. Really hate to see it. So we got Dad C versus uh, Lazy Zach. Winners finals. That's crazy. Big game from Dad Z though. Um. Played played that space really well. Yeah. 
Who do we have up next? Uh, you could do meat flap chess. Oh, we're gonna do that? <laughs> okay. Uh, so for Taco Guy and who else is it? Uh, <laughs> So his opponent plays Rosalina, was unseated, but it's been doing pretty well. So unseated got to at least nine. So I would definitely keep an eye out for them. We can probably pretty, pretty close. You should do you should do winners finals loser semis. Yeah. I would maybe just put me flat chess on and then if you put me pot chess on then well how much time do you have it would be a tight squeeze Oh no, poor Kirby. Big fast smash is huge. What is happening? What am I watching? <laughs> big fast special smash. What about oh. it? Oh. It's big and fast. Big is that fast. not what you want from your Smash Bros. content? Chad, press 1 if you would play big fast smash in brackets. <laughs> Chad, press 2 if press you Press 1 fun. if you want to play big melee. Big, uh, big fast. Not uh, any, uh... Yeah, big... I'm good. You still want to play Mario No, I'm good. So, um... I'm sure we'll get a match eventually. Something fun, something really vile at the census. Chat type one if you love Bass Pro Shop and you want to see uh, see a sponsored. Okay. Alright, we're getting meat flap chess. This is gonna be a long one, potentially. I said vomit all day or vomit. Uh, lazy Zack would be a long one, and that was a decently fast three. It's a hell of a tag, vomit. Yeah, vomit and meat flapping are two Shoto players. Is insane. Makes sense. I wonder who Meatflap's gonna play, because it definitely feels like Shoto's would lose to uh, Min Min, who Jess is probably gonna play. But I don't know, I don't, I'm not a scientist or expert on Meatflap yet. Ten! Min Min, let's see what we got. I imagine this matchup is a lot of uh, jump mix ups, like just like every Min Min matchup is, but. Specifically, if you get hit off stage, you probably just die if you're, if you're at a decent high percent, so gotta watch out. Here we're gonna have a crazy entertaining match. High Octane. High Octane? Oh, we got some down tilt shockers. Not I don't know. Wow, there's somebody to get Tatsu with no one. Oh my oh god, you're dead? God. You have to air dodge that combo, but like, yeah, I wasn't expecting that to hit jump. 
Probably direct from their nuts to light there, but that killed thoroughly. And I, I've, I've only seen uh, meat flap bods, but yeah. man. He has. Plant! Is he asleep? Is he? I don't know. His beeper's going off. Can you tap him on the shoulder? Your beeper. <laughs> Sorry, your chat. We had a bit yeah. of a sleeper in the venue here. He has his food was ready. Very silly day today. That didn't work. It's time to buff him. I don't know what to say. I haven't been looking much at neutral, but Mephods is getting the big opening for more. Yo, yeah, sausage pizza, that's sick. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, I mean... Yes, please, I am tired as shit. No, no offense to you, but I'm gonna follow the game. Alright. This is Maya on the mic. Uh, as you can all see, Chess is scared as fuck, holy shit. You can see Chess like every single time, like they're running for the corner every single time. A little bit? Alright, I'll think about it. Um, so, basically... <laughs> um, yeah, no. Chess like... Chess keeps running to like the corner to try to fight uh, Meat Flap like from there, but then whenever they get cornered, they just roll into the center. And I feel like uh, Meat Flap is already starting to call out a lot of uh, Chess's movement because of that. Like, you can tell like, if they're not in the corner, they're gonna roll out. They're gonna try to like, you know, keep their distance, but Meat Flap, uh, as a faster character, you can uh, just start like running up and just scrapping with Min Min, who definitely does not have the best scrapping options. And Ken actually does not really struggle to like get in either because of um, Nair coming with arms. And you can see like Meat Flap, yeah, this is already gonna be it. Frame two up till it just, you know, combos into death at pretty much whatever percent you feel like it. Um, yeah. In the game one going very solidly to Meat Flap. I'm pretty sure uh, we might see a switch from Chess because I know that Chess does also play Steve. But, you know. Yeah, I mean, Meat Flap took the stock at 6%. So at the beginning, Chess yeah. was already at a big disadvantage. Disadvantage, yeah, for sure. Um, yeah. Um, wait, can I not see chat? I want to see chat. Hey, wait, my bad. But yeah. Um, yeah, we're just gonna have to see. I'm pretty. Sh I'm pretty sure we're gonna see a switch here, though. I mean, Ken Steve is like definitely better for Steve than Min Min, probably. Yeah, Enderman. Yeah, you could hear that from the live screen. So yeah. Now this could all depend on what stage they actually go to, because um, small battlefield. Yeah, no, that's a fairly neutral stage. Low ceiling, so both of them can kind of get kills earlier. Uh, Steve has platforms to stop jump ins. Meat flap. Um, yeah, no. Yep. This. Yep. I mean, this is pretty much standard Steve gameplay. Uh, you know, as a former Steve player myself, I definitely can analyze this pretty well. Nice reverse Nair. That Nair uh, sends forward no matter where you go. So, yeah, I know Meat Flap just kind of pressing whatever the fuck, whatever that, you know, um, whatever the heck he feels like it. And then, you know, just probably combos together, you know? Um, yeah, so 75% on Meat Flap. Chess is trying to make as much distance as possible, but Meat Flap is just running in. Chess feels, oh, that's going to be a shield break? That's not going to be a shield break. Um, I think if the moves were slightly less staled, then it could have been one, but I'm pretty sure, uh, you know, uh, since Meat Flap's been kind of like, you know, using a lot of buttons, uh, you know, calling everything. That, um, that micro was very, very ill-advised. Meat Flap was clearly, um, like, you know, waiting it out. That was a good show you. Uh, Chess, like, <laughs> staying, like, you know, Meat Flap's just staying, like, so on top of uh, Chess's movement. Do you have any comments to make here? No. Alright, so I got it. Um, alright. Let's see. Down throw, dash attack. I mean, yeah, you can't really do much at that percent, so. Yeah, forward air up smash. Alright. Um, uh, Meat Flap not jumping in, you know. Uh, as someone who plays chess a lot, I know that chess likes building walls with the intention of doing like short hop backer or full hop backer to uh, preemptively call out jumps, but Meat Flap seems to just be waiting, and yeah, you're just gonna call out the. You're just gonna catch the landings, and uh, you know. Who's this? 
<laughs> who you are. Yeah, what's up? I didn't expect when I said could I hop on comms for them to just swap out instantly, but... Yeah, uh, no, they, they retired. Um, yeah, so yeah. Uh, so I heard Chess got cooked the game one. Chess got kind of farmed, and he, they're kind of getting a little he, bit farmed. Now he's right Steve. Now. I've never seen Chess play, let alone as Steve. Chess as so. Steve is like interesting. I don't know. I I think you said it was at, like as good as Dirt Dogs earlier or something. I did not say it was as good as Dirt Dogs. Someone, Dirt Dogs definitely has like the mental game to go with um, play? playing Steve. Oh, Chess um yeah. definitely like you know. Has a good defensive game, but tends to crumble whenever uh, they have to scrap up close. Like, yeah. Yeah. And you can see, like, they're running away. They're, run they're running out of resources because they just cannot counter scraps, like, yeah. uh, meat flaps, like, at all. They're they, just have a, run yeah. they have a lead here, though, so. They uh, do have a lead, but I don't know how they're going to take the stock. Yeah. I, they're kind of just minecarting and then getting hit and good running SPI. away. Oh, that downer. Yeah, you got yeah. by the downer. You just got to, like, you got to take that up. You were you were cooking gate the earlier. You just got to learn how to like pressure um, blocks when a uh, chest isn't going to be like preemptively going for those um going for those uh back that smash true? That F smash was not true. That's, That's like, gonna be it though. Oh, miss input. Oh, hot Hadouken. That's definitely gonna that hurt. Definitely, that was definitely supposed to be a sure. That's definitely supposed to be sure you because that would have killed um Chess going for up. Not going for an up smash. Um. Yeah, nice back air. Unfortunately, he hits a trade, so um, yeah, you're not gonna get. Chess quite. is completely out of materials, but I Chess is has, out of materials. He has oh. two diamonds now. Up smash is gonna hit. Gonna take it. I think Chess. Yeah, no, yeah, I don't. I don't know if Meepla tried to air dodge in or something, but like, yeah, you just gotta like. So obviously, the Steve did something that the Min Min didn't. No, uh, yeah, definitely Steve had a. Uh, Meepla was uh, Chess was actually able to play the runaway game a lot better. Like, yeah. Uh, calling out. Like, it kind of feels weird compared to Min Min when Min Min can run away so easily with his arms. No, nah, because. Ken's Nair can clank with all Oh, yeah. Really well. Ken's yeah. Nair does just clank with everything in the game. And Min Min's uh, scrapping is just, like, really, really, really not good compared to Steve, who has, you know, jab up till yeah. um, stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, we're going to have to see what adjustments uh, Meat Flap's going to make. I think as, I think um, when you just start, like, trying to play more, like, unreactively, I guess, like, around walls, like, doing tilts and then special canceling them into whatever... Instead of like trying to do uh, jump ins that chest yeah. can react to and like you know just because all the shotos can special cancel off of the block right yeah which yep. is pretty cool and minecart yeah I, I know Terry can do some things off of that just like yeah. just hit a block and then crack shoot or just they're going to FD so oh I think off that now you could have low key gotten um oh sour spot down now that's unfortunate. Yeah, no, yeah you're gonna, you have to story after that. Yeah. Meat flap with a very early lead. That was very good. I FD, I know that uh Chess does not have a problem. Chess, like as a speed player, um for some reason doesn't have a problem going to FD, even though in my opinion that's just not that good for speed, whatever. Um But Ken, Shoto's very, very solid against this uh on FD because you can uh, jump in so much easier against like you know, walls and stuff because okay yeah. Me flap uh I mean chess has to go for so many more like preemptive options. To like uh, react to jump in, this could be bad. Tries to go for a downer again. I think you probably just are better going for like back air or something out of that uh, crescent kick. Yeah, I've seen back airs like that mix up DI the because they right because you're holding out for sure. You yeah, and I've seen that kill at like 50 yeah. is ridiculous. Oh, that's that could have been the stock, I mean, not the stock, but a uh, solid amount of damage. Like but uh, yeah, drops it. Meatflap, okay, I think Meatflap needs to recognize that Chess is not reacting to uh, what no. uh, Meatflap's doing whenever he, they go for those back airs. Chess is also going for a lot of approaching minecarts. Right, those aren't very good against Ken who has like, you know, those frame what, like frame uh, really early uh, Shoryu in yeah. ability. Yeah, like yeah. trying to go for that there, unfortunately. That was a, a good idea. Late. I think definitely just work on that because see, sure. there's another one. It, it's kind of just every time Chess has uh, played, that was not every approach option yeah, is the minecart. Uh, thankfully, doesn't die for it. So uh, yeah, you're definitely like a lot. So, uh, yeah, you know, you gotta, you can, you can definitely show you in between those hits. So uh, oh what? No. That was definitely. I don't know if that was a miss input or what, but um, yeah, chess. You cannot be letting um, me flap. You cannot be letting that happen. Back air, no back air. Uh, okay, me flap. Don't, don't be approaching. Steve already has dime. You have no reason to just like. Yeah. I, I know how Meatflap really likes to go for um, drop shield down tilt because even if, so, if something's safe on shield, then they can just pull. Oh. Chess always thinks they're so smart for doing that wall bounce shit. Yeah, get out. Yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah. Talk. yeah, that wall bounce shit is so annoying. Nah, bro. Every single time we were playing friendly, they'd be talking about no, that. Philbot does it too. Yeah. Um, yeah. And talk nothing ever edge. comes from it. Don't jump over. The, don't jump over the walls. Uh, meet, you wait until uh, you have to wait until like oh uh, that back air. Oh my god, that didn't kill. 
Yeah, oh, that, that, that angle though. is weird. That yeah. looked like it was a spike. Yeah, the um the minecart like it combined the angles with yeah. a forwarder. Nice. Forward smash? Don't forward. Yeah, forward smash is just not connecting. Nice. Ooh, nice. Catching the retreat. Um we're gonna see uh can meet. Nice, oh. okay. Nair? Oh, up air. Oh. Tries to go for upper short to close out the stock, but unfortunately doesn't work out. Um one down tilt or up tilt though is just gonna be Yeah, one up tilt up tilt jab sure you, down tilt, down tilt. I don't know if uh, I don't know if down tilt sure you will take it yet, but um Focus. Fo yeah, I mean focus. You get uh, you, you not don't really good. Want to approach it, but... Oh, yeah. Uh, if you guys didn't know, Chess uh, it doesn't really lapse these combos like that, so they don't get the. Oh, this could. That's it. Oh, oh wait, no. Too that far was away not... for the regular. Oh wait, this could be so bad. Oh wait, never mind. That's it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Meepot takes game two. Like, yeah, game three. Game two. No. Game three. Game three. Game three. <laughs> I forgot about that minute game because that shit was so quick. That was so quick. Sorry. But I'm trying. Meepot takes game three. That was. A nail biter at the end. I don't For know. Sure. Chess was kind of just bringing that back, but yeah, Steve's damage outputs really yeah, strong as everyone yeah. knows. Obviously, so. without having that those labbed Steve routes, it's gonna be a lot harder to take those stocks and get those percent, right. that percent. Mm -hmm. Even though you can still get a ton of percent without having it labbed, like you already got like what 50 percent off, like up air, up air, up air, forward air. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, just being able to do at least like nil ones can get you a good 60, 70 percent. Yeah, which I don't think Chess even knows how to do. No. Except he's 2300 rated on beat chest. They are here. Yeah. But the chest tag probably gonna go Steve again. That was so close. Yeah, for sure. You're definitely gonna go. Uh, Not Steve gonna again. go Min Min. Not banning FD, so I'm pretty sure. Wait, did they go FD again? I think they did. No, I think it was Battlefield. Was it Battle? Ugh. I know that. Because there's DSR, so. I don't I mean, think. Oh, is there D There is DSS. Yeah, Battlefield. I don't know how good of a DID it is for Chess. Um, for me, Pop, I mean. You have, uh, you have so much more. Okay, good. Special canceling off the box is good, but you're, you're like, so limited in your jumping ability because of, uh, what's it called? The platforms. Oh. Rock, paper, scissors, right? Is it on stage? Wait, when am I? I gotta play. Go do your RPS. Can you yeah. come get me when Maya? Yeah, solo commentary. Oh, chess takes that. Yeah, yeah solo that's commentate. Game, chess, chess, you got yeah, me. Maya's going. Go yeah, tell me when mine mine is. All right. Okay. Well, there's a rock paper scissors tournament, which I think is really funny. But both of us commentators were entered in it, and they're doing it on the big stage out here. I don't know if it's best of three or best of one. I haven't looked at it at all. It was just two dollars. So, <laughs> but me flaps has a huge lead here. Oh, that is a. Okay, that was nuts. Didn't even have to do the good the good angle of up B. I'll probably be called out for rock, paper, scissors in a minute here. But we got Ryan here joining on comms. But meat flap here, yeah, Chess is already at a hundred percent. A down tilt here or an up tilt's gonna take the stock. But a couple games ago Chess made a pretty good comeback. Oh, that up smash was not the option to go for there. You could have gotten at least 20% more off an off kill. Matt, put up air. Okay, we got a Ryan here on comms. You might want to get a little closer to the mic, but that, yep, that sure he's going to take it. Is, my, is, it, is it my game? What <laughs> no? When do I play? Okay. I think that we definitely we definitely we definitely need to ban scissors. I, I think that I think scissors is way too powerful an option in this meta. Is it best of three? Yeah. Okay. It's single elimination too. Yes, yeah, that's awesome. Okay. Yeah. No. I. Uh, yeah. Meat flap kind of just looks poisoned. Wait. What happened? It's not. Uh, I mean, it, meat flap's just been cooking. Really? Meat been cooking. So, I think meat flap's definitely poised to win this. Yeah. But, I mean, meat flap's all but won this set already. This huh? is a huge uh, lead for this for meat flap right here. Yeah. But, I mean. If you guys didn't know, me and me and Meat Flap used to be playing all the time, so we definitely got that uh, got but that I, Steve experience. Of you and Meat Flap look a little different. Yeah, no, I mean, I I, I obviously cook Meat Flap because I'm just the best player in the world. So um, oh okay, that was that. Oh, that, was, that was good. I don't. Oh, yeah, you, call, you, call, you yeah, you call out the rolls away. You just yeah, Meat Flap. I mean, you have so many chances to call out movement for the rest of the set. Okay, yeah, there was they're no just, block there. Test is not. But maybe there's no blocks. Yeah, I don't know why they're not maybe pushing this, there. Uh, proves that Steve does not need any tech to view. True. I mean, I don't know about that. Uh, Meepop is getting a little bit impatient. They really want the set to be over. Up smash? Yeah, you can't. Meepop nice. does not know how to tech that. See, the battlefield ceiling actually coming into kind of oh, a huge play. Uh, that's it. 
Dude, huh. Chess could bring this back. He has diamond, so. They do have diamond, yeah. Okay, B5 is, Chess is really just, oh, tries to call out that roll. Nice reaction to that yeah. roll, but unfortunately. Yeah, they have diamond, so, I mean, one okay. up to ladder and then no you don't you don't in this situation you don't you don't let them you don't you let them get their materials let them get yeah. materials and just wait for a minecart wait for a bad like option they have, and then you just call it out in the wind yeah they have rage so if you approach it could just end up with that if they get one oh this is not good for it okay for that oh my god no okay, tech on. there no roll this is a back air here is gonna kill at this a back air is going to kill in the corner not center stage quite not, but not right here but yeah that's gonna be it yeah yeah okay good job to meet flap me flap taking that. Yeah, no. Chess definitely that was great. Was that was almost an insane comeback. But here, yeah, I'm gonna pass my mic to Con uh, to our Ryan. All right. What? Here, Ryan, get on here. I'll wait for my rock paper scissors. Wait, I thought we were doing. Huh? I thought we were Press cooking with time. commentary. Whatever. No, I know, but or I, you kind of, I didn't want a Ryan to get. Unfortunately. Like just one game. So if we want to. Like 30 seconds. Yeah, like 30. <laughs> yeah, like 30, like one stock. So maybe, Not even. maybe after the next set, oh, we can get back on. True. I'm gonna go. Do I still listen to the people like this? Yes. 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 I don't think I will. How was your doubles run? It was it was amazing. I'm just you know the best doubles player in the world. Unfortunately, um, my bestie Twain could not clutch up with me, so didn't get top eight. Unfortunately, but you know, much respect. I miss you, Derp Dog. Come back. <laughs> no, it was fun watching you two play. It was pretty cool. Me and Quinn. Yeah. yeah, it was fun. Good stuff to meet Flap though. I mean, we're gonna probably end up seeing uh, Dadzy against Lazy back now. Okay. I, I, I mean, I'm assuming so. Julian, yeah. All right. I know. Uh, I know there's a uh, cream drip kind of going on on a off stream set. Oh, is this the? Is this a bracket set? Okay. I think so. I yeah, I know that Kareem has uh, historically been like just very solid against uh, Drip and Mario in general, so I could definitely just see... Uh, I, I mean, I'm assuming that Kareem might just take it, but I mean, you never know. Drip is definitely uh, capable of like, you know, oh, pulling some crazy advantage. There. That might have taken it. They cannot see what's going on, but we can tell you that uh, the set is looking like a nail. Gotcha. Hey, everyone. Hi, Hiss. You got a pizza? Yes, please. Thank you. I will take this. To be honest, the food here is like super expensive. But yeah, it's, it is. It's kind of worth it. But I get, I get free food, so I will always take free food. Hey, everyone. Uh, eat his flushed up, so shout out to eat his. <laughs> Like its last stock on that drip. Uh, mm. I think game. is cream at two stocks. I think cream is at two. Oh, cream three right? stocks. Oh crap. Mm -mm. <laughs> drip that two cream that three. <laughs> this just in scissors is overpowered and rock paper mm -hmm. scissors. That's what I'm saying. Too, too good for it. Too much. Uh, there's no lag on shield. Hmm. Frame data is just absolutely insane. I think it's a little bit toxic for our community. We gotta we gotta rise up and ban scissors from the Smash Ultimate community. Low key, Smash Brothers is just a lot of RPS. It really kind of is. Like, it, I mean, it's a little bit of an oversimplification, but like, when you really get down to it, it is just a series of like action responses. You know? Yeah, like. <laughs> There's no reactions, there's just like, there are some situations in some characters where you just like genuinely have to play like, oh, this option beats this, which loses to this option, which beats the first option, which yeah. loses to the first option. Oh, absolutely. Like Samus, you know? Samus is absolutely one of those characters. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it's just, it's hard to get around projectiles, especially as a... <laughs> Mm -hmm. Hey, let's go. Much love. Oh, 
we got Sorry coming up. Sorry, I know that Sorry um is did beat Barb Nation and losers after Barb Nation made a pretty clutch ass run, uh, clutch run uh, beating um, Taco Guy and All Day. Oh wow! Yeah, those are two really good wins. Yeah, I mean, out of like the uh, Arcadian members, they're definitely like one of the top, they're definitely like top ten seats. I'm fairly certain. Oh, so yeah, those are definitely some upsets that we were happy to see. I mean, I've been practicing with Barb Nation a lot. I've been going out to the kids' place and just like practicing, like helping them. So you know, it's all just me. You know, I'm just the best coach in the world. It's nice to see some upsets like that, though. Yeah. Uh, it really shows that people have. Uh, I test. Ken is broken. We already know. I'm sorry. It's fine. I should have just stayed in the middle. Yeah, maybe. I think Ken got a mess with her up, though. Huh? If Nair, cl Nair claims with the arm, and then he runs it, and then it's just like... And then wins, you know? Yeah, no, no. Ken definitely does a lot better than Ryu. Yeah, so I agree. I didn't realize that until yeah. yesterday, so... You know, you got, uh, we got Violet from uh, I, I absolutely Minnesota. understand that. Uh, Ridley's entire game plan against Ken is sit on ledge. Yeah. Wait for him to make a mistake and then capitalize and then go right back to ledge. That's it. It's, it's unfortunate. Uh, yeah, so like that sorry. That's a Pyramither player, also plays Joker and sometimes Zelda. So, yeah, whoever their opponent is is definitely going to be a uh, very big snooze fest, unfortunately, because, wow, three boring characters that I can yeah, that's a really awesome tag. I don't know who that is, though. I forgot. It's awesome. Grace. He is. Are you going to eat that one? Thanks. Oh, who's Sori waiting for? I don't know. Hmm? Huh? Oh, come mm. That Rosa player. Yeah, the Rosa. Hey, yo. I ain't no. Yeah, Rosa. Uh, from, from Iowa. Iowa. Yeah, beat Orable, who, uh, who was yeah, yeah, the no, first seed. It's been a hot minute since I've seen a good Rosa play. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think the last I mean, interesting thing in winners. I like the set. The last set I watched that had a good Rosa was Debuzz, and I don't remember who it was. But yeah, Debuzz, Debuzz like played at Summit. What? Debuzz like called Luma back and wave landed. And Luma landed like right on ledge and he up smashed and yeah, killed no, the guy. Up. <laughs> it's like, oh no. my god. Luma is just mm -hmm. better ice climbers. Literally. <laughs> it's no. it's that... Popo with better AI and it response. Nana? Or Nana, yeah, sorry. I'm not nice, he's good. The thing about Rosa is that they kind of play like. They play, he plays like a 40, but if you try to clank with Luma, then you get put in hit lag and then she just hits you for it. And yeah. it's like really. Really obnoxious to be here, like when she's playing defensively. Yeah, no, absolutely. Sometimes even harder to get in, just because like you really can't grab Rosa, mm -hmm. or like you can't pummel at the very least. Uh, Sometimes you can just like run up shield the entire game and then play off that. And up yeah, there. no, literally, it's it's something interesting. It's always nice to see a Rosa though, because Rosas aren't really. Super I mean, it makes sense. She's kind of a hard character. I don't think she's bad at all, but she's definitely difficult. There are definitely different options that people are more comfortable with. Mm -hmm. All right, starting the game. I don't know what's. Well, they're just doing a button check. Oh, for sure. We're uh, <laughs> watching a CPU game, I think. Yeah. In other words, uh, Drip has gone Greninja against Kareem. I think Kareem took game one. Alright, we're getting going here. Kazuha? Kazuya? Can I say Kazuya for the rest of the set? I'm gonna say Kazuya. Is it Kahuza? It's Kahuza. Kazuya? Okay. Kahuza. Kahuna. Kahuna Laguna. Good to know. 
Kahuna Laguna. It, it is a, it's an interesting tag. I haven't seen something spelled like that in a while. Kahuna. Mithra. From Fire Emblem or something. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Hey chat, how's my commentary? Am I the best commentator in the world yet? Number three, next to who? You got it. <laughs> A good wood. Let's go. This is gonna be an interesting matchup. Uh, yeah, Pyro Mithra against the first. Pyro Mithra is kind of able to bully Luma, but, yeah. but at the same time. Uh, Rosa can kind of chase pretty deep. Yeah. I'm kind of interested in seeing how uh, Kazuha's, Kazuha's going to actually play this. Oh, me, <laughs> dang. Unfortunately, doesn't get the Nair off stage, which would have totally killed uh, Luma. But, you know. So we can see uh, Sore trying to just, like, get Luma off stage while also, like, dealing with Rosa. Okay. I think I kind of get... Yeah. So... Yeah, Ka Kazuha's uh, game... Oh, that was a really oh, good overshoot yeah. grab from Sean. I mean... Sean isn't a bad player by any means. Definitely a good, like, especially, like, they play uh, Project M mostly now, I think. But, uh, you know, they play the easiest character in Smash Ultimate, so it doesn't really matter. But you got, you know, the Project M fundamentals, like, you know. Uh, but now you're fighting an ultimate character. What the heck was that? That would nice be Luma Jank. Jank. Yeah. I love Luma Jank. Yeah, so um, I can we can definitely see uh, Sean struggling to actually uh, break the distance between uh, Rosa and Luma. Because... Um, yeah, you get punished for trying to actually hit Luma, but then you try to get between them, and then you get anti air because you have to jump in. Yep. Tries to down air that, unfortunately gets reversed by the up air, but at least it wasn't anything like the back air. Nice forward tilt. Really taken. Yep. You can see probably a down air. Yeah, no, you cannot be down airing like that. You're just going to get shield grabbed, and then... Oh, I trap. respect yeah. it. No, this ledge trap loses to get up attack, so you actually shouldn't be doing that. Um, unless you think they're going to do literally anything besides get an attack, but there really isn't any reason to do that. Yeah, so, nice down tilt from the Rosa. I think what Kahuza was going for there was to try and get uh, Luma slightly off stage and just drag Ooh. Sean into the blast zone. Right, right, like yeah, that. That, like that. But, I forgot about that. Uh, didn't that. space it correctly, unfortunately. Yep. But, I mean, yeah, I know that. Oh. Ooh, fourth throw off the that was good, yeah. You could have, like, ooh. ooh. That up is huge. What? Okay, nice forward. Yeah, from uh, Sore. Sore playing actually really well today. I'm, like, kind of impressed. Very patient. Yeah. I mean, it might just be Pyro Mithra, because that character's a little silly. But... Alright, yeah. Um... You really have to kind of pick your openings with uh, Rosa Luna. Nice down smash. I caught the air dodge, and I'm pretty cool. Oh, never mind. Not catching the points, unfortunately, so... Nice up smash, yeah. This time the this time the landing attack. Yeah, for sure. Sean uh, tried to just get a reversal with down air into something. Fortunately, didn't work out. Um, oh, that's unfortunate. You really wanted that kill down down air forward smash. Unfortunately, not connecting. Um, Unfor but you I did mean, get it on that Luma. That Luma, that Luma is gone. Yeah. That Luma is dead. He's like 100%. Oh, tries to catch an air I dodge. Nice. Good spot dodge. Yeah, good spot dodge. Ooh. If I were to the story, I definitely would prefer dash back there, but that berry is definitely going to take that. So, um, yeah, I mean, last dog, 0% each. This is just like... It's a reset. Yep. Up tilt, back air. Yep, nice. That was just like, you know, a good impromptu good combo. 30%. Yeah, you just got to take everything you can get. Uh, nice. I'm actually surprised we haven't seen much of uh, Blazing End coming from uh, Sorry, because, I mean, you can definitely see, like, the hitbox is getting extended on the Luma and, like, making it harder to actually, like, roll out and stuff. Mm -hmm. Nice! Ooh. That could be... That's no, not going to be... Yeah, okay, yeah, 60 per, like, well, like... It was definitely, yeah, it's definitely a, little a bit high damage level. combo, though. Yeah, no, for sure. Now we might... Uh, yeah, down air up smash is definitely going to kill here, so... Ugh, tries to catch some sort of, like, spot dodge or out of field option, but unfortunately, Luma can out. That job is going to be... That's going to hurt to get hit yeah. by. You took a lot of damage from that, and... Okay, Sori is definitely looking for a downer, which you don't want to see, like, fishing for, because... Especially against Rosa. Right, who can just, like... 
just so easily punish you just like mashing by hitting Luma and then it's like yeah you get off stage you just like could just die at any time nice side B feels like a, it would be a good wall against uh, what Rosa does oh, and that was a bad forward hit out of field that gets punished by that forward smash yeah and so it's going to take game one it was a very well spaced down for sure and this is a best of five so this is top eight okay cool losers yeah losers semis no idea actually Oh, okay. Cool. But it's the best of five? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm assuming so. I mean, yeah, it's top eight, so. Kazuha, I think, uh, you need to make some, like, minor adjustments to, like, Really? What? Drama. Uh, Shoutouts to my buddy Scone. Uh, back when I was in Bemidji area, uh, he played Rosa for a while. So it's always cool to see another Rosa around. Yeah, shout outs to nobody because I know nobody that plays Rosalina. <laughs> nice throw. F throw up smash. Yeah, throw up smash. I'm surprised that actually does such little damage. I thought you'd get like more damage from a throw to a smash attack, but. Yeah, I'm assuming it's just it's Luma's hit. Yeah. It's yeah, for sure. Rosalina does do more damage on every move, but then Luma has the one which is the one with the knockback, so yeah, definitely makes sense. Nice up smash. Um, Decent trade. Yeah. Sean giving up a little bit of stage position here. Luma's playing like Luma is literally just the whole character that's like that you can put wherever you feel like it. Like this character, I don't know how people play. Yeah, oh, that's unfortunate. SD from, uh, sorry, I I don't know like what exactly like. I mean, she definitely has the flaws that like, are very clear. She's floaty, her disadvantage isn't good. She doesn't have a hitbox on her recovery. So, like, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, nice. Uh, you do reverse that. Uh, oh, great to get, DI. Yeah, good DI on that up. I mean, that up has a really bad angle, anyways. Like, you go to the corner pretty much by itself. Nice True. job. All right. Oh, I respect the attempt. Nice forward there. Dash tag, yep, sends Luma barely off stage. That was very lucky. Gets dash grabbed out of shield. Ooh, tries to go for a uh, oh. down air, but unfortunately doesn't pan out your problem. Okay, ledge jump. Okay, I'm surprised. I was definitely expecting a uh, ledge roll from there, uh, a ledge jump from there, but uh, nice. Yeah, you jump there. You have to catch the landing. Rosalina's uh, fall speed is actually um, one of the worst in the game because her gravity is actually the lowest, which makes sense considering she's a space, space creature. Yeah. Nice edge guard. Side B down. Make the back though. Okay, okay, okay. I think let drop side B, uh, let drop backer would have definitely uh, killed right there, but I think uh, it was just a little, you know, panic. Rosa down air is absolutely terrifying off stage. For sure, it lasts it stays a long out time. forever. Yeah, and even if you get hit by just Luma, then it has like really high knockback, so you just die to it. Yes. Yeah. Yep, side B, that was a good idea. I mean, I don't think I don't think Kazuha knows you can uh, roll out really early and just start pressing. Oh. Wait, that was weak. What? Did you see that? That, that hit and it, it was, was a like really, it was a sour thing. spot. Yeah. But it went like pretty much up. That's strange. This, Sean's yeah. doing a very good job at denying yeah. Luma. For sure. I mean, I think that just comes from, that just uh, comes from playing uh, Pyra more. Pyra has a lot more, uh, you know, knockback. High, yeah. yeah. You know. High damage options as well. Oh, tries uh, to go for some fluid stuff to avoid having to side view the but unfortunately doesn't pan out. Nice, yeah. I do think that Mithra might, like, at the end of the day, be the better option against this character because you have a uh, stuff like Nair who's going to like be really hard to challenge on Steel, even though it might not do much to Rosalina herself. You're gonna get free hits on like uh, Luma. So yeah, but I oh, no, absolutely. Yeah, uh, I don't think Son uh, believes so though. Rip that Luma. Yeah, Luma is key. Side bet. I got five dollars for the next one's gonna be a blue one. Let's see. Nice it's oh, not. Oh, that's position. unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> I lost five money. Unfortunate. <laughs> but <laughs> I already gave you my money. <laughs> Luma got knocked off stage. No attempt to recover it. He yeah. couldn't get up attack though. Yeah, oh, you can't actually recover Luma. If she gets sent off stage even a tiny bit, she's just key. Oh, gotcha. Trying to neutral B. Oh, nice neutral B. Neutral B is really good at covering pretty much everything besides get up attack. So like sometimes you kind of use it when they're actually using their uh, option, and you'll get like a weak version. Oh, that grab. Yeah. 
Sorry. It's not good. Ooh, that up air was definitely ambitious. Um, you don't want to be doing that, especially when you're like going so hard, far above stage. So, yeah. Ooh, Luma is already killed. That's crazy. Alright. Sorry is doing a fantastic job of just denying Luma. Yeah, just not getting hit. Oh, what? Oh, no, no so that's so unfortunate. Yeah. You gotta so just go deep. back to stage. You, yeah. Kazuha, no, that you, that you, uh, that Mithra just couldn't, like, go any higher. Yeah. He so just recovered high. Just kinda, he floated backwards. And yeah, for sure. And then, uh, yeah, Sean kind of overextended and killed. But, I mean, Respect the attempt to edge guard. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's really unfortunate. Yeah, for that sure. That timing is I think, uh, as poor as it was. Honestly, uh, or... Sora was definitely playing a lot better than the beginning of the game, so I think it's going to like start playing a little bit more patient, using Mithra a lot more to like abuse her speed and burst options. Um, so definitely, like I think it'll work more in uh, his favor. Okay, yeah, so the fire already. Uh, just have to, oh, nice. Good. The back air, beating out the. And Luma's gone already. Yeah, Luma is gone. You definitely don't want to be like. Going off stage, I think if you get reversed by like a back air or something like that, it could definitely spell out death for uh, someone with such a bad recovery as a higher mid throw. Yeah. Nice back air. Really odd back. angle from that. For sure. That down air. Nice down tilt. Up air, unfortunately, you had good DI for a. So, unfortunately, for a story, because uh, it was not inside of that. I think. Um, down air Sora's really efficient for that down air. For sure. I think, yeah, no, you definitely have to, like, adjust that. Like, you don't need to hit down airs. You just want to, like, make them know that you can go for the down air and then start tomahawking, start, like, landing with the uh, neutrally, I think, as well. It's, like, a really good option. Conditioning one for shield. Yeah. Or, like, try to parry it or whatever. Yeah, for sure. Nice dash attack. Uh, so, of course, we're getting edge guarded, so... You know, he's losing the stock. Oh, wake up down smash. That's definitely not a good idea. Nice down air. Go for a side B to maybe cover it? No. Oh, that was a very nice idea. Yeah. For sure. Um, oh, okay, yeah, no, because uh, unfortunately going a little bit too low. Alright. Up he's really, really high up. I don't know how good of an idea that. Oh, wait, do you not have a jump? Ooh, no, nope. that doesn't do it. Yeah, no, they had a jump. If they didn't have a jump, so yeah. that would have been a little silly. Oh, uh, what? That Luma is That Luma is killed, but that Rosalina, of course, got a couple hits in it. I mean, Luma doesn't take percent when Rosa does, so... Yeah, I mean, I don't know how worth it that was. Uh, yeah, we can definitely see a couple uh, really good adjustments from Kazuha. Um, you know, being a little bit more patient and sweet. And shield against uh, what's his name? Sorry. I'm not sure if Rosa's uh, like projectile absorption really works against. Yeah, no. Um, it w it might absorb it if you went like the projectile that could be thrown, but once the moves out, it is not a projectile. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, this could be it. That's, that's definitely going to be it. Yeah, that's like uh, PS2 has a really really high low blast zone, <laughs> so. Um, yeah, you're just gonna die to spikes like really early. Yeah, PS2 is a very unforgiving stage when it comes For to sure. lower blast zones. I definitely think that we'd want to see a um, a like better stage option from uh, Sore. Um, I think having a large space allows Rosalina to just like disengage with Luma a lot more easily. Ooh, the mix up. What happened? So he's not playing. Uh, Zelda. Pit. Pit. I know that Pit was um. Uh, Sora is like old, regular pit was uh, Sora's like old main, um, so we could, this might, this might be cooking something, I have no idea, but I mean, yeah, up smash amp here, nice down throw, uh, fun fact, uh, Sora normally has a smash stick on for pit for whatever reason. Really? Yeah. Interesting. I suppose it does make a couple of pits combos a little bit easier to execute. Maybe. But I'm unsure. I don't... Neutral get upside B, that is definitely a classic that Story likes to make fun of, because, you know, it's really funny with armor, reflector, whatnot. Really strong, too, so... Absolutely. Yeah. Great dash attack. Yeah, good dash attack from... Uh, can you... Yeah, you can definitely recover from the pit recovery. goes really far. Doesn't have a hitbox. All right. Ooh. 
That was a good up smash. Uh, Rosalina's neutral bead when she like shoots Luma is actually um really safe on shield. Like it's really like uh, you can do pretty much anything before uh, your opponent can act. Like up tilt or like yeah up tilt jab whatever. You can just stuff out people's options That's with no harm. Yeah, with no risk to um. Rosalina herself, so even if you do get punished somehow, you're just like, killing. What is it? What is it? <laughs> Has me and Failbot popping off, do I want? I don't Oh, Failbot loaf money match, I'm assuming? Oh, loaf kind of sucks and lost. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I mean, you know, Failbot, you know, my, 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 uh, I'm like, you know, Failbot's biggest fan, so unfortunately I can, uh, I, I am very happy with this uh, outcome. Uh, top five locators in the world, number one me. <laughs> nice, uh, nice grab from, uh, what, what's his name? Sorry. Sorry, yeah. I have to stop forgetting names. Oh, what's my last day? Oh, that recovery that. is going to get hard punished. Yeah, that could definitely, what was, yeah, I don't know, like, you're going to definitely kind of lose some, some precious percent. Can't grab Luma. <laughs> cannot grab Luma, unfortunately. No matter how hard you want, no matter how badly you want to. Yeah, because it definitely looked like they made an adjustment after game one that just allowed them to like keep leads. Yeah, jump scare by Luma. <laughs> Luma jump scare. <laughs> Five minutes at Freddy. Oh, good and sorry, I think um. That's just going to kill. That's going to kill. Oh, never mind. Get out of it. Roll, roll out, roll out, roll out. Uh, you, why are you? You can't land on Luma. You either hit Luma and get hit by Rosa, or you die. There, there is no in between. Yeah. Oh, he tried to wait it out. You gotta disengage. Oh, good tech. Nice forward air. Yeah, catching that early. Yeah. Sure. This is undoable for Sore, but we're definitely gonna need to see some major adjustments to Absolutely. his uh, game plan. Oh, one of them are dead, but unfortunately, it's not really oh, good. That's not bad. Well, nice grab, neutral getup. You know, looks like the appealing option. Luma's not like threatening it directly, so you can just start like neutral getup. Oh my lord! At this point in time, Kazuha is just kind of waiting for. Yeah, the story did do anything. Yeah, Luma got killed. Unfortunate. I think the next. Uh, I think the next Luma is definitely going to be a blue one. Let's see. That was close. That was close. <laughs> it's another five bucks. Ooh. Yeah, unfortunately, I think this game is pretty close to over. Unfortunately, yeah. I, I don't mean to be Yeah, that jab. Oh, it didn't kill. In the end, literally anything could happen. Yeah. Because you have to get way too hungry for the kill. And oh, wait. Well, Luma is panicking. Could not find his uh, bestie Luma. Yeah. Smash will take it. Rosalina and Luma might be the best character in the game. What? <laughs> you know, they were better top ice climbers. Before, for real. <laughs> it's literally just better ice climbers. Yeah. Except you can actually control mana. <laughs> Top five most boring sets in the world, number one now. <laughs> Alright, you get to see uh, Lazy Zack and Dadzy. Um, I just want the whole world to know that I 3 0 Lazy Zack with Roy in a money match. So, a bad actually has to quit Smash Brothers because he cannot be Lazy Zack with Roy. So, um, yeah. Very nice. I don't think I've ever watched Lazy Zag play, but I know I've played a couple games against Dadzy. Dadzy's got a really good neutral sense. Yeah, Dadzy is definitely a solid, very solid player. He went to a tournament on Thursday and beat a bat and another PR player who I don't remember. Very good. Yeah. But, yeah, I can. I want to compensate this. Can I stay on for the rest of Top 8? You're replacing me and Grands with, and someone else here? Me and you and Grands, or you and someone else? Oh, sick. I'm more than happy to dip. I like this commentary. It's cool. I enjoy commentary as well. I'm just not super good at it. Yeah. <laughs> but how are yeah. you going to get better but improve? But, you know, practice, right. I suppose. <laughs> right. It's all a process. Same with learning and playing Smash. 
All right. Looks like we're starting out on Final Destination. <laughs> All right. Uh, game on an FD. Uh, I don't know why Dazzy is like so in love with this stage. I don't understand. Sonic, like every single time you jump against Sonic on this stage, you are like risking getting hit. But um, no, absolutely. Yeah, Sonic covers so much area, and you don't have platforms to mix up your approach. Um, He's also just super quick. Right. Um, okay, right now I, I can already tell that uh, like Dazzy is already hitting like uh, Zach Four trying to charge up spins in the corner when Dazzy's already way too close for him to like actually be able to react to Dazzy's movement. So um, yeah, nice back to call out the jump. Oh. Ooh, high frames on that up. He's saving Dazzy's ass once Absolutely. again. Lucina is literally the best character in the game. It's crazy. I don't know how people be losing with this character. It's whatever though. Nice uh, forward tilt a little bit. Yeah, you couldn't get punished by the uh, grab. So, Sonic's uh, movement is just so insane. He can right. in and out of a front sure. range in like half a second. While his dash isn't the best in the game, his run speed is. Oh, tries to call it that, uh, what's it called? That uh, roll with a uh, forward air, but unfortunately does not pan out. Up forward air is not going to take it. I wonder if Nair would have. If depth, I'm pretty sure like it would have, but you know, then I just gotta hold it. Yep. Does Sonic have anything that can contest Lucina on ledge? On ledge, not really. Forward tilt, kind of, maybe. I don't know. Getting down tilted by Lucina is so scary. You can get tag chased by down smash or like whatever. Oh, Side B is going to take the first stock. Sonic uh, is not very good at killing, so we're going to have to see how uh, Dazzy tries to go for some stock, but unfortunately throws out multiple first options in a row and none of them panned out. And you're already taking a quick 71%. You definitely do not like to see that happening, but um, you know, what can you do? Nice, yeah. Uh, ladies, that you gotta stop spinning while you're uh, getting hit by like first off skin. Yeah, no, you don't want to be doing that. Don't yeah, uh, down two stocks already. That's the I mean playing really really hot today. Absolutely. Great timing on that. Great. Nice carry, yeah. Yeah, no, I mean, Dazzy just has something about Zach figured out. That's actually really impressive. Yeah. That upper is very safe on shield. Um, that thing has not taken any percent. As you say that. <laughs> my fault. You know, we commentated first. Gotta be a little. You gotta be a little, you gotta be a little uh, silly with it. Uh, that yeah, no. Like, already trying smash, to get way too many uh, openings that you just don't have against Lucina. Tries to get that with punish with the uh, uh, forward smash. Unfortunately, did not pan out. Nice. Up air, those just aren't connecting. I mean, you can't really expect those to connect considering how far you are away. But, uh, you know, most Sonic mains will be like, oh man, my character is so bad. Why does an up air turn next? But it also seems uh, quite difficult to contest a character that has a sword. For sure. Uh, when you're a character that's hitboxes are your hurtboxes, basically. Yep, I agree. But a character like Sonic, who has such amazing speed and Lucina's like floatiness, should be able to whip punish a lot more. But unfortunately, Lady Zack is just jumping into a lot of attacks from uh, Dazzy. We can make a couple more adjustments, like stop spinning when Lucina's in burst range. And I think this could definitely go a lot more differently. Absolutely. Uh, Lady Zack did not take that game. You gotta change the set. You gotta change the layout. Hey, Dazzy won. Dazzy won. Ladies and did not take that game. Hey, yo. Hello. Thank you. Yeah, there we go. We're good. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, we got... Uh... What? What'd you say? Yeah, sorry. No, it's all good. All right. Yoshi's story. This is an interesting stage. Yeah, I can, I can definitely see... Nope, never mind. I can't see why. Um... <laughs> Well, Sonic has a wall jump, doesn't he? Sonic does have a wall jump, but I don't think... I don't think Lady Zack was really worrying about getting edge guarded. Up till yeah, Dazzy's advantage stage is just so solid, I don't know. Nice Great carry, carry. runoff up air, yeah. Oh my god, tries to go for a wave land into the grab, but... Lady Zack does not bite. Nice forward air. Ooh. Great air dodge. Lady Zack has not been hitting as many edge guards uh, at all during this uh, set, so... We definitely want to see something change about that change. That attack is down smash is going to take it. Is not going to take it. I mean, nice. That is some time where you can like for sure, uh, you know, 
make it ambiguous whether or not you're going to like be able to iframe through an attack machine that throws out. I don't know, maybe side because I've done something, but yeah. Thank you. Zach is playing very, very scared. And I don't know of what. Is it just side B? I mean, the threat of side B is there, but I don't think Dadsy has been throwing the lot nearly as much as he think he would. Oh, trying oh. to go for the shield break. Oh, it's a double supporter and unfortunately not connected. Yeah, that party's going to take it. That now, Lazy Zach with a lead. This definitely could be huge because the stock lead with Sonic is very, very huge. You can just choose like what moves you want to put yourself at risk of getting hit by. Yeah. And Lucina has such like few really solid kill options. That Sonic can just kind of like allow himself to get hit by like what up air, maybe like jab, forward tilt, whatever, but oh, not by counters. anything else. That counter was really, 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 really not. Good. Not well timed. Not well It was not awful, well Dazzy. Uh, yeah. Nice. This, these spins puzzle. are good. These spins are good. Like, You're spins where Lucina just physically cannot get into the burst range to actually um, contest them before you can throw out the spins, and like your iframes can uh, go through anything of Lucina's options. Those are spins that you want to do. Spins where Lucina is able to just dancing blade, run up forward smash, run up like whatever. Those are ones that you don't want to throw out. And Lazy Zack is definitely making those adjustments right now. Nice. Oh, great down Power down air is going to take it. I don't know if that was a miss input or what, but that definitely did something. You um, take those. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> nice. Getting refunded by that uh, spin dash again. Nice up tilt. That covered a spot dodge. That was actually really smart. I don't know if it was on purpose, but it definitely was effective. 21% for Dancing Blade. Um, tried to call it a roll right there, but unfortunately doesn't pan out. Uh, oh, no, that uh, that's a little def definitely not a very good idea. Um, I can considering... definitely tell. Uh, oh, no spike. No spike. For sure. Only jumping in reaction to um, Dadzy trying to jump. Ooh. Another thing I like about uh, what uh, Lazy Zack is doing is he knows when to disengage off of uh, doing spins that whiff and go like when he goes on the platform he doesn't always just try to jump like run back uh, to center stage and just like try to strap again he just you know goes off stage or like goes to like goes to ledge or like chills on the platform for a little while. Uh, you can be doing that. Uh, nice, yeah, full hot back here is going to take that. Oh, that backer is huge. You definitely might have lost the stock if you didn't do that. So um, yeah. Got to call that jump out. Yeah, no, tried to go for a parry. Unfortunately, didn't pan out. Uh, Dazzy taking a breath in the player cam. Uh, I don't know if Bro is looking there, but I'm not going to argue. But, um, yeah. Dazzy, you got to figure out, like, how to contest these spins more. You're, like, not, oh, you're, like, you're not, you're, like, under shooting. You're trying to, you're trying to catch Zach, like, spinning, but not the charge itself. So he's just going to wait. Oh. That could have been really been unfortunate. Really that fourth match is going to catch that neutral getup. That's a very, very solid two stock from Lazy Zack. Um, yeah, no, this is very different than our game one. Lazy Zack definitely made some very solid adjustments that allowed him to win that game. Um, yeah. This was, yeah, for sure. No, I'm absolutely with you. Yeah, I think now I'm thinking of um, one thing that I think Yoshi's did for Zack is that he could spin in the corner and because of the slant and the platform, you can't like go onto the platform and try to pressure from there. You have to drop the platform, which takes a lot longer. Got a what? I'll be over in a minute. Save one for me. <laughs> I'm gonna finish this set and then I'll come get one. All right. I told you to save one. Unfortunate. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah. So small battlefield. This is definitely um, a more neutral stage in my opinion. Um, you definitely have don't have much space to like you know keep Sonic out of constant burst range considering like you know how much space he covers um but the platforms are definitely going to be a lot more helpful in uh dealing with like spins like in the corner especially yeah but yeah i'm gonna see how dadsy actually uh, tries to you know play this out tries to catch the neutral get up with an air but doesn't pan out gets the down tilt forward and that could definitely be it and that's not it yeah time the iframe so that you can go through the spring dadsy uh yeah no you can't be spin dashing like that dad Lazy Zack is definitely waiting for to react to something that you do. Get up attack. Okay, that was good. Nice. Dazzy was definitely uh, scouting out for a um, neutral get up there, which uh, Lazy Zack did not bite on. Oh, that platform almost really had Lazy Zack messed up there because of, um, you know, homing attack. Landing lag only actually happens if you hit the ground during the move. Yeah. But otherwise, it doesn't really have much lag at all. Yeah. 
Wow, that back air is just insane. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Dazzy's swinging way too often when Lazy Deck literally isn't anywhere near him. I think this is more. That was that was a good. One. Yeah, oh, that only gets like one reach in, huh? The response in this, as far as I'm seeing, is uh, good guy, good guy. not try to uh, intercept where he's going. Kind of oh, try to stuff out his attacks. For sure. Play a little bit more. Ooh, oh, that spring could definitely be huge. Good. Yeah, no, that's, that's going to be it. Oh, nice oh, tech, nice tech, nice tech, nice tech, nice tech. Unfortunately, it was a little bit unlucky in that uh, with that spring not sending Dadzy out because that definitely would have killed there. But you know, Dadzy. Um, a little bit, yeah, no, Lazy Deck was definitely uh, going for a kill there. Like, we wanted a forward tilt, some kind of back air. Um, it, it amazes me how nice long these games go. The first God, it was the was first stock took almost three, three minutes. Yeah, yeah, two minutes. Okay, Lazy Deck did run into that preemptive uh, dancing blade. You kind of got to figure out why that's happening, Zach, before you um, try to rush in and try to do something about it. Oh, yeah. That seems started doing a lot more um, run up spot dodges. Yeah, nice. Uh -oh. Oh, we get up attack. That almost could have been a really good option, but Dazzy just scouting it out out of nowhere, and I don't know why he's dead. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay. Nice. Neutral. Oh, no trick get a forward smash. That was not a good idea, but unfortunately, doesn't get punished and gets Dazzy. I mean, uh, all plays like a little bit of a uh, grimy stock right there. I will not lie. Sonic backdrop. Nice down there. I never saw uh, Lazy Zack do that before, and yeah, you just catch uh, someone sitting in shield, like trying to catch a jump out of shield uh, when they're trying to punish spin dash. So um, yeah, having an option that can actually hit Lucina in place. Absolutely. It was, a, it was a good mix up too. Mm -hmm. Yep. And now Dadzy has mostly brought this back. Yeah, I love how Dad, uh, Lazy Zack just spin dashes the stage like that. Lazy Zack, I, I mean, uh, Dadzy could definitely be uh, calling this out a bit more, but um, he's just not. He tried to call out a ledge roll right there. It does not pan out. Oh. That could have been so scary if Lazy Zack... Oh, okay. Nice air dodge, nice air dodge, nice air dodge. Up smash. I don't know why you up smash there. That was not a good idea. Down throw. I can definitely see why you down throw there. I don't know why you spring there. That nair is going to take it. Yeah, no, you why have to go to center stage. Why there. down throw there over back throw? Oh, I suppose back throw doesn't send very far. Back, back throw, yeah, doesn't send too far. There's just the fact that uh, you want to have Sonic more getting juggled rather than getting off stage because Dazzy has not been successful in edge guarding Lazy Zack like whatsoever. Yeah, no. Entire point. set. Nice back. Yeah, I know you got you out the neutral get out. That's not gonna kill. Spring should not take it. Okay, yeah. Dazzy's uh, recovery pass is just so so smart. Oh, tried to shield there, but unfortunately got hit by you know uh, the multi the multi hits of um Dad's uh, dancing blade because dancing blade is literally just like. A 50 50 every single time. Absolutely. With, with you being able to control the timing of it every time. Oh. There was definitely a time where uh, Dazzy was a lot more vulnerable than uh, Lazy Zack thought, but unfortunately, grabbing the ledge definitely left his options um, a little bit more limited. Uh, oh, He's a little you impatient with the side piece there. For sure. Oh, that down there was also very impatient. Oh, yeah, nice. Coming attack the ledge. Don't ledge roll. Thank you. I don't know why. It, I, one thing I wonder is why Elise is actually up airing after all of their spins. Because um, you're just kind of throwing out an extra attack that feels a little bit pointless. Forward smash. Don't be. No, you can't be doing that. Nice homing attack. Unreactable, pretty much. Yep. Up, up smash. Take that. Uh, Dadzy up two one. I don't. I think the stage selection was a lot better from Dadzy in this point. Um, yeah, for sure. So. Absolutely. Avoiding the. Uh the slants of Lilat and Yoshi's has definitely made a little bit of a difference. Mm -hmm. Just because Zach's not able to hide as much. For sure. Yeah, we're gonna have to see uh, what stage this could be going to because this definitely could just affect the entire outcome of this set for sure. No, oh, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, Ali Tena. Oh, Lucy now. I was like, Cali? Hold on, what? <laughs> yeah. You've been having success with Lucina, why drop yeah, all the momentum? Bitch, yeah. Oh, back to small battlefield. Interesting. This is a little bit surprising, I will not lie to you. I mean, th there were definitely some adjustments that uh, Lazy Zach could have made that last game, so I think he's just kind of confident in his ability to, like, you know, clutch up with the adaptation. That was not a good uh, homing attack. Dazzy was in the middle of a roll, and, like, yeah. Dazzy's reactions to ledge roll are so strong. 
They really are. Yeah. And that's huge too, because now you can't have a good way of like getting to center stage from ledge. You always have to play from the corner or in the air. Yeah. As Lady Jack, so. Yeah. Sonic's not Sonic. too terrible at playing from the air, but Lucina has a lot of really good air. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Nice early forward air. Um, nice. Up air, yep. You gotta keep advantage. Don't try to jump, just wait. Lucina will take a while to land on her own, so you can reposition way better than just trying to jump up and forward her uh, up air. Oh, oh that was God. such a good forward <laughs> smash! Alright, uh, Dazzy definitely, uh, Lazy Zack not being in too much danger of dying to too many options right now. Even, like, center stage forward smashes just will not, uh, take it. As long as you don't get hit by, like, very specific things, like forward tilt at the ledge, forward smash at the ledge, side B at the ledge especially. Oh, that DI on that forward air was definitely not good. Uh, as I say, that, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Nice. Oh, up air out of hits done. That. Oh, I hate, I hate it when you go to grab, and it registers that you get the grab, but you get hit by a hitbox that's out at the same time. Right. It knocks you too far. It's so obnoxious. Okay, nice tomahawk grab. Uh, Dazzy, earlier in like just a couple seconds ago, he was definitely swinging in uh, Lazy Zack's face when he wasn't supposed to be. Uh, I know that you can't react to Sonic that well, but you definitely have to be using a defensive option rather than a... Uh, yeah. yeah, nice ledge jump. I would have I would have done that too. Uh, Dazzy was not really trying to uh, react to anything. Uh, air dodge in! Yeah, Dazzy already knows that Lazy Zack loves doing that air dodge in after something attack. You cannot be doing that every single time. Reaction to the ledge roll, you can't be doing that. Um, of course, that does mean that Lazy, uh, Dazzy's not going to be scouting the that much. Nice back air. Nice uh, dash tag. Spring. Nice Great tag. Oh, that spot dodge is so good. No, oh, burst himself out of the corner with that dash tag. Yep, I definitely can agree with that. Yep, oh, it tries to up smash. Wait, what? What, what is, is going happening? on? No, you cannot be doing that up smash out of field, especially when you're reacting so slow. They won't so expect slow. it the fourth time. Right. Nice reaction. Yeah, no, this is... Dazzy's playing a little bit more scared than he should be. He's uh, going out with these spins like really, really, really preemptively. He shouldn't be doing. Yeah, okay, good back air. That's good back air on that uh, air dodge. So, um, Sonic is so good at playing around. Uh, what's it called? Legend. Uh, respawn invincibility. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, that was such a far dancing blade. I'm impressed. Yeah, Dazzy's kind of running up and shielding, walking forward. <sighs> You can't be spinning, you cannot be spinning there, uh, ladies and You have to be like, oh, dodge, okay, yeah. Okay, up air, up air. You don't push your advantage there, yeah. You don't want to get reversal in that down air. Actually worked out. Normally that would be a bad option. Smash not quite safe on shield. Yeah. Oh, four. Oh, he doesn't, he doesn't, he doesn't, he doesn't roll in. Normally you would be so like sure that someone's going to roll in there, but just a spin. I, uh, it's not looking good. Ooh. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Uh, ooh, that was not a good air dodge. Um, I think, oh, tries to catch a really low recovery, but unfortunately doesn't pan out. Oh, forward tilt, forward tilt. Oh. Went for the jab lock, I didn't yeah. expect that. Ooh. Forward air. Huge. Oh, that spring. So Covered. close to hitting every time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So insane. Oh, wait, this could be it. No! Whoa! No Whoa, tech. He killed him there, too. He up, he's high, and he gets hit, but he just, uh, yeah. That's so unfortunate. That is I mean, really genuinely unfortunate. What a fantastic yeah. set to watch, though. Yeah, that was a good set. Both to watch players are incredibly talented. Mm -hmm. And now, um, yeah, no, Lizex in uh, Losers Finals and Dadsies in Vance. I mean, as the free first seed, you definitely should be expecting that. So, good uh, stuff to, uh, good stuff to Zach. Absolutely. Alrighty, I'm gonna hop off commentary here and go get some rinse. Really? Yeah. Good night, everyone. Honestly. Probably clear, so. Yeah. Rosa Ken. This honestly, like, hear me out, this might actually be a pretty good matchup for Rosa. Uh, Alright, solo commentary, I can do that. Alright, pull up. Okay, so, uh, yeah, Ken uh, trying to run up in Hadouken. I can definitely see this take over um, Ryu. Uh, Ken's strapping is probably a lot stronger against uh, 
the, the Luma, Rosa Luma, so yeah, Ken does, uh, Reed doesn't really have up close options like that. Um, just throwing out a lot of Hadoukens. None of them got punished, so yeah, you just got a little bit of a lead. Getting jabbed, not taking too much percent, so you don't gotta worry too much. I can definitely see Focus not being a very good option in this matchup, because uh, you know, you're getting hit twice by pretty much every, every single time. That yeah, there's a lot of hitboxes you can throw out and catch with that sure. Focus. Alright, we have a uh, commentary partner finally. <laughs> the, apparently the best commentator in like, Minnesota. Num ever. Number... tied for number one. Yeah. It's me and Ben. Yeah, and then me. <laughs> and then Maya. Yeah, nice, that was a cool jab up smash. Um, we're gonna have this. Oh, I don't know why that didn't okay. auto turn. We need to buff auto turn right now. That it's been really interesting watching a Rosalina for once. For sure. I've never seen this in bracket. Okay. Yeah, no, neither have I really. Uh, besides, like, you know, obviously top players like Tripaz and whatnot. Well, sure, yeah. But yeah. as far as, like, our Minnesota local things that sure. I have, like, put on, right. I've not seen many Rosalinas, that's for sure. Oh, nice. Ooh, it tries to shore you as a reversal out of that uh, focus, but unfortunately, you kind of pressure that shield. Up. Yeah, that jab standing up is a little bit crazy. I will not. Oh, that's so Ooh. unlucky. You try to roll behind them, but Ken just, you know, boop, auto correct. Hits him with the flaming uppercut. Yep. Ooh, Sick tries to move. roll it. Can't wait for Street Fighter 6. Street Fighter 6. Ooh. Yeah, that exists. I forgot, honestly. That's going to be so cool. Is it? Yeah. I mean, I haven't played Street Fighter like that. I definitely want to oh. try it out. Um, yeah. Are there any, are there, do you think, are you planning on like, having any uh, Street Fighter tournaments like around here? Are you Probably. Yeah. yeah. Probably, yeah. I know a lot of what we're gonna do is like fan games and retro stuff. Uh, as far as events that like Forever Classic puts on, but as far as things that we like present, like we're doing today, sure, yeah. we'll probably do some Street Fighter Six and Tekken That's Eight. Like, Tekken Eight, I know Kazuya. I love Kazuya. <laughs> That's the only guy I know from Tekken. It's it's him and Kuma. <laughs> Akuma from Street Fighter? No, Kuma, the bear. Oh, the no, oh, yeah, the bear. <laughs> I forgot about that guy. And then there's a uh, that dude, he Heihachi, whatever. Yeah, Heihachi. The guy that threw him off the cliff. That was a good get up attack. Oh, unfortunately, gets punished. So fourth throw. Oh yeah. Is going to take it. That's crazy. Um, I mean, you know, Vamin no has the idea. current lead. Ooh, Nair could have definitely comboed into up tilt, but I think Vamin was just a little bit late on his execution. Up tilt. Sure oh, you. That oh, that was slick. Yeah. Oh, I did silly. Huh. Yeah, Rosalina's down B does absorb any active projectiles, so... Um, Can she use it? If it, if it, yeah, no, if it hits, um, if, like, the actual, like, you know, the spinning around her... Yeah. If that, if that connects with someone, it'll definitely, it'll, um, hit them. Oh, okay. And, uh, fun fact, in, uh, with team attack on, you can actually do it with your teammates of projectiles. So, if you have, like, oh. Rosalina and a Robin... Okay. With, with a fully charged thunder, you know that one? Yeah. You have the huge line, it just... Oh, god. You know, it just covers the that entire That sounds state. brutal. Yeah. Okay. Take yeah, another stock here. Yep. Uh, you can't really focus on a disadvantage, so uh, Ken definitely uh, struggles to uh, land sometimes. So yeah, you get hit by the up smashes, you get hit by the up airs so much more. Trying to Tatsu in, I'm not sure how much well that's going to like work at all, considering you're going to be hitting Rosa, hitting Luma, being stuck in hit lag and getting hit by Yeah, okay. Yeah, roll behind down tilt, go. the classic Shoto um, maneuver. I mean, Shoto's really have a pretty standard game plan. They're just trying to link combo into their uppies, usually, yeah. or a Tatsu. Yeah, they're, like, or... dashing in and out, just trying to hit their, like, most effective combo starter. Like, yeah. yeah. They're really cool characters to watch, though. I'm glad oh, they sure. exist in Smash. Yeah, they definitely deserve the representation. I'm not at all opposed to watching them. Playing against them is a mildly different story, but I don't struggle too hard against them, so it's like... Right, right. They definitely feel a little bit ignorant, especially considering uh, autocorrect just kind of uh, makes like, <laughs> uh, kind of just makes cross-ups non-existent against them. Yeah, the auto turn is such a like. Oh, it, it's yeah, an interesting Rosalina. mechanic. Okay, next, I know that Vomit oh, really wow. likes adapting to those uh, mo uh, defensive options out of like getting up tilt on shield. So I would definitely not be surprised if uh, he lands an up tilt on shield and then dashes Ooh. back. Never mind. Sure you. Oh, oh not gonna take my it. Yeah. Goodness. That move has no land. That move has no land. Big like, uh, shield pressure. Yeah. Really low shield. No two frames. So don't be doing that. Trying to call it. Probably gonna kind of. Oh, they're definitely gonna ledge mm. up here. No ledge up. Okay. Okay. Trying to, yeah. Let, drop some ledge. Uh oh. Oh, uh, that was not a good air dodge at all. You got an air dodge to ledge. Oh no, no, no. That definitely panned. That at least panned out. So. Oh, that up smash was very, very nice. Oh, wait. Hold up. Watch out for Luma. Watch out for Luma. That was oh. a kill confirm. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, uh, yeah. Luma's dash tag actually has set knockback. 
So you can always combo it into that, like a uh, dash stack cancel. Okay. From uh, Rosalina, because you can cancel uh, moves into aerials. That, they can cancel um, the first two frames of any of your moves, uh, grounded tilts, into uh, aerial, like jumps and uh, buffered aerials. Weird. It's uh, actually just to make the game a little bit easier, more accessible to people, because, you know, like you press A and jump at the same time, you don't want to, like, you know, oh. you, just end up, you just end up canceling the move. Okay. Huh. And it doesn't work on, mo on moves that uh, have hitboxes before the cancel can happen, like Little Max Grab. So yeah, it's like an accessibility thing that unfortunately made Rosalina a much better character because of it. Because now Rosalina, since Luma can't do that, Luma gets the dash attack hitbox out and then Rosalina can just uh, do Nair, do any aerial out of it uh, at the exact same time. I mean, most of the time a puppet character is considered very technical, but I really think that Rosalina in, in Smash is a very technical character sure. like we're talking about. Yeah. Being able to use certain things like hit lag and like, you know, puppet mechanics. Yeah, oh, definitely. Vomit swapped over to Pyramitha. Vomit, so yeah, swapping over to Pyramitha. Uh, I know that uh, Kazuha had uh, got to play against Sore, but I mean, Sore, I mean, Vomit isn't Sore, so we can definitely just be seeing a, a whole different game plan. So, coming from Vomit. Yeah, running in and nearing. Oh. Separating the uh, baby from his mother. Oh, yeah, that's a Ooh. thing. You know that uh, when Rosalina's in off B lag, like before she lands, Ro Luma is still like there. So you can start a jab while she's in landing lag, and then Rosalina can just act normally as long as you're holding A. That's what I'm saying, man. If you've got really good awareness, and it seems like Vomit's trying to take out some frustration on the way. Right. Luma. Yeah. Let me just bop that little star around for yeah. a bit. <laughs> cold blood, unfortunate. I hope everybody's having a great time tonight, by the yeah, way. I mean, was, this, this has been a lot of fun. Uh, we got sure. 33 people hanging out with us. If you haven't hit the follow button, sure. go for it. Yeah, follow me on Twitter at uh, Bump. At what? <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I was trying to say something funny, and then it turned into a toilet joke, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, nice berry uh, dash attack. Uh, yeah. Down, down air, no combo. But nice up air. Hey. air dodge. Rosalina is a little bit floaty. Black Luma, this is the best one by far. This color scheme is amazing. It's a really cool color. Yeah. The blue, blue eyes, you know. The rainbow. Get up attack. Just get up attack. Just get up attack. Never oh, mind. Nope, swipe now that. you're Oh, never mind. So that ledge hang is a, a little bit too low for. Uh... Okay, cover ground. I feel like that move is maybe a little underutilized in this matchup because it 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 gets Perfect. Luma out of the way. Wow, you can see Luma just Stock body up. blocking those uh, projectiles from the upbeat. So Rosalina just free to like run up and. Oh. Okay, on the pyro. Or is this one Mithra? Nice forward tilt, yeah. Uh, this is Mithra. This is Mithra. I've learned a lot about Xenoblade recently because everybody's talking about it, it on YouTube. I feel so bad for you. But I've not played any of them. Top five Xenoblade haters in the world, number one me. <laughs> nice up beat. Ooh, you know, you got like good string. 18% instead of trying to continue uh, a juggle with up air. I can definitely respect it. Whoa! That was a lot of defensive options in a row. Honestly, one thing I really hate is those uh, Rosalina's and like, you know, those characters can just like vanish whenever they do their rolls and spot dodges because I have no idea what option they're doing until like a little bit later in. So reacting to them is a lot it's harder. It's the visual of it that trips you up. For sure. All right, we're going to see no, no, uh, no Luma slander this time. Ooh, I just noticed that the blue Luma is uh, actually inverted from the black one. You got the black uh, eyes. With the, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, definitely a huge fan of that. They put a lot of really oh. cool design into her. For sure, I definitely, yeah, no, I'm a huge fan of Rosalina's design, even though I'm, I haven't played Mario Galaxy like that, it's just like, cool character. Played through like half of each of them. Crazy. They're good oh, games. For sure. Yeah, no, I've definitely heard them like, you know, highly regarded. Wow, Dad, Luma just, you know, taking all of the views and now Rosalina also falling with her child. Oh, Foresight. Big smash attack there. Okay. That was nice. Um, yeah. Throwing up the tilts. I am definitely, uh... You know, me personally, I'm a Minnesota fan. I don't like cheering against Minnesota, so I'm unfortunately a Vomit fan at the moment, even though top five most cheesy players in Minnesota. You know. <laughs> what was the one viral tweet? It's like, Minnesota's hilarious because you'll get beat by a guy named Vomit and then again by a guy named Meat, Meat Flap. Flap. <laughs> yeah. yeah, nightmare. And they're both Shoto players. Minnesota's Dome. got such a cool scene, though. For I sure. really appreciate like everybody in here. Yeah. Like, it's just fun to watch, and I like watching people go out to, like, majors and regionals and stuff. For sure, even though we have almost nobody go out to other state stuff, which is unfortunate. I mean, we just have, like, Loaf, and then, like, some people going to, like, Wisconsin. Some of the FGC people, like, our buddy Ruben will travel a lot. For sure. We get to see him on. Yeah, but none of, like, the, you know, Smash, like, familiars, like, yeah. Like, yeah. like Lucky Thor, stuff like that. 
Oh, tries to get a neutral B, unfortunately doesn't pan out. Um, this game has been really long. Yeah. Ooh. I mean, we haven't seen a timeout yet. Okay. Have we not seen a timeout in bracket? Okay. Not, not on stream. I've never seen one on stream, I don't think, except for maybe once at Advantage State. When yeah, I Advantage State, yeah. Oh, nice dash. Okay. Play. Yeah. Yeah, no, I mean, because uh, I'm, I'm assuming wasn't expecting like to get their landing spot from so far away from a character as low as Pyra, but that dash deck is kind of just a jump scare. Yeah. So, yeah, nice play from a Vomit. Yeah, I mean, we've got some really good competition today. People, we were talking about this, me and Gummy, The people want this. They want to win the Arcadian. For sure. You know, there are people talking about how why, why people are taking this Arcadian so seriously, but wow, this is like a chance for... So 118 people in a bracket? Good right. lord! Like, this is a chance for so many underrepresented, like, underrated, um, like, Smash, like, Minnesota players to, like, you know, get the chance, like, the spotlight without any, you know, of the top 10 players, like, you know, right. beating them down before they can ever act to get a chance to sign. Like, funny enough, I don't think I've ever seen Vomit on cam. Like, I've never seen him physically. Yeah. If he did play for us, it was when we didn't have player cams at Black Ice or something, but now I'm like, oh, okay, that's Vomit. Yeah, that's gotcha. Yeah. Ooh, that dash tag really killing Luba from that far away from the ledge. That's really important. Like, what yeah. trips me up, if I had to play against Rosalina, it's the camera, like, desync. It's for sure. weird, man. Luma has to be, like, accounted for at all times, and it's like... Yeah. Forward air, up tilt. Forward air, yeah. You're trying to just combo Luma off stage. I mean, you don't really need to combo her, because Luma can't air dodge or anything like that. That downer is really strong for Luma. You're going to have to side be there. Ooh. Not going to kill, though. Good timing. Luma's a... Uh, Oh, air dodge? Oh, oh, oh! Barely, barely. back. Dude, Vomit is a ghost right now. What the heck? What, what? Oh, God. What? Uh, what? 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 The Top I hate cheating. The, Her. like, the tilt, the, like, balance into the ups. What was that? Dude was, a. Uh, you know, Luma did that whole thing. Was that you, intentional? You're hold, yeah, you know, you're holding jab while Luma, while Rosalina was in a different animation. So you can just hold jab while Rosalina didn't do anything else, isn't doing anything else. That's wild. Yeah. And that's how he got it to combo to the up smash. It's kind of cheating, but you know, <laughs> cheating is apparently allowed in smash. So hey, it was cool. It was if cool. it if it works, I don't see what's wrong. With it. <laughs> Rosa can also combo off of jab. That's kind of <laughs> scary. It makes sense though, because uh, Luma is the one that's suffering all the hit lag rather than Rosa herself. So you just get more time to like follow up. Uh, vomit uh, almost getting lap percent, but not quite. Uh, not rolling oh. out of that. Gets and the DI was through. very not good. Uh, Try to side B again, try to catch Luma's uh, kind of predictable uh, motion. Yeah, no, that was a good point, though. So. Yep. Um, yep. Yeah, catching the ledge roll, even though, like, because I didn't think it was possible, it definitely was there. Jab, that's not going to take it. Air dodge in? No air dodge in. You're going to have to side B there, and you're going to die. Oh, the timing yeah. again. He's just got the timing down. Yeah, no, you definitely have to just go air dodge. You have to air dodge and then go low with your upbeats because you are gonna get you're gonna die every single time for getting a for trying to side beat the ledge. Yeah, what a day for Kahuzi. He's been on stream a lot. He's playing a character that we don't see much out here. Sure. Like that's he's awesome. Dead, yeah. People say he's like from the Wisconsin area, I guess. I think Iowa. Oh, maybe. I don't know. What even is Iowa? I ain't <laughs> a place where Slipknot came from. That's about it. What? <laughs> yeah, they're from Iowa. Crazy. Their second album was called Iowa. That's all I know about it, though. <laughs> That's all the Iowa facts I have. Iowa. Cool. Slowing down a little bit here. Nice dodge. Oh, but vomit with the chase. So, yeah, I'm surprised. Oh, that upbeat. The Luma tripped him up. Oh, yeah, the, oh that downer was actually so messed up. Now you're in the ledge. Oh, wow. oh yeah. the distant Luma. For sure, yeah. You just kind of have to deal with that uh, puppet character. Came in with the Gynax punch. Holy crap. Yeah. Huge. You know Gynax, right? Like, Gurren Lagann and uh, BNA and the animation studio? Oh. Gynax, Studio Trigger. Yeah. Eventually became Studio Trigger. Evangelion? That's Gynax. Crazy. Yeah. There's all these little things they do that, you know, it's just a part of their charm. It's good stuff. No idea what this guy's dashing about. (laughs) 
All right, here we go. Potential game point fear for Kahuza. Meanwhile, Vomit swaps characters over to Incineroar. That's a lot of character swaps. Incineroar. Yeah. Oh boy. The big cat. Incineroar is definitely a uh, Vomit's like silly character that he just like kind of goes for that when he's like quote unquote trolling because unfortunately his trolling in Incineroar is incredibly real. We've seen like some really funny reverse like sets from a. Uh, Vomit on people like a bat and other good players. Oh wow! Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. No, this Incineroar is definitely not a mean pick whatsoever. It's definitely a character that, like, when playing, I'm, I really didn't like just his whole kit. Sure. But I've seen so many people do awesome things with him. For sure. Like, yeah. There's like Sky J. There's you know a lot of really good players in Incineroar. Yep. Seems bad at first, but like when you're just not moving that much. Mm-hmm. His move, his mobility is really bad, but his buttons are so amazing. And like when you're in advantage with that character, you just get up there and just get everything. Oh, oh caught up. He's getting sent off stage. You're gonna recover high here. Never mind. Oh, okay. Ooh, nice. Nice down smash, covering the ledge roll. Vomit. Uh, yeah, no, kind of feeding for center stage. Nice tomahawk side beat. That's going to take it for sure. Oh wow. I love the taunts that Incineroar does after all of his cool moves. Like he's, he's the wrestler. He's right. really cool. <laughs> We yeah. might actually be doing a team up with a indie wrestling thing sometime really? later this year. Yeah, we've got a friend from back in the college days that I just like talked to our co-owner Zach about, and he's like, "Yeah, we might do some wrestling stuff," That's which I think would be awesome. Side B gets spot dodge, unfortunately. Uh, you know, Incineroar. I think one of my favorite moves from Incineroar is his forward tilt. You know, the the like hand, jab, the hand poke, the yeah. Hand poke? Oh my god! Whenever I'm playing the character, I always oh. just like. Just say poke whenever you know. You can play. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Looks like a, such a weak move, but it's insanely strong, especially if you can get the sweet spot. Ooh, okay. Nice, field, field, yeah. nice. nice. <laughs> ah, yeah, I know. You call that like, try to get the, try to get some sort of cheese, and then you know. Hit him with the revenge. Yeah, nice grab. Gets him to the revenge. Now back throw forward. There is a true combo. Ooh. Oh. Oh, yeah. weird little interaction there at ledge. Giving um, is, uh, giving vomit center stage in favor of um. Instead of trying to push his advantage in the corner, because you know Incineroar is kind of slow, he can't push himself out of the corner without like you being able to react. Nice up air, yeah. Juggling with the with the other guy, yeah. Getting oh, there you go. Up air, not going to take it. That DI was definitely uh, very lucky. I'm not going to lie. Ooh, oh, side almost got him. Could not catch that. Yeah. Kahuza hanging on. Dash attack, press. Yeah, oh, another dash attack. He's going to take it. Yeah. Battlefield Bastion almost saved uh, Kazuha there. Yeah, Big nice roll. Big cat damage. For sure. Yeah, really wanting to get oh, that buff. Luma abuse, what? <laughs> get out of here, little guy. Uh oh. Ah, that takes is almost crazy. I'm not even gonna. Nair? No, Nair. Oh, tried to catch something with a revenge, but unfortunately just went pan out. You cannot grab Luma. I love how Kahuza plays Rosalina. We've we've said it a lot, but it's yeah, really, cool. really cool. Yeah, it's, I know it, it. It like abuses so many of Smash's like mechanics, and it's just yeah. like wow, having such a having such knowledge on like intricacies of your character that like come from like these little like... it goes to show that vomit is a very experienced player yeah being able to play around this even though you probably had no idea like what you were doing against this character right and then kahuza just able to exploit all these little things like we're saying like no side B's not oh. killing that's the fakest kill screen oh my god Yo. never mind oh. curse indeed uh i don't know how good that di was maybe air dodge no I, no he jumped there so i guess it just looks good <laughs> All right, as we get those stage bands, we're into a game five once again here yeah. on Forever Classic Games. And now I tell you what, I am impressed with this venue. The sure. borough is sick. I know, I love this place is so cool. Like, I really wish that I, I got to like move around a little bit because yeah, <laughs> obviously I got to run master control over here. Yeah. But the borough is such a cool place. Mm -hmm. We got arcade games, we got pinball machines, yeah, they got all the cool stuff. Right. Obstacle courses and such, like man, I agree. It's axe great. throwing. <laughs> I wish we could be here more often instead of just for the Arcadian. But I guess you have to do a lot to like try to get this venue set up in the first. I don't know what it what it takes. I I was just told to be here, and I'm like, okay, <laughs> got it. You got a cat. You got a cast. Just you know. Yep. Do your own thing. 
And I mean, obviously, Dravis and Tac Tac have just killed it in the TO scene for, for the sure. past like year and a half. Anytime I get to support those those folks, I'm all in. That's I mean. Yeah, that's great. Game five on Treasure Trove okay. Cove. On FD. The final destination. The final destination, game five. Very fitting. Um, okay. I honestly, I, I don't know about this. I don't know about this pick. Like, I know that uh, Kahuza got the ticket, but I'm not sure why. Down tilt, down tilt, up. That was a good two frame punch. Yo. Player, 70%. Yeah, no, I mean... What a are... clean conversion off right. of that one. Going for the second down tilt, I don't even know, like, who would have thought of that. Yeah, I mean, down tilt two frame at the ledge definitely kills here. Because, fun fact, you can just uh, down tilt forward tilt. Okay. As a two frame, op as a two frame option, just kills people at, like, 70%. It's absurd. That's crazy. Yeah, trying to wall people out with the... Um, Your grave is jumping in? Oh, nice to hear. Yeah, what's okay. up, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. In the house. You know, we've been seeing all day is top eight right now. Gang five. We got Vomit. We got Kazi in the house. Oh, shit. We got, we got the yeah, start right here. Who, yeah. who you got on the, who's got on the set right now? Huh? Who you got on the set right now? Honest, oh, Vomit's shit. Looking he took really the set. Go. Damn. <laughs> Vomit up right now. Let's see it. Up throw. Okay, okay up right. throw. I like that. Kazi got... Yeah, his nice, his yeah, Rosalina, right. this whole racket has been insane. Like, right. He beat Arwolf, who was like he had, second seed. Yeah, he has notable wins this whole the whole season. I, I didn't know who this person was. So Yeah, no, he's from Iowa. I'm pretty Iowa, sure. okay. He's looking nice, though. Yeah, and it wasn't PR'd apparently, though, because that's why he's here right now. Yeah, so. high key, okay. He's farming, I guess. Yeah, just doing a little bit of, you know. Little, he's turning up. I like this. He, he has a little, he's a familiar style yeah. player like the Buzz. Like if I'm For sure. Honest. Yeah, like even like, like. The setups he has, like, you know, his, his FDI is really well. Yep. Oh, oh nice. Yeah, oh, you want to like. His set, setup with Rosa, the, uh, the star is so phenomenal. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, gotta Getting go. so much damage, yeah. I mean, are you dead? You are yeah. dead. Yeah. Here we go. Okay, right, it's yeah. tied up now. Let's see. Does anybody gain though? We still gain five. Oh, Luma, unfortunately, just taking. So much damage okay, and then yeah, okay. just dying. Yeah. He just need a couple of seconds to get back that star. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's like what nine seconds. Yeah, nine seconds left. Yeah, really. Five, four. Yeah. Okay, here we go back. Luma. Ah. I mean, you get a hit right now in the corner, and Luma's gonna die. So. Yeah. Fortunate. Oh, it's not. No, tries to go for some reversal. Like, okay, I like that. Range, so yeah. Nice. Okay, yeah. Neutral B. Oh, hard yeah, to, yeah, okay. Hard to contest with on shield. Only got a dash tag instead of something bigger. Oh, down mm -hmm. smash. Tries to catch the landing, but Vama's a bit too far away. Forward smash. I don't know what's going on right now. Okay, okay. Um, oh. Hey, yo, in chat, let me know who y'all rocking with tonight. Yeah, who y'all got? got rocking with? Vomit or Kazu? Let's see. I see Thor in the chat. Let's see. Who else in here? Make some noise. I want to see it. I cannot read the chat, unfortunately. No, it's okay. AC McCumber's got us. Let's Ooh. see the vibes. Luma is not dead fight. Okay, yet. okay. Damn, this could be any stock. Oh, oh, that that's not gonna take okay, it. Okay, okay, that's close though. Still alive. Oh, Luma takes it. This is literally even here. though. Okay, yeah, for sure. Okay. Down tilt. Oh, 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 this is the roll. That's so unfortunate. Oh. Yeah. No. Nope. Uppy's oh, really high. Oh, oh, tries to, oh, yeah, I tried to go for the cheesy uh, side B. Unfortunately, he doesn't uh, pan out. Get up attack. No, get up attack. Hmm. Okay, collects a little bit at the end. Trying to okay. go for some. Uh, rev oh, that was such oh. a good jump call, and now Kazuya on his okay. last leg. Uh, this could be his potential this tournament stock. Doesn't get the oh, doesn't get the spot dodge read. Uh, yeah, no. Let's see. Bomb is such in such a good spot right now. You have rage. You could like genuinely just pull off some crazy stuff before uh, losing your stock. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Nice he's trying to go for some side B's. Uh, no. I think Kazu is definitely like scouting out side B right now, so I don't think it's gonna be working. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You lost the star. Luma. Yeah. No. Luma. Couple seconds. Let's see. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. Nice. 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 Five, four, three, two. Luma. Now. Yeah. Oh. Yep. We, I, I always like to predict this, the color of Luma. Yeah. Yeah. He's got, he got I, was two try, I was trying. I was trying. I was trying to side <laughs> bet on it, but I was wrong every time. He got two goldens right now. Okay. Damn. Oh, not a single time. Finish, finish, finish. Oh, oh. A beat. Ooh, oh, not getting so punished. That's close. so unfortunate. Okay, 64% right now. This could be nice back air. Man, this Kazu has I want to see it in, in stock right now. I think it's going to be. Oh, oh, that was oh a good my reverse. God. That was one of the first ones that worked this set. Yo, that was insane. Definitely. Yeah, that could definitely. Okay, just... later I'm going to post that. Damn, yeah. that was nice. Hold yeah, no, up. side B. Uh, Vomit definitely trying to just find some way to take down the stock right now. Oh, oh doesn't catch the jump. His... That LP armor was so clutch. Neutral lead. Okay, that was strange. Oh, uh, nice, back nice, throw nice. forward air? No back. Okay, yeah. Holding out on the back throw so you don't uh, get hit. Come on, come on. Anybody's game right here. I mean, uh, this, oh, is nice. it really anybody's game? Vomit. Vomit looking so strong. Yeah, I know he is. I ain't gonna lie. 
Vomit has been nice this whole this whole tournament too. Oh, Luma not getting bumped off the stage quite yet. Uh, Kazu is just trying to slow down, let Luma take all the hits. It doesn't really have matter if Luma takes hits because like you know it's just he's gonna respawn. Exactly. But I mean. You can't let Luma take that all that abuse for free, though. So you gotta be able to run in and punish, but that's it. Oh, that's it. Take it. Yeah. Vomit Good takes stuff it. To vomit game five. Here we go. Game yeah. five locks in. Here we go, baby. Let's go. Huge. I'm sorry, Kazuya, but that's the end. Yeah. Here we go. That was a good run, though. I think fifth. Yes, sir. That was fifth. There yeah. we go. You know, hey. Good stuff to I'll, vomit. No, no, real quick, real quick. I just gotta say, vomit did a lot better than me flat today. Damn, that's messed up. <laughs> no, that's no, messed no. up. No, but I'll give him the I'll give him the title of uh, best FGC best player. Shadow, best shadow. Best shadow. I mean, I also play Kazi and Terry now though, so that doesn't count. They they play the Ken Ryu. You're right. Okay. What? Well, is is three? Is uh, a okay. what, what? Okay. What's Terry? King of Fighters. King of King of, King of, of Fighters. And obviously Kazi is Tekken. Yeah. There we go. But yeah, they're the classics. Yeah, they're they're, both, they're all goaded. You know, it's just that's yeah. not the vibe. But I mean, he's also playing at Sinora. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, y'all yeah. know vibes. Your boy Dravis in the house. Favorite TO. We starting top eight. We got Maya, PR. Hey, what's up? T banned from banned from the Arcadian, unfortunately. We yeah. got to get a regional in here where I can play that, right? Yeah, we'll run it back. I, yeah. You know, that's in the works right now. We're trying to, you know, do some moves in Minnesota. We'll get Chicago. We get everybody yeah. in the Midwest out here. That'll be sick. Hey, I want to fly Owning. For real. Let's fly really? Owning. Yeah, Let's no, fly Owning. Let's sick. tell him. Tell him, man. Oh, yeah, he's no, he's the best Steve in NA. For sure. Better than Uncola. Loki. Loki, Loki. Oh, here Nicola we go. Wouldn't, only one lost the cola. So. No, facts. Yeah. All right, y'all. We got Vomit. We got uh, Kareem Esports. All of these guys. Game like, of Watch. Vomit with Aegis? Aegis? Yeah, no, I can definitely respect okay. that. Okay. I, I see why, though. It's Game of Watch. Yeah, you need a sword to, like, keep uh, Game of Watch out. And Shoto's kind of do get a little bit bullied. Yeah. Like, Game of Watch is an advantage state because, like, up there's multi hit, so it can go through the focus attack, you know? Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, no, they're just going to kind of get juggled into. Die. Yeah, that, that, that makes sense. For obviously, sure. like Game Watch is very floaty and like has so many options. And like, obviously, yeah. in that when that nine comes out, it's no joke either. Oh, sure. here we go. Yeah, up B. Here we go. Those setups, man. Yeah. Easy damage. Oh shit. Up B. Other shield guys. Yeah, yeah. Just oh, really, man. really hard to deal with. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yep. Nice nair forward air. Trying to two frame, but Game Watch recovery can be oh, mixed up way too low. Tries to go for like a field break. I don't know. Or just catch the missile get up. I don't know. Out of the two for ages, who do you like more, Pyro or Mitra? I mean, or like each one has equally can, can do a lot of different stuff. You can do a lot of different stuff with them. Okay, I, mean, I think I like Mithra more in general. I only really use Pyra if I'm like, if I got them off stage and I want to like see if I can kill them in the corner. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. But otherwise, I'd just be switching to Mithra, even if they're at a high percent. Because you can just kill them with whatever. Yeah, high key. Okay, next setup. Oh, here we go. Side B, you can knock down Smash. You have to jump over and down her. Yeah. Okay. Grab, yeah. Is it done? Is it done? Back here. Oh! Nice forward tilt. That's God not going to quite take Damn. Though. He can farm him though. Ooh, nice, oh, nice, 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 yeah. nice. You dash way quick, far quick back. back air, quick backer, quick backer. That's all you need, honestly. Yeah, backer's gonna take it. Uh, oh! Forward tilt's gonna take it. Up tilt's oh, gonna damn. take it. Up tilt's gonna take it. I think up tilt's gonna definitely. Uh, yeah. Nice switches. Oh! <laughs> that hitbox is massive. <laughs> damn. Man, I know Cosmos wish he could do that. No. Yeah, Cos <laughs> no, Cosmos could never. <laughs> I know, facts. He does it though. I always expect it to work, but obviously the high level play, it's really hard to pull that off. Yeah. It's really predictable. People are going to be uh, watching out for it. No, thanks. Nice. Or to, uh... All right. Yeah. Uh, Let's see. Honestly, Kareem's not really able to juggle. I, I don't uh, know. He's doing really well. He's really playing like kind of like mid-range mid slow. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. This is not the Kareem I like to see. He's very like... Yeah. He has good play. Oh, shit. Ooh, nice force size. No. Be, uh, Damn. Oh, it doesn't get the second hit. That forward air loses to a lot of things. Yeah, it does. Any hitbox just kind of gets stuffed, like stuffs it out because it's like a projectile, but it's really weak. You know, I, I know that like, Kareem likes to just run in, like run up shield up B, but right now he's just kind of trying to run away in forward air, and I don't know how well it's working out. Um, yeah. Okay, I know oh, that, forward, that down okay, was a little okay, bit bring it back. We even yeah. it out 2-2. Two, two. Okay. Nice up. Oh, nice up. Nice, catch nice, the jump. Nice. Yeah. Oh, fourth smash. Yeah, that was a little suspect. But... Oh, this could be okay, huge. Nice, Never nice, mind, Foresight. Nice. Yeah, this is looking good. Hold up. Oh, that could actually be huge for this match. If you hit, like, the... 
You had, uh, you missed the, uh, what's it called, the up airs, like, you just yeah. get four-sided, because normally Game Watch, like, he up airs you and you air dodge it, you just trap your lane in. Yeah, and th that's, that's really tough, though, because, like, what can you do in that situation, then? Right, like, air dodge, if you try to up air them, they can always just air dodge it, slow you down, and then just, like, hit you off of it. In the, in the position that Game Watch is normally, like, super oppressive in. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Okay. Nice camel hot grab, yeah. Okay, it's looking kind of even right now. But yeah, it's this, definitely a lot more even. Ooh. But, you know, there's still any better game. This is top eight, you know, for sure. Let's see the vibes. Yeah, we got so many good, like, so close to making their way into, like, our top ten. These are definitely our, like, our players that aren't quite top ten, but it could definitely bring it there as long as they make, like, a couple more upsets, you know? Yeah. Oh! Yeah, for sure. Damn, I thought that, I was the cooking. Yeah, no, that forward smash uh, doesn't take it. That miss tech is definitely Wow, that too. was nice. Damn, Korean, that was a nice setup, right? Like yeah, that. that was a good down. Yeah. I mean, Pyra, uh, you have to go from like that angle where yeah. you're just going straight up to ledge, so yeah. counter's just going to hit them. Exactly. You just eat it all up. Yeah. Forward air? Oh, doesn't connect. Oh, I don't know what he was cooking. You see, he was cooking <laughs> yeah, some bacon, Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. I guess, right? Oh, tries to catch something beside me, but oh. did not pan out okay. at all. Nice trade, I guess. Okay, yeah. Trying to switch to see, like... Kareem, you want to see if Kareem uh, won't be able to figure out who you're trying to play? Because playing as Pyra, Mith, there's Pyra and Mithra are definitely two very different characters. Like, uh, Pyra, you just like play very far away from her and try to whip punish. But then uh, Mithra, you kind of got to stuff out her hitboxes because they're kind of smaller. And you like run up shield to punish her out of shield because she's not that good at like pressuring entirely safely. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Yeah. That border. Nice. nice. Yeah, that, that DI was not good though. Like he went uh, straight up. He went like straight into and the And he literally just ate that up. I was like, damn, yeah, I guess. Like, yeah, you know, he should not have died to that, but Bro was holding in. Up tilt, up tilt, up air. Uh, that down air landing hitbox is so like hard to deal with. Like, switching to a uh, Mithra. Oh. God damn. Okay. And now, I'm not even gonna lie, like. These guys are, are these guys both uh, try, playing to try to play against Lazy Zack after this? Yeah. This is loser semis? Yeah, pr pretty much. We looking for projections? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. both these guys have had a very, very no you know, notable history of not doing very well against Sonic at all. I know. So this this effort might all be in vain like if you're hoping to win because Kareem has been losing to like all day. Uh, so yeah, no, he's definitely, and all day is like, not even the best Sonic in state, considering, you know, Lazy Zack is right there. And then Vomit just got, like, kind of wiped earlier today on stream, right? Yeah, hi K, I saw that. Uh, yeah. I, I was really shocked to see that. I was like, damn. Yeah, no. Like, there's been a lot of upsets, you know? Like, example, my the first upset of tonight I saw right away was seeing Sans going on, too. I did not expect right. that, I did at, not all. Expect that, that was, at all. That was... It was very unfortunate. Yeah, I know. I, th I thought they would do really well this tournament. Yeah, you know, losing like, to Milk Tea. Yeah. Uh, Milk Tea, who I think was criminally underseeded. No, I... I, I told that to Zach too. I was like, you know, like, they're really good. Their ice school is nice. But obviously, they're still the best ice school in the yeah, state. Ice, yeah, ice climbers in the state for sure. Uh, but, you know. Last three on. Oh, there we go. Shit, game on Kareem. Let's see. Lock it in. That forward tilt was really risky. If that got shielded, you get upbeat and then you die. But I, I can respect it, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for running this tournament. Yeah. Thank you, Dr. Phil. I appreciate Thanks, you. Thanks, Davis. Shout out to Davis. You know, yes, very good TO. We've seen him, like, Pretty much everywhere in Minnesota tournaments, like what? Well, Advantage that you pull up, you got black guys running until they got the yeah. shutdown, unfortunately. But yeah, it's all good. I, I just want to say real quick though, um, the monthly will be back, and I, I am running a bi weekly Fridays um, in St. Paul, so it's going to be crazy. St. Paul, all right. Yeah, it's Highland St. Paul. It's going to be a nice little venue, it's going to be chill. Bi weekly? Uh, bi weekly? Bi weekly first, and then we'll run a monthly too. The monthly we can host like. I think 100, 150. So we'll definitely. Right. I think the bi-weekly will keep it chill at like under 50, and then obviously the monthly will try to go out all out for it too. Uh -huh. You know, but I'm I'm happy though I, to be back. Yeah, for sure. It's been a long it's time, and you know, bring the team with me. So you know, black guys I, had a vibe that I don't think advantage they could even fill. Yeah, you know, and everything. We try, you know, the team Ace and McCumbers. You got, uh, and then we got Tack. We we'll definitely run it back, and then you know, try to bring some other like uh, very well-known people in the scene too. Sure. Or what it is. Uh, the only thing is we don't have a name though, but uh, I, I'm, we are, I'm thinking of one. But yeah. A what? A name for your yeah. yeah sure. The new event, yeah, pretty much. But we'll see the vibes. Yeah. It's trial and error. Alright. Oh, here we go. Switch to but Ken. Then, he went switch to Ken. Here we go. Yeah. Let's see. 88%. I can definitely see like uh, why though, because Ken is very good at trapping Game of Watches deals. So you can't like, you can't just like. Oh. Ooh. Oh. oh. Okay. Nice. Okay. Nice comeback. 
yeah. Oh, he's dead. I don't know why he died, but I guess he didn't have a jump. I don't know. Yeah, high key. Ooh, oh, that shit. up smash was so close to connecting. I know, high key. I thought it was Dunzo. Okay. Ooh, balls out of the nair. I guess uh, he wanted to like drift back to try to control uh, where Sonic goes, but that helped the focus come in clutch. Forward tilt, yeah. I saw that at the last stock of the last game, so it'll definitely be an effective option to love to see. Oh. Yeah, you can Dang. see. Vomit tried to run in with a nair, but then uh, Kareem just got to do his, his own like the fish move. So yeah, I was like, damn, what was he cooking? Yeah, no, <laughs> definitely wasn't cooking. <laughs> oh man, this this is not looking like a good stage though for Vomit though. Ooh, ooh, oh! that air was so unfortunate. Oh, I mean, unfortunate. I know that Ryu likes going on this stage, especially because um his fireballs are a lot harder to do with under platforms. But Game of Watch has the uh, bucket. That yeah. He can just absorb everything. I was like, dang, he's literally he's that's what he's been doing this whole set, and like it's been going to his advantage for a reason. Yeah. Yeah, this is not looking uh great for our hero Vomit over here. But I know, I care. Honestly. I definitely I wouldn't put it past him to make some uh, adjustments though. I mean, we just saw him like, was it a, was that a reverse trio? No, he took game one. Yeah, yeah. But he got a reverse. He got a reverse trio by like switching to different. Uh, ooh. Oh damn. That's unfortunate. Okay. Yeah. Vomit like you know not by any means a one trick. So we could definitely see him like pull out something crazy game three. Nice. Oh, damn. Game Watch really has no lag. This character's I know. Viewlessly, I... I he, oh, nice. That was a nice connect. Viewlessly, Game Watch is still a great character. Mm-hmm. People, people thought that he fell off. I don't think so at all. That's no, he's not. He messed up. Like, as you see, like, in Japan tournaments, like, yeah. this, when the a good Game Watch comes out, they come out. And yeah. Win. It's literally like, insane. What, like, what's that one name? Meet... Meet... I don't remember. It's starts I, with an M. I, yeah, I know. I was trying to remember the name, too, but I can't... The names are so hard. Yeah, yeah. Me too. Oh yeah, down here on shield got a up beat. Okay, this might be. Oh, that focus was really very close. Oh, okay. Nice back dash. Normally you get hit by the multi. It's of a game and watch back here, oh, but damn. didn't didn't pull up now. Okay, Shotos, you have rage. You could definitely pull something out kind of crazy. Like even right now, an up tilt would totally take it. Like up tilt, sure you. No, run up forward tilt again. Vomit's definitely got to do some more like running up and shielding instead of just trying to run up and do a down tilt. Because Cream is just calling those out with forward tilts every time. Yeah. Unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. I forget that name, though. All right, y'all. Going to game three. We locked and loaded. Yeah. And let's see it, though. Oh, we went to Cinemore. We're going to Lila. Yeah. All right, you can okay. see Lila, you know, pretty sure the side blasts are actually very much in uh, Vomit's favor, considering, like, they're short. Game of Watch will die a lot earlier. More platforms to cover yourself when you're trying to land. Nice forward tilt. Uh, yeah, Game Watch also will probably die incredibly early to Infinite War. Yeah, every time. Yeah. Every time. yeah. And he saw that. He, so that was nice, Roland. This feels so rough to do with, though. Like, you're in disadvantage and you just die. Oh, damn. He's already 100%. Holy Literally. Shit. He's just like, how do you land against anything? I know. That's so unfortunate. That downer's landing hitbox causes a good tech chase every single time. I know. Oh, Two my frames God. of the dash attack. No, it's not. Okay, it doesn't hit that one. Oh, what the? I just, bro, <laughs> this that, I up here is that, so that, difficult that, to deal oh, with. That forward air, too. God. This... This is not looking great. Yeah, no, this is not looking good for uh, Vomit over here. But, oh, that up okay. oh, getting uh, kind of messed up by the platform. Landing hit of Game Watch back here also kind of messed up. Up smash not connecting forward tilt, oh, though. That forward tilt has been coming uh, coming in clutch with uh, for, for this entire set of the chair. Yeah. Man. That's a chair, right? Yeah, for yep. sure. Not it's, a key. It's the chair. Okay. Yep, that could there take it. Down that close. is going to take it. 75%. That's <laughs> definitely like the flip side of this matchup. Game of Watch. Get, oh my god. This Lila, though, it's like, it's so condensed. Right. You like, maybe on a different stage you wouldn't die there, but you just did there. Yeah. Yeah, baiting up the revenge. What do you do about that? I know, high key. percent from down here. That's, a, that's really funny. That landing kit, the landing kit of uh, oh Game of Watch Danner has been catching. Uh, no. I know it has. He's, he's been, like, I guess he hit it like every time this set. He's cooking. Oh, okay, yeah, that was a good, yeah, that was a good job. He switched. He catch out the roll. 
because I mean, you just don't have many options. Like, you neutral get up, you get hit. You jump, you get hit. You roll in, you get hit. Game and watch that legend is so insufferable. Oh, oh, that's not that? good. Down oh, smash it. Damn. It's so messed up. Yeah, it's not looking good. I think yeah, no, it's not looking I don't, I, I mean, oh. you never know. Down tilt, forward tilt. Okay. No forward tilt, no forward tilt. Forward tilt would have killed there, but I don't know if. Uh, Maybe he could clutch it up. Maybe you're right. He could the, the, change the character, switch the game. Yeah. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I don't even know what this oh, is. Oh, yeah, that, that, my that, 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 God. Here we go. go. Vomit, that was very that was yeah. very very huge for vomit. I know that was that was beautiful. Yeah, no. Now I mean you have revenge, you can just like try to press Yeah, good another revenge? Alright, okay, as nice, long as you nice. don't get grabbed, you get to keep all of that for free. So yeah. Ooh. Oh, getting let's... no running up and grabbing, okay. I know uh, you can't, he has the wave. You know you can... I'm pretty sure you also lose revenge if you take too much damage as well. Try to neutral get up or once didn't pan out. Yeah, you gotta jump there. Oh! Those oh, side so, are getting spot dodged every time. Know, That's so unfortunate. So close. And then he lost it already now. Oh, yeah, no, he lost it. You take too much damage, you lose that. Yeah, that makes sense. Though. Kareem rolling in a lot. Like I know, he's, he's, he's spotting everything well. Yeah. Nice neutral B. Just getting Kareem off of him. Oh, that forward there. Oh, nice oh, going nice, past nice. the ledge. Side B okay. in the corner, I definitely could see taking the game. Oh, nice. A side B here, a side B here, we'll take it. Now it's just a matter of how you're gonna land it. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, let's get it. Get it. Oh, ooh, this is so stressful. Hold on, yeah. Oh, hold on. No, you can't be getting hit by those backers. Okay, you're gonna need to go for like some some of those jump side Bs. Yeah, let's oh! take it. Oh, oh, I love shit. it, Sarah, dude. We're going to game for y'all. <laughs> The last so change funny. of the character just made sense. That jump side B, that, that's such an omnipresent. Like you jump, you jump at any time during that, you just get duffed by it, and then you die at seventy percent. Yeah, that was such a good clutch from uh, Vomit. Damn, here we go, y'all. This is not the end yeah. of Vomit's run. <laughs> Let's see it. Yeah, though. no, Vomit holding on. Bro, is staying in scenario. Yeah, no, I respect it. Um, yeah. All right, yeah. Let's see where we're going now next. Yeah. Okay. They're keeping the uh, center war game watch. Smash it. Smash it. Okay. I, I don't know. Incineroar definitely gets juggled a lot harder on here, but the small stages means you have to have to you have to deal with like Incineroar yeah. every single time. Like he's even close to you. You can't just dash back because there's not much space. Okay. Nice spot dodge. Yeah. All right, you got it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can do some solo comments in there. Uh, yeah. I mean, uh, vomit trying to you know. Give Kareem a lot of space. Like, you don't want to get hit by, like, some burst option there that you can't really react to. So, unfortunately, that doesn't mean you're going to end up cornering yourself a ton. Okay, yeah. Uh, up, forward tilt, at ledge, yeah. Um, yeah, tries to get up attack. Uh, bomb, Kareem doesn't punish it, yeah. Uh, dash back, forward tilt, going to take that, so. Get him off stage. Wow, these forward tilts are crazy. Oh, that's not good. You do not want to see that at all. You cannot be jumping into those uh, back airs from Kareem. You got to be going low. Nice nair, but unfortunately the uh, eye frames from Game & Watch of you just, you know, doing so much for him. I mean, yeah. The Incineroar pick has been exceptionally clutch. Yeah, but, I don't know, this is just like, now you're just starting to see like all of Incineroar's flaws at this point. Like, he's slow, his disadvantage is really bad. He just like, you can just kind of run away from him, use projectiles to wall him out. It's, yeah. Hmm. Nice spot dodge. Okay. okay, nice forward air. That's not gonna take it because never mind. Okay, yeah. Then again, going after yeah, it did. will. Yeah, he used. Yeah, he used his air dodge. There's nothing he could have done there, but. Uh, I'm glad rolling. that like it would have been sick, obviously, to see Kareem get the three zero. But I'm glad that like I like seeing things roll. Yeah. Oh, he's baiting out these rolls so hard from uh, Vomit, but uh, barely missing these punishes, yeah. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Kirk's starting to space out. Trying to do it, yeah. Tomahawk neutral be unfortunately not panning out. Um, Good parry. Nice get up, yeah, no, get up attack, uh, hitting out the bomb, so you can't, uh, you know, die to it. Oh, trying to call it a jump, unfortunately got hit by a down tilt, so, um, 
Yeah. Oh, read a Cream, roll. Yeah, Cream's just trying to go for a roll read, but it didn't pan out. Nice up tilt. You gotta have some awareness of just like knowing what move, what's one of your moves cover what space. Yeah, side B. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. And I mean, a side B at ledge right now could definitely. Oh, just take, oh yeah, no. I mean, a lot of things at ledge would definitely just take it down till now. Comet's oh, actually been doing really well. Oh yeah, I tried to pray. Yeah, I tried to uh, call out a jump out of the corner. Unfortunately, it was a little bit late in doing so. So. Jump, yeah, calling up the jump in the back end, that is not good. Vomit is potentially on his tournament stock at the uh, bar. Gonna have stadium. to really start putting in some protein here. That was here. Like a good Yo. forward tilt. Vom uh, I mean, uh, Kareem was really hungry to ha hit some oh, kind wait. of like Nair combo to try to get as much uh, damage as possible as soon as possible from uh, disadvantage. And uh, Vomit, you know, just so good at capitalizing that, on that. Nice grab. Oh, oh. Ooh. Forward air. Yeah, that's, this isn't... Man, those down oh. smashes are scary. For sure. You get hit by one of those, now you die. Nah, yeah. You gotta hold that. Oh, uh, he's trying to read a roll. This is oh, oh, you parry the back air and then you get hit by the multi hits. You hate seeing that. Too many ticks on it. Right. Vomit. Okay, no. Vomit tried to call that out when uh, Cream was nowhere near it. Oh, the chair. He goes for a deep read. Tries to go for a deep edge guard, but he doesn't pan out. Calling out the jump once again. Vomit. Nice. Oh. Doesn't bite with the ledge roll. He's got so much percent right now. He's got now. so much rage. Also true. Oh. Uh, tries to forward tilt. <laughs> oh, run up forward tilt. Tried to, tried to use the, uh, the game winner from before. Tries to catch some. Oh, wait, why is he shielding? Okay, yeah, stay at ledge. Oh, oh scrap it! No, it's not gonna kill. It's not gonna kill. Um, oh, landing kid doesn't. Oh my god, we're down to you! Yeah, Kareem. that's gonna be it for Kareem. And now Kareem has to go up against the second to last final boss. A three-one. Three-one. Yeah. Now we got Kareem against Lazy Zach. Kareem against Lazy Zach. Where's Zach? Oh, whoops. Oh, whoops. It is ten o'clock. It is 10 o'clock, right on the nose. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, you know, yeah. this set might take a long time. And if Lazy Zack wins it, we're going to be seeing potentially two sets of Sonic. At least two, maybe three. So we're going to have to hope that Lazy Zack speeds some stuff up. Losers finals. Huh? <laughs> What's up? That was a... Yeah. Good luck. That was Have a fun. hard set. Good luck, Zach. Let's hear it. Sonic, as we all know, a top one character, but as we also all know through uh, Game & Watch, is a top zero character. Definitely a very good character. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, you know, Kareem does not bode well against Sonic, but, you know, there might have been some... Oh, Banjo! Yo! Bro just switched to an objectively worse character, but... No! Maybe? Yes? No! Yes. You've never seen a Kareem Banjo like I have. No, have you seen my, have you seen my Mii Brawler against this it's Banjo? It's the dream, Maya. My, my, Mii, Bra my, my Mii Brawler play has seen that Banjo before. You wait. You wait. We'll have to see. Banjo, as we all know, is a terrible character with absolutely... Kareem's no out here. He's, he's trying to build an organization. Yeah, Cream Esports. I mean, I'm part of Cream Esports, right? Yeah, what are you talking about? You gotta be hyping up this banjo. Come the, on. The, the moment that I got signed to Cream Esports, I lost twice to Cream, so I don't know how that worked out for me. <laughs> Here we go. Bro this is, this is what I love watching about Banjo specifically. Oh his animations, his sound effects are really funny. I like them. Gah -huh. Gah -huh. A boo. That's one of my favorite amiibos that I have. I just uh, saw him moving on Sunday, right? Yeah. I packed up all my amiibos a couple days ago. Mm -hmm. I have so many of these things. Really? <laughs> and Banjo is one of my favorites. I keep him on my desk. Do you train them in Smash Brothers? Nah, I just collect them because I think they're cool. But one of these days, I might throw it on. I got a. Uh, you want on? Yeah. I got that. a Byleth amiibo named MK Leo. No, I don't have a Byleth. I got Byleth, Marth, and Roy for some reason. I don't know. I'm not even like a Fire Emblem fan, but I just saw them and I'm just like, Damn. I like Fire Emblem on the GBA. That's really good. I've never played a Fire Emblem game before. The GBA ones are legitimately great. That's cool. Hello. Hi, Maya. How are you doing? Wait, why, is this, why, why is there Banjo on my screen? There is Banjo on your screen because Kareem, uh, unfortunately, is really hates the game and watch Ban uh, Sonic. 
I just beat Drip a bunch with my Insin, but then we did an actual set and I lost. But it oh. was close, so. Unfortunate. Uh, I mean, Zach, like, not really adjusting to this banjo right now. He probably was like, expecting Game & Watch and seeing something different just kind of threw him off. Down throw, back throw. Yeah, I mean, Zach, what? I mean, down throw, up tilt, maybe. Down throw, up tilt, yeah, 100% yeah, kill. But Zach might mash out of it in time at 100. Hunt, mm. Maybe my mash just sucks. It does. <clears throat> Thanks. Love you, too. I mean, this is... I can't wait to get food after this... Where are you trying to go? After this tournament. I don't know. We are getting something, though. I don't, even, yeah, I don't no. care if it's fast food. We are getting food. Nice. Four tilt. Now, Banjo has to kill. But, guys, I just want to say shout-outs to Tac Tac. Shout-out to, uh, to, to Dravis. Davis, just yeah. shout-out to everyone working on this. This has been a, a really great experience. Like, 100 people here. Yeah, the, and the borough is such a cool place to get a venue at. Yeah. And, yeah, obviously, the bracket's been going pretty long, but it's... Yeah, like, long. I mean, a hundred entrants. Obviously, that's gonna. That's I mean, gonna... has this even been as long as like? Oh, that was like a really important. I mean, yeah. this has been managed so well. There's been no real issues, and I'm just, I'm glad there's yeah. that this has been able to come along as it has. Honestly, th this bracket has not even been that much longer than some advantage. And it's been a sick bracket too. Like in like pretty crazy ups. I mean, the bracket's been like eight hours. Yeah, I mean, I guess I don't know about. I mean, yeah, no, there are no PR players in attendance, but for the people that we already like know that are well established and like the unranked scene. This is crazy upsets. Yeah, there have been some upsets for sure. I, know, mean, I beat see, like, Sands, but yeah, we got to Sands see, like, was seated like 13th or something. That's crazy, and then, yeah, no, just going 0-2 when you're seated that high is just like you know. I mean, it kind it of was, hurts, it was but really, like, yeah, I, really nah, I lost my it. round one, and yeah. I mean, them going 0-2 losing to Milky and me is like just not. Yeah, it like, does not feel good. Yeah, it's just unfortunate that it had to be put in that place. Oh, Cream already on his last leg. That's crazy. I've never seen a banjo in my life, to be honest. Good. Cream used to play. Used Cream actually did play banjo before. Um, I mean, he became like a game and watch man because um, but before he became, yeah, Banjo's got. I, I don't know. I I mean, I've seen Banjo. He's not the worst character. To watch. He's like bottom five and not. He is cool. not he's good. Boring. He's, I mean, he's bad. He's boring. He's just like he doesn't bad. have much going for him besides a, being Banjo. Like, when I see a Banjo win though, I pop off. I, I don't. I don't at all. Because there's none of them. It's like it's like watching Rosa except Rosa sucks. Rosa's so cool. I love Rosa. Rosa. You are out of your mind. What? Rosa, I hate Rosa. Why? Huh? No, I was watching it and I'm like, man, I hate Rosa. And then what, watched, what did she? What did Rosa do? Uh, lose to an Incineroar. That's true. <laughs> vomit clutch. Like, Ford, I don't know why vomit didn't go into game one against. Uh, yeah, game one against Kareem. I mean, game I, watch Incineroar. My Incin would win those. You're right. My Incin would win those. But oh, the Luth Carpool is gonna head out. I think. Damn, really. Okay. Yeah, Game & Watch. I pretty much expected that. Yeah. Does Sonic just screw up Game & Watch? Maybe. I think so. I think Game & Watch definitely loses the matchup. Yeah, I mean, yeah, everyone loses a matchup besides Roy, right, but... Is Sonic really the best character in the game? Yes. yes. Type your answers now. Low-key. Joker is kind of... Yeah, Joker's yeah, Joker's good, but two frame, two frame right now. Never mind. Sonic is kind of just better. Honestly, like I'd be fine if you say they're interchangeable, but Sonic is. Just I think better. it is interchangeable. But we all know Pika's not top three. Pikachu is a top five. Maybe not even top ten. Pikachu is absolutely top ten. But Game and Watch is also top ten. Game and Watch is top ten. Game and Watch is broken. I don't know what this character doesn't have. Uh, he has like six of the best of the, its respective moves in the game. Yeah, he has like the best, uh, the best up air. The, the best nair. The, the best, best nair, the best up air, the, the best, best down uh, smash, the best down up smash. smash, the best up beat. Not the best up. Is it the best, it's up, the best up smash? It has, it's like it's like 28 frames of yeah, no, maybe, 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 maybe. and just kills at like 40. I'm thinking, I, I thought there was someone that has best like a better up, up smash. Best up beat. What? Oh, my nigga went. <laughs> oh, unfortunate. We hate to see that, actually. You need to get some of those early kills against yeah. Sonic, especially when you're at a deficit, and now you're just going to have to deal with so many more neutral interactions. Top, top three neutral B. Or... Yeah, that's true. Neutral B is kind of broken. And I'll be best up B, obviously. Yeah, best up B. So, uh, like, good, good ass F tilt. Good F tilt, yeah. We're going to stick over like Good grab, really good grab. Mr. Game and Watch. Bad F tilt, dude. Uh, it's so, it's so fast. It's so strong, so yeah. Long. Like, 
Uh, neutral B in the F tilt is just insane. And then we also look, and then we look at Sonic, and it just has, he has the best side B in the game, and that's it. Best side B, best but down that's all he uh, needs. Best, di best side B, best down B. Not best down B. Who's down B better? There's someone who's is better, but I can't remember it right now. What is my board with Eco game? Out of your mind. No, one's no, 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 no. Spin charge, spin charge isn't the best down B. I know that there's a better one that I just can't no, think of. No, wrong. Yes, I, I guess not? switching Pokemon or switching to No. Which is weird if you count that. No. Who's this better? I gotta look at the roster gyro? to check that. No, not Gyro. Oh, gy Gyro, Gyro, you're Gyro. Out of, you're out of your mind. Gyro's to Gyro literally could, is literally half the character. No, Nair's half the character. Gyro and up air are split 25-25. No, Nair's not even his best move. Yeah, that's true. Side B is. True. Well, Gyro's his best move. Down tilt, 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 yeah, down tilt, I forgot about that. Down tilt's the best ground move in the game on Rob. It's the best, like, A move in the game. Yes. No. Yeah. I mean, there's game and watch in there. There's better A moves, but... Okay, this is... It's a, it literally has really a... Close. It's literally a contestant for the best move in the game, though. Rob down tilt. But what? Up B, game and watch up B is another... Monado. Eh. Joker gun is crap. Gun is... What situation is there that Gun isn't a good move? None. But Sonic been dead. Okay, this is. We should commentate. We should commentate this, but this um, you know. But yeah, it's no, Sonic Game and Watch. It, it is like, Sonic Game and Watch. It is two sleeper characters, but it's 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 oh, it's close. It's not too far. Because honestly, I, I honestly like. Sonic. I thought Zach might have was gonna beat the break. Nine. Dream, but this isn't too awful. I know that all they kind of. Yeah, that give them a slow so death. Dumb. I know that all day. I know that all day doesn't like lose to Kareem much at all. But then it's it's not fast. It's not fast but at all. Do. Nice forward smash. What? I said, but you do. I do. I got signed by Kareem East, so I have to throw. Yeah. It was almost too easy. Weird emoji. I hate. <laughs> I hate Sonic. If you want to counter pick Sonic, just go instant though. All right. All right. I love Sonic too. You love Sonic, Billbot? I, I please leave my city. Three, two, one, go. Roy cannot two frame with a Penny? With what? Forward smash? Yes. Yes. Roy can two frame with forward. What the yes. fuck? Who does that? I mean, it hits ledge, so it can two frame. Does it? Yes. Have you not seen Crom forward smash? I'm making this shit up. They're the same move. Making this shit up. Yeah. Don't Who's swear. forward smash is going to be swearing. Uh, Mario's. Mario's. Mario's can, uh... I don't care. Uh, Olimar? <laughs> no. Down smash. Down smash does. Down smash broke on Olimar. Actually, Olimar is just the best character in the game. That's but, true. Like, honestly, if you're an o 2 or play Olimar, you will win your tournament. That's true. Or Game & Watch. Or Game & Watch. Or Incineroar. Well, no, not Incineroar. Not Sonic, though. Sonic's hard. I want to learn Sonic. I hate losing. Yeah, and you'll still lose to my Incineroar. Forward air. No forward air. This is so... What it... Like, imagine... Like, no, imagine just like... This is so bad. There's no music. Oh, Nick. Oh, girl. I got it. Nice catch. Hmm. Poor Vegeta. Mike is not like me. No, but there's no nice music. Air. It's yeah. like Game and Watch music right now. It's like yeah. Oh my god, I hate these I'm sound effects so much. Game and Watch makes me so. No, I'm a, if I'm ever on stream, I'm counterpicking to environmental noises. The Game and Watch? No, no, no. From like the Pikmin soundtrack. Oh my lord. And it's gonna be the worst experience for anyone playing. We can do like some Nate. Oh, is this environmental music? No, this is like beeping. I don't know actually. I'm just losing my mind when it's silent. Or like very little money. <laughs> but none of them are using you. I don't know. You got it? Okay. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, no, uh, Zach kind of wanted Kareem dead there, but, uh, Kareem did not fight, and then got hit by homing attack bagger, which me personally, I would never take that level of disrespect, but, you know, Kareem isn't me. 
Nice nair. Tries to go for some stupid side B, but it didn't work. Uh, full bias. Hey, game and watch. hey guys, if you're in Minnesota, go to Invergrove Fights tomorrow. Yeah, I'm trying to pull up. Me too. There's no one going, and okay. that I've asked. And yeah, I want people. To All right. Anyways, we should do uh, try to do some more involved commentary on this. Very engaging set. Oh. Very engaging. Yeah. Okay. Well, Kareem can definitely take a stock here. Yeah. No. You can like you got to forward tilt that ledge. You got to up smash. You got to something. Down smash. No. Jab. One. Jab. Oh, jab. actually can combo. Yeah. That's not even like a mix up. It's just like a thing. Oh. Damn. That forward again is so hard to deal with on shield. Honestly, nice up smash. Yeah. A uh, game of uh, Sonic's Sonic up air. Is so dumb. Sonic. Yeah. No. Sonic's up air. Um. It auto cancels the frame after it's the hitbox is done. So it up just never air? has landing. What up air? Yeah, you know, like you do up air and then it just has no landing. Yeah, like after. Up air is yeah. Um, so like. And on, and Sonic's up smash. If you have any damage on your kill, it'll automatically shield both. Yeah. And it has iframes at the beginning, so yeah, you can like, try to shield grab, but then it's just like. You can jump kills. cancel it too. Yeah. yeah I don't know. I no, I don't think you, I don't think it's that fast. You can do that with Lucas. But I don't know. I made that up. Yeah, it's source. I made oh, you, it up. yeah, you can jump cancel with Lucas in uh it, with the invincibility on his up smash, and it's dumb. All right, Jack. I'm gonna make some adjustments. Forwarder, that's gonna not take it. Oh, tried to go for something. A little, yeah, no, that's gonna be it. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Oh yeah, banjo. I forgot. Ban what? Oh damn, that's messed up. All right, I forgot. I forgot about that game one banjo. Yeah. Three zero for Lazy Zach. I, I think Kareem definitely could have recovered better there. Hold I think, up. I think he would have. I'm about to give Lazy Zach some of my expert coaching. I don't want to see him beat. You know, whatever. What's up, Daddy? Daddy and Lazy Zach Grand Finals. Uh, I think I predicted this. I think I said Daddy and one of the Sonics, but I don't remember. I, I think I joked about Drift doing it because Drift's a homie, but well, what my voice? But because Drift's a homie, but honestly, I mean, no one's surprised to see Daddy here, number one seed. Just want to stop your friendlies a couple days ago over my uh, end of bat. Just some good players. Dude. What? I mean, yeah. I, I gotta use the bathroom, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe you can do it. Sussy Sonic versus Super Dead. Go. I'm gonna try to do this with right. a wireless mic. Or a wireless mic. Yeah, you got it. Grand Finals! Grand Finals. <laughs> All right, Clank, here we go. Yep. All right, grand finals of the first Minnesota Barcadian. Dadzy versus Lazy Zach. Hopefully not the last. What a day, dude. Yeah, I mean, 100 entrants, like I said earlier, doubles, rock, paper, scissors, Mario Kart. And, I mean, the whole venue is amazing. we got axe throwing, go-karts, laser tag, like a whole arcade, two bars, food, like anything you could imagine. So it's been a great experience, and I hope we can have another one next year. Yeah, that is at the borough here in Oakdale, Minnesota. Shout outs to Zach of the borough for really just helping us out with the tech side and getting the projector and getting us out in the hall. And the whole staff has been just exceptionally friendly and really cool. Speaking of Zach, Lazy Zach here, the Sonic, he's only lost to Dadzy in this bracket in winners and winners finals. He's been on the run of his life today. He's been playing out of his mind just wholeheartedly speaking i saw what he did to vomit earlier it wasn't very pretty yeah like, lazy zach is such a good sonic player and their movement today has been impeccable yeah it's been kind it's been really good but dadsy's also just been out of his mind Obviously, also true yeah beating in doubles in singles like yeah and dadsy just like, like i said earlier he just won to stop your friendlies a couple days ago over maya and the bat so he's, oh, he's on top of and he flap he's on top of his game right now so he's definitely poised to win the whole thing shout outs to all the pr ranked players here in the state who 
just were able to not only come to the event and have the Big Brother situation, but also be able to just support the community. Yeah. I super appreciate all the top players I mean, hanging out. I got my bestie Failbot over there. There's a yeah. Matt, Maya's in the bathroom. I mean, there was Loaf. We had Loaf. We had Casimir. So, like, Stealth Pilot. Stealth Pilot was here. Yup. Ventura. Like, mm -hmm. everyone... Everyone's been here, and I'm is the all-star cast. Just glad to see it, because this was a big, this was a definitely a big process to put together, and I'm glad that it came through, and it's it's coming to a close. But I think it was a great day. No, wholeheartedly agree. I left to lose at eight. Ooh, come here. Oh, I yeah, I took off at like 8:30 today, and we we've been at this stream for about nine hours and 45 minutes, give or take. Where are so. you from? Uh, West Virginia originally, but I live in Anoka currently. Anoka, okay. But I'm moving up to Brainerd tomorrow. Tomorrow, Brainerd? Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> that's great. That's a big day after this day. Oh, that's stock. Yep. Oh. That spring just getting that gimp there. Yeah, Lazy Zach's spring has just been yeah, Zach is brutal. Just so composed right now. Oh, nice. But it's another, it's an even game. Daddy's not even phased. They're, they are both just composed and like in their element. So. They're very, very focused. You guys can see that there in the bottom no left. No one is surprised to see him here. Lazy Zach's been doing great lately. Wins off Vivian, wins off Ventura. No, um, I don't know about Ventura. I know, I know it went on Vivian and just other players, but I mean, no Four one's surprised eggs. to see him, them here today. The forward smash too on Zach has been really clutch in a lot of moments. Okay. Oh, able to get the dancing blade. Basically, and Nair one F smash could take it here. Um, a lot of things. A lot of patience. That, yeah, Zach is still gonna just continue to play patient. <sighs> the link combos out of the the spin dash has been so cool to see today. Yeah, Sonic is broken. Lucina's up, uh, Lucina's up B is a really good combo breaker, really good out of shield option. It's so fast, and it's just, it, it kills too, so. Well, Tadzi on the defensive, able to get back to stage. Able to get right around that spring and not getting gimped in the process. Holding that, that smash, shield so long! That shield was almost gone, and that down smash was wondrous. Just realizing that, that oh, what an up smash. Yeah, that was kind of a not great up smash from Lazy Zack. I mean, it was definitely a kind of a panic option to try to read a neutral get up or it might even go over a get up attack and come and hit him when he gets back up. But uh, I think that Daddy was, yeah, I think Daddy saw that. Once you see Sonic do that, you have so much like time to react. And then Daddy just got up with an up smash and took that first game. All right, here we go, game two. Same stage, same track. Back to Smashville. KK cruising. At least it's not Game & Watch deep poops. <laughs> it's certainly not the greatest battle music, but you know. No. It's in the game, whatever. <laughs> At least it's chill. It's a, it's a nice and breezy 10, 20 p.m. I think maybe a little chill is what we need. Yeah. Everyone. If anything, at least it isn't the, the like, some of the longest days me and Ben had would go clear into, like, 3 in the morning. I remember one time, I think it was either, it was either Casimir and Loaf or it was Loaf and Lucky, and they just, full gambit, last stock every single time. <laughs> like, I got it. Yeah, just, a uh, tight. The clamp on the mic is a little weird. Okay. Here, Maya, could you take apart my setup when you have the time? Thank you. It's just a little off balance. I'm going to replace these for a desk mount, I think. Yeah. I have uh, arms and stuff over here, but... Yeah. All right, Maya, don't forget to give Dravis his dock back. Don't forget to give Dravis his dock back. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Lazy Zach taking the first stock here. I think, oh. I think everyone's here is a bit tired, as even the competitors. It took a while to get... Huh? Yeah, can you just ask them if we can pack up? Thank you. Everyone's tired here. We've been here a long day. I think Lazy Zach even mentioned that they were, like, really, really tired yeah. right before this. I've, yeah, no, I'm pretty exhausted, and I think Dadsy probably, too. There was, a, there was a lot of breaks between the sets, and especially when you're playing like Zach does, a lot of uh, patience. It's 
like being tired is difficult. Because it could, because Sonic, no matter how patient you have to be, it's still precise how you do it. Because one slip up could mean everything, and so being tired makes it a lot harder to be precise with those. Going for an insane air dodge read. Charging. Okay. That up tilt is terrible. What was that? What else you got here? Okay, Danza gets the forward throw. Oh, yeah. got him. In the left-hand right. side. Hey, yo, Quint, can I hop on screen? Yeah, you, you got it, Davis. Careful, that clamp has been kind of wonky. Oh, Thank you. Man. Me and Dravis and Grant? Heck yeah. All right, y'all. Y'all know I had to be back for grand finals. <laughs> we got Dude, Dazzy. We got. Uh, no matter Zach. what happens here, congratulations. Yeah, thank this you. This has been an awesome event. You know, I tried. This is a, a trial and error event today, but it was very fun. Yeah. A lot of upsets. It was very crazy. Oh snap! Yo, Lucina. Oh. Oh, here we go. It's kind of tied up now. Let's see. One to one on the stock. Sixty-seven percent on Lazy Zach. Bring it back. Let's Dazzy see. got full oh, health. Dazzy takes it. He gets oh. him. Not quite. No, no, no. He's, he's still alive. No, but backer. Dude. Da Dazzy has been looking so good this whole set. Couldn't agree more, man. Let's see. Let's see. He's going to finish it for sure. Oh, oh here we go. Dazzy blade. clocks it in. Here we go. Game two. Locking it in. We're heading to game three right now. I don't know the vibes, but man, Dazzy could be the Minnesota Arcadian champion today. Could be, could All right, be. Hey, yo, chat, let me know what, what y'all thinking today. Y'all think Lazy Zach can make the comeback? We're going to make it to game four, game five? Let's see. Uh, I, I would love to see a Okay, let's see, let's see what stage we're going to right now. What's isn't up? It, isn't an Arcadian just like the world's biggest mid-off at a tournament? If you ban all the good players, right? No, this gives you a chance. And then, no, 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 Maya, <laughs> next season, I'm sorry. You're going to see Dazzy on the PR. You think? I'm, I'm so serious. You're gonna see him on there. Not over me, but you know. Hey, he just might. If, if you're not serious in that, he's gonna take. He's gonna take them wins. He took it off you on Thursday. I heard. Ain't that bad? Damn. Y'all quiet right now. But come on. No, don't say that. <laughs> We're gonna yeah, talk shit on Twitter hush, later. Hush you know exactly what's gonna happen. Yes. That's so funny. Thank you. Thank you. That's yours. It's all good though. You know, like I said, you know, Dad, he's finally. He's clocking in. Let's see the vibes. But like I said, Lazy Zach, best Sonic in Minnesota, though. Oh, absolutely. Both phenomenal players right here. Let's see it. All right, y'all. Make some noise in the chat. Who y'all rocking with today? We rocking with Dazzy? We rocking with Lazy Zach? Lazy Zach. It's hard for me to choose, man. Uh, I, <laughs> They're both I, really I, good. I, you know, I really love Dazzy. He's, he's been phenomenal this whole this whole Arcadian. Okay. Here we go. Lazy Zach turning up with some nice. Connects. Oh, 60%. Look at this. Oh, no, I got this one. Okay. Dang, Dazzy connecting with everything. He's not dropping nothing. Oh, nice read. Okay. Okay, nice trade up next. Oh, hold up, hold up. That was me. Okay, it's all good. It's all good. We still alive. Dazzy did win the last two, right? Yep. Okay. <laughs> it's something weird goes on with my graphics and I second guess myself. So Lazy Zach is is a oh, winner side, right? Yeah, he's winner side. Okay, this definitely could be a reset, and then we. That's what know. I'm saying. Dadzy could reset it yeah. right here. Okay, nice early. Oh, talks. okay, back to back. It gets the taunt. Okay. Sonic speed. A little toxic. I like it though. Let's get it. <laughs> okay. Oh, didn't damn. quite time the, the was, counter. Right? I was feeling that. I was like, man, he's coming crazy. <laughs> Oh. oh my god. The combos on Lazy Zack today have just been so cool. I know. He does a lot of crazy stuff. Meanwhile, Dadzy's got the precision. Oh, here we go. That was nice. Forward airs. Oh my god. A shield. There we go. Good up Still alive, though. Oh, nice, nice. He tried it. Watch the right hook. Okay. Ooh. Here we go. On the right hand. Oh, drops my, the spring. I, oh, that's just, stuck. Oh my God, just he's barely. down. Lazy Zach got a bit of a lead here. Oh, here we go. But one clean hit here. Look, he's gonna need one more, one more connect, and it's done. 
There we go. He gets the up air. Just reposition a little bit. Yeah. He, man, Dazzy's neutral game is so good, though. Oh, here we go. Oh, he gets in. Forward air chase down. Didn't quite get the grab. A weird angle on the platform. No, it was. It's a small battlefield, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there we go. He cleaned it up. Nice. Let's see. Last stock here. Okay. In game three. Dadsy looking for that reset tonight. There we go. Lazy Zach really holding this left hand side. He tried the nice back here. Oh, snap. There we go. Nice shield. Oh, the okay. dash. Come on, Dazzy. Let's clutch it up. Digging the soundtrack for this. Yeah. Ooh, oh, he, he tried, held he tried it. it. He tried it. He tried oh, it. Okay. He held it okay. so hard. That would have killed so fast. I see. Okay. He didn't try to back here. Let's see. I knew it. Whoa. Okay. He can clutch it up. He Gets can reset launch. this, I believe. Let's see. It. This is okay, where Dad connect, connect, connect. is so close. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, I don't understand how I feel right now. I'm a little intense right now. Let's see it. <laughs> this could be the last couple of seconds of this, ge this game, game three. He tried it. Okay. Looking for it. He tried oh, it. Oh, the defense right oh. now on Dadzy. Dadzy wants it to go to reset. He's looking. No, but Lazy Zach. Oh, oh Zach gets him. him. Woo. So, damn. Point on the board for Lazy Zach. Yeah, yeah. Here we go, game four. Wait, he no, Lazy Zach was in winners. What? Is he? Let's check. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Sorry, Chad. We're gonna change it right now. Little mistake. It's all good. I'm doing this from a distance. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Dadsley would have won it had he won there. Yep. <laughs> we, That's we, even we, more we stressful. Are still one game away from an Arcadian champion. Let's see it though. Coming back. Ooh, they got the Guile's theme. Okay, I like this. Mm. Good vibes, good vibes. Or no, this is Ryu's, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's Ryu's. Okay, some Street Fighter vibes. He's cooking. Okay. Oh man, I forget. I forget. It's still like an actual projectile. I, I play Mega Man. Spring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come, I play Mega Man. So like when you do a beat, it does not look like that. No, but you get the, you got that dog in him. <laughs> yeah, he got, the, he got the dog for real. Okay. Oh, way down go, low. Oh, okay. Connect still off stage. Clashes with that. Oh damn! Oh damn! Still building up some damage. Oh fudge. Man, the spring is just brutal on Lucina. Yeah, off stage, you don't want to get off though. Let's see. But Lady Zach wants to wants to definitely go to game five with, with uh, Dazzy though. But I hope Dazzy does not allow it though. Okay. Okay, connect. Oh. Okay, there you go. Connects. This is where this match gets really interesting. Is when they're right next to each other. Okay. This is still an even set, no matter what the percentage. Back throw. Yeah, nice. Man, grand finals, <laughs> baby. This is insane. Oh, there we go. Dazzy connects it. Here we go. What Take that a catch. Him. Absolutely awesome. He's waiting. He tried it, though. I like it. Oh. Gets, he's cooking, gets a couple he's extra cooking. credit. Okay. What is he cooking? Okay. He's got the soup. Oh boy. No, sir. Nice, nice. All oh, this is. Oh. I dig the nice, hit and nice, run. Nice, nice exchange. Okay, nice another exchange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he just waits. <laughs> oh, no. that, just, just like how calm it was at that moment. I didn't even know what to expect, but damn. Wow. Okay. Dang, that's he might Dazzy be. holding on oh. really tight right now. He's not allowing it. He said no. 
even if he doesn't get the stock here, this is a really good box. Yep. Oh my god. 160%. Counter? Oh! oh shit, he gets the up smash! Get the next stock. Yo! Is it... This is... Dazzy keeps cooking. Oh, oh, if, yo, Dazzy might take it. He's in such a good position. All I know is this Dazzy is looking like your Minnesota Arcadian champion. But we'll see the vibe. 191%. Potentially. If this is a three stock, I'm running out the room. <laughs> Don't knock over anything. It's I, I'm expensive. going crazy. <laughs> oh, snap. 200%. He's still in it. He's still in it to win it. He's still looking clean. He waits. He's still got the rage. He's still got the vibe. He's feeling himself. There we go. Oh, connect. Oh, oh connect. Oh, oh. Grab. Here we go. Down throw. Okay. 69%. Shit. Oh, 82%. He's in the matrix. 94. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe it. If he's three stocks, I'm, I'm literally running out this joint. Take your headphones off. <laughs> That's it! Oh, oh, it. Oh, can he Let's Yo! Go! Let's go! Let's go! Oh, my God. There you have it! The Arcadian is over! <laughs> Go! Wow. That know. was crazy. <laughs> and the mic still works, thank goodness. <laughs> well done all around, guys. Super, super fun day. Congrats! Well done, well done. As for us here at Forever Classic Games, thank you so much for hanging out with us. You got any final words there, Wilhelm? Speak into this one. Oh, yeah, sorry. That pop-up was crazy. Um... The mic did collapse. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know what to say. We'll, we'll, we'll rewatch this VOD later. Uh, but oh, for sure. Crazy set from both these players. Phenomenal people. Um, but as y'all saw, Lazy Zach um, tried his best until the very end. I thought we were going to go to game five, but uh, Daddy did not allow that and finished it off with a three stock. So I just want to say shout out to everybody today. Yep. Uh, thanks to uh, Arca Covenant for letting us, you know, having the uh, our, the borough. Shout out to Forever Classic Games, AC McCumbers. Appreciate you. Absolutely. Appreciate anybody that helped out today with any of the brackets or anything like that. Setups, um, whatever you did to be a part of this community, like you are seen and appreciated, and we absolutely had a great time. Uh, just real quick, if y'all didn't hear in the chat before, um, we, I will be running a, a bi weekly in November, and there is a multi coming, a new name, but uh, we'll be okay. back. Um, I'm really excited to see everybody today that came uh, and like I said, uh, if you have pictures posted tag me. Let's get it going. Yep. Um, but yeah That Craig was Vistado. that was super cool. Yeah Really good, good time, job, bro yeah, Thanks you know. for having me. Yeah Well, we'll this will be on YouTube later So we'll yes, yeah. we appreciate everybody sharing that around and <laughs> it'll be a lot of fun It'd be a good time. I, I do not look forward to seeing how much your audio spiked there at the end <laughs> <laughs> That will be an editing oh nightmare. God. I need to remember to, to keep my volume low whenever that comes through. <laughs> I know. I can't, sorry. I had to. He, he just. It was fun. It was fun. First Arcadian champion, and now Dad's is banned. <laughs> oh. for, for, for being, and, he can't uh, play in it anymore. He can't play another part, uh, um, Arcadian, but I, all I got to say is this upcoming season, Dad's will be on PR. Period. Okay. We'll see. We'll no see. Lie. Yeah. I, I believe it. I would like it's to phenomenal. see Stealth Pilot go up a couple notches, person. Yeah, I do too. It's been a while. You know, like seeing all the top players today is phenomenal to see them. But yes. obviously, we'll bring out more people. I do hope to see Steven Shark more this season too. I try to do my best to bring them out too. Yeah, and yeah. Phenomenal players we got going. Thor, on. thanks for hanging out in the chat. Everybody in the chat, Vivian, I saw you too. Really appreciate y'all hanging out and watching with us. Yeah. But that's it, man. Here we go. Let's hit the credits and uh, pack up. Yes. <laughs> we'll right, we'll see y'all next time. Thank you. Appreciate you a lot.